hacker welcome in thank you for the follow plus one everybody dude a follow right at the start of screw stream hmm. hi weenie aunt jr hi kim <laughs> welcome to weenie aunt jr <laughs> I feel I really hope we can beat the game today. I really hope so. Cause we'll recap once I turn cam on. But I think we're very close. Someone gifted a sub to me? That means Ryan, you get to use exclusive subscriber-only emotes in my chat room. You also get ad-free viewing. If you click the emote menu, you'll see all these new emotes that you have. Smile. But congrats, you are one of the lucky few who got a gifted. But have fun, man. Um, everybody who else is a sub, put your favorite emote of mine in the chat. My favorite is... Ooh, I'm torn. I think... I have top three. I have top three. Pisa, all these three are pretty solid. No, you can't just put every single emote. That's cheating. How about top two? Top two. PSI 27 is pretty solid. I think if I were to remake PSI 27, I'd have it me wearing like a lighter shirt. Cause it... Okay. Who uses Twitch on light mode? I don't think many people do. Why is PSI 2 L your favorite? That's kind of mean. <laughs> it's kind of rude, not gonna lie. I think my most, my, my best emote standalone is Peace I Do Punch. Just the motion, the foreshadowing. Insane. I'm a bully. Should we ban bullies from the chat room? <laughs> hmm. Peace I Do. Hmm. Yes? Okay. <laughs> Mud? Time came out for. Two seconds. Nah. The only time that Kim has acted out of line is when she called my sister hot, and that was weird. Otherwise, she's cool. <laughs> then everyone is gone. I guess, I guess. <laughs> nice knowing y'all. Yeah, PSI 27, RIP Kim. First, you got laid off, and then you failed your job of being in the Twitch chat. Am I the new Chris? <laughs> I mean, we don't know yet. I think Crystal and Deacon are my two most DJ chatters. Guys, one minute to go, then face cam turns on. If we hit 5 million subs, I'll turn face cam on right now. Ooh, guys, I have such a good bit planned for April Fools, you don't even know. You don't even know. I will be streaming on Saturday, probably, for April Fools. You're so funny. Y you need to put a slash J or a slash S or S. Cause I don't know if that's joking or not. <laughs> Guys, 20 seconds. For the longest- wait. Wait, isn't slash S sarcastic? Wait, oh no. <laughs> Wait, I need to Google slash s meaning. No, it means sarcastic. Oh, come on. 
Yeah, that's what I thought too. I thought slash S was serious, but it's not. I'm done for. Yeah, you are. Hello. Why did I wave? That's so weird. Um, good morning, good afternoon. Hope everyone is doing well today. We had Kim, Ryan, and Hacker in the just starting soon screen. Thank you for chatting. We also got one follow in the starting soon screen. Ain't no way. How? For real on my mom. <laughs> uh, but welcome in everybody today. I am hopefully going to beat Omori. After what? I think we started this in very beginning of January. So hopefully we beat this today. If you need to catch up on any of the previous streams or the lore, I have a playlist pinned at the top of the chat. All previous VODs are on my YouTube channel. It says it takes this game about 20 hours to beat the main story. I am around 16 hours in. So I'm right on track for once. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. I started a little bit early. It's 10.55. Because I want to get this done. And I owe chat a subscriber-only stream because we hit our sub goal yesterday. And then I was too tired. And then I slept the rest of the day. So, if we get Omori done relatively quickly, like within 4 or 5 hours, then we'll do a sub-only start. Dude. To make up for yesterday, because I don't scam. I never scam. Imagine taking three months to beat the game. How many hours do you have in Splatoon? Huh? And you haven't beaten the game yet? <laughs> For context, I posted a clip a few weeks ago now, I think, and it was talking about like how many hours you play in game. And it was Hacker, because I clipped their chat message, and I think Hacker said, I have like 500 hours in Splatoon. And then that clip popped off. It's at like 6,000 views on TikTok, which did really well. It did pretty well on YouTube Shorts, too. See, like, hackers not chatting because they're... They got roasted so hard. Okay, let's get started, everybody. We love video games. Okay, so last week... Wait, I need to... I forgot to... My viewfinder's on. Actually, you cannot beat the game. Isn't there, like, a story mode? Oh, you did beat the story? Okay. Okay, dude. I always forget to hide the viewfinder because it blocks my POV. Yep. Oh, also, gentle reminder. It is March 29th, so you guys have exactly two days left to be eligible for a portrait sketch card. So if you want a cool little card like this drawn on stream, all you gotta do is gift five subs to the channel by Friday. Any Oilers? Right now we have four people eligible. So if you're eligible for a card this month, please send me a picture on Twitter. I need it by Saturday because I'm not going to do portrait cards on Saturday because it's April Fool's. Also, yesterday... <laughs> I ended stream and then I looked in the mirror and my arrows were like fucked up. Fricked up! God damn. No cursing stream when. Um, so like this eyebrow was like crazy. Cause I don't do makeup. The most I'll do is I'll go like this just to make sure like the eyebrow hairs are flat. But yesterday this one was like wonky. This is why I don't like having an HD cam. Okay, so we're at two days left. Tw oh. 23 hours playtime. Well, I, I miscounted then. Okay, so last week we left off. I had received all the mandatory keys. Oh, I have 27k. Oh my god, I'm a... I'm not a brokey. I have a lot of life jam. I'm gonna buy 10. No, I'm buying 20. I'm buying 20 of these because these are adequate heart. I bought 19. Because I assume we're going into like a final fight. Okay. 
So last week we got every single required key. Wait. This is the wrong way. That's towards the castle. So now... Because there was a cutscene where it showed that Basil's house, like, crumbled. Hi, Goboba. Welcome in. Oh, I didn't. I thought I saved here, but I guess I didn't. It's Ike. It's Ike. Oh, god damn it. I am at a little grind bar XP, right? Beating the game today? Oh, oh, crossing my fingers, I do. I'm just gonna attack. Hi, Keelan. Yeah, imagine being 10 minutes late to stream. Disgraceful. Oh, easy. Dude, that was like a two-hit KO. Oh, I need to fully heal everybody. Everybody's like dead. I thought I healed. <laughs> I just really hope we get some closure finally. I'm still going with the theory that, like, I don't- okay, I don't think Amori killed Mari. I think Mari, like, unalived, probably. Because, like, the, the hangman illusion is obviously very transparent, right? Oh my god, plus one follower! Thank you! Yeah, I did go live, like, 15 minutes early today. Oopsie! That's why I gotta be in offline chat, like, an hour before I go live. Easy. I'm gonna buy as many upgrades as I can, just to be safe. Dirty heart, 25 juice. Okay, these are kinda ass. Oh, it's only 10 coins, so that's not bad. Kianes. <laughs> flowers this morning and they're already dead basil <clears throat> these are sunflowers they're called that because they always face towards the sun that's how i want to be like someone who always sees the bright side of things let's water them now just to be safe oh they're not coming back to life R.I.P. Flowers. Peace I-27. These flowers are called Lily of the Valley. It's said that they're able to ward off evil spirits and help people see a brighter future. I guess that's why they remind me of Mari. I can always count on her to help me stay positive. Roses come in many different colors and have their own unique meanings. Pink roses symbolize admiration, orange roses symbolize passion, yellow roses symbolize friendship, and the list goes on. Hero doesn't remind me of any rose in particular. I think Hero's like all roses, because he's versatile and universally loved. Damn, he's a simp. These are a type of flower called the gladiolus also known as the sword flower. As you might guess, they represent strength of character. Someone who is honest, with strong moral values, 
Someone who stands by their convictions. Me. I'm consistent. The, ga the gladiolus reminds me of Aubrey, because she's always true to herself. Cacti are very sturdy and resilient plants by nature. They don't need much care and can survive even in seemingly impossible conditions. I guess what I'm saying is that you could even take care of a cactus, Kel. Everybody's always shitting on Kel. I don't think he deserves it. Kel seems like the nicest one of it out of everybody. And these... These are white tulips. Tulips aren't very flashy plants. They're not too big or too small. Not too elaborate or flamboyant. If I could put it in another way, I guess I would say that they're comfortable. Simple, modest, and perfect. Just like Sunny. Why is he calling me perfect? That's weird. I think when you call somebody perfect, or like a goddess, it's too much almost. It's like, why are you idolizing me so much? I'm not perfect. Or when like, somebody calls you like the best person in the world, or the most prettiest person in the world. Dude, you're gaslighting me. This trail seems longer than I remember. Wait, gradually more trees are dying, right? Yeah, look, the forest is full here. But more trees are dead. Uh-oh, is that paint I see? Looks fresh. Yeah, weren't all the trees alive last time we were here? I don't think the water's supposed to be red. Amori! I'm scared. Let's... Let's go back. Oh my god, hi, Kimari. Can we get some peace I to yo's? Hello. There's no turning back now. Wait, I didn't see it! Something flashed on the screen. I missed it. Small plants. They look a little sad. It's a long way down. Do you want to jump? Yes, sir. Wait, are we going to go to the surface? That's what happened last time. We're in the water again. <laughs> Let's all jump together! Yeah, where are my friends? They left me. Chaos. I can't click on it. I can't run, either. Wait, 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 Oh, I can't look at my keyboard, because didn't the keyboard say welcome to the dark space? 
Because we've always been in the light space. Dude, the color shift when there's a lot of gray on screen is scary. It's like those optical illusions where it makes the lines look like they're moving, but they're not. It's only how they're shaded. Wait, I want to go back. Because it seems like if this is similar to the light space, it seems like an infinite loop, right? And there was another spider web over here. Oh. Yeah, it's just a loop. Oh my god. Did I get did I get possessed? Oh no. Oh, it's a stage. A white agrate orchid. In the language of flowers it symbolizes the phrase, my thoughts will follow you into your dreams. Oh, was this the door to the dark space? A black door casts a heavy shadow. What would you like to do? Hello, welcome to chat. Welcome in. Can we get some peace I to yo's? If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. Hello. Okay, we're gonna open the door. Welcome to Black Space. Is this like the ghost levels in Mario, where you have to go through every single goddamn door to find the prop or the to find the solution? What's my theory so far? My initial theory was that Basil manipulated Sunny IRL and then convinced Sunny to kill Mari because it seems like Basil idolizes Sunny, but I I think Mari unalived herself because like the obvious illusion, explicit illusion with the hangman illustration. I don't know. If you've played this game, everybody, no spoilers. The music is making you uncomfortable? <laughs> Good. A megaphone streamer for a second. I have an email. The soundtrack in this game is A1. Steak sauce? such a stupid joke. <laughs> I just know how she unalived. Yeah, it's obvious that she unalived herself. There was like that one scene where there was like a piano and then a giant mirror. I think she jumped from the window. No spoilers. We're, I'm in- it's a game theory. It's a theory- a game theory. I'm, I'm thinking out loud. Okay, well- oh, I hate these little eye things. Oh, are they like actual- I can't like run into them. A tissue box for wiping your sorrows away. My movement is different. 
I kind of like when I stop, I kind of slide a little bit. It's weird. It's kind of like Mario. Mario's picnic basket. Would you like to save? Yes. Okay, still two days left. Oh, it opened, okay. Stranger. These rooms are full of broken things. But at least in here, I can see who you really are. The world that you created above this one? Did you make it to perfect or to protect this place? Or to hide it away? Either way, it's become more powerful than you. We have blue paint now. I think this place is a lot more interesting, honestly. Hey, it's our friend. Because the world above was way too happy. Yeah, how do I get out? <laughs> Shit. Yeah, the door was over here? No. That was an accident. Oh. Okay. Well, the door's gone now. Okay, it, it, it acts like the blank or the white space where it loops. Okay. So I guess I just gotta go in every door. 100% completionist run, everybody. Mods change the title. <laughs> oh, trigger warning this game has flashing lights. I assume this is the section where we're gonna see some flashing lights, everybody. I think the music sounds a little bit like Mary Had a Little Lamb, but slightly, like, not the right tune. Oh, <laughs> my great- So sometimes with this new capture card, it, the screen will go black on my TV, but it'll still stay on stream. My screen just went black. And it's not intentional. Ooh, there's something under the bed. Ooh, more paint! Oh, that's the cat from earlier. Or no, the bee. Wait, what? I got you baited. The trail ends here. Speed running? That's just black paint, everybody. It looks like me using paint 20 years ago. Oh my god, in like junior high when we had computer class, I would make these weird abstract drawings in paint. I would show you guys, because I saved them on like a little USB drive along with my student account on the computer. I, I just made like, because you know how in paint they have like the pre-rendered circles and rectangles? I would just make patterns. You know who else can make patterns? You can make chatters, patterns in the chat room with your emotes if you follow the channel. Because we are 30 minutes into stream, so if you're near here, click the follow button. We already got two follows today. Pog you. Can we hit our follower goal? And if you're already following, make sure you have notifications turned on. That way you don't miss a single stream.
Um, you just gotta go to your notification settings on each device. So, like, you have to change notification settings on Twitch Mobile and Twitch Desktop. Lost in this confusion lies the root of everything. The truth that you've locked away, you must find it no matter what. You have to. For the both of us. Okay, dude. How do I get out now? Just, just take me back, take me back. Ooh, I have my journal now. There's gotta be new pictures. Your sketchbook. Take a look inside. Yes, sir. Did Mari die in the bathtub? Like 13 the reasons why. Oh, wait, these are new. I think the person, the drawing at the end of the hopscotch? I think that's Hero's character. That's me holding hands with Basil! Oh, it's all the photographs on the ground. Let's keep going. Oh, the, the mo you can't see anything when everything is black and white and you're moving. Scribble. Are you lost? Not to worry. The red hands know the way back. I figured that out already. Because I have a very big brain. I feel like my eyes are going to be twitching after this. A key. Where's Basil? Or the stranger, rather. There was no stranger here. Back to reality. That's the only line I know from that song. <laughs> I've only li recently started listening to Eminem, like, as of, like, three years ago. I didn't listen to any of his older shit. I'm a fake fan. It's a friend. When you hid the truth, you sealed a part of me away with it. He's been waiting for someone to save him all this time. On that day, when you became nothing, I was split in half. Which me do you think was more painful? How much is this sub again? Free with Prime! Or five dollars. You can also subscribe on TV now. Like it because they added a subscription button for Twitch on the TV and it pulls up a QR code that opens a link. It's cool. Now get me out of here. 
Where's the little hand, guys? Oh, and it, oh, there's more blood here. Oh, it's just a loop. Okay. Yep. Oh, my computer's back. Can I use it? Nothing but static. Dad unplugged the router again. Why is it moaning? Ew. I'm stopping. <laughs> Liar. I would never lie. Liar. Someone's being defamatory right now. Liar. Have you guys ever lied? Type 1. <laughs> liar, liar, liar. Oh, it's a head. No, you guys are lying. You've never lied. JK, I have a job. Imagine Kim is just RPing as a, <laughs> a laid off employee. That'd be so stupid. That'd be such a stupid bit. Oh my god. <laughs> liar, liar, liar. Why is there no paint here? <laughs> liar, liar, liar. I'm not saying anymore. I won't stand for such slander. Ooh, it's our best friend. Liar, 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 liar. Something. Sunny. I love you. Liar, 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 liar. Oh, oh. What? Oh, he's part of my party now. Sunny. I love you. I think he's lying. He's he's scaring me. Somebody who loves you doesn't scare you. Sunny, I love you. I don't like you, man. Sunny, I love you. I don't, I don't. Take me away from this creepy man. What was the last lie you told? Ooh. See, that would have been a great question for yesterday. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know, actually. Oh, I lied to my sister when I went grocery shopping because I was like, I, I went over budget. And then, because I went over budget like $70 because I we went to the Asian Mart. Now, my budget was 100 but I spent 170 And she was like, how much over budget did you go? And I was like, eh, like 50 bucks. But I went over 70 not 50 So I think that's the, the smallest little lie I've told recently. Otherwise, I'm very honest. Also very blunt. Which is to a fault sometimes. Okay, next room. Guys, clip it and send it to her sister right now. No, she doesn't even have a Twitch. You'll never find her. Ooh! 
Back to reality. Miwo stares at you. She does not know what is happening. Do you want to cut open Miwo? No! My future cat would not want to see this clip. Butler. Miwo has been very, very bad. You got a key. How do I get out? I can't get out. Miwa has been very, very bad. Miwo stares at you. She does not know what is happening. Okay, there's nothing else I can do. I clicked everything. R.I.P. Miwo stares at you. She tilts her head out of curiosity. I'm clicking no. It seems like we're in an elevator. Okay, nothing changed. I'm doing it. Miwa stares at you. Her eyes widen. She wants to go now. No, I'm, I'm letting you go. I'm letting you go. Run away. Just run away. Stupid cat. Just run away. Okay, nothing's different. Miwo stares at you, her eyes widen. She wants to go now. Do you want to cut open? Yes! Oh my god, stop! Miwo stares at you. She struggles to break free. Do you want to cut open Miwo? No! I'm gonna keep saying no. Just let me leave. Just open the door. Me and the cat can leave. I'll adopt it. Oh my god, hi, Chip. Can we get some yo's? Miwo stares at you. Her eyes are filled with desperation. Do you want to cut open Miwo? Holy moly! Thank you for a gifted sub! Thank you! Thank you, Kim! Two gifted to the channel! Let's freaking go! Thank you. <laughs> Can we get some wimps in the chat? <laughs> Thank you, Kim! <laughs> that is your um, that's your first gifted for the month so enjoy those bonus channel points yeah can I get some more wins um you will get your name written at the end of stream thank you Kim <laughs> oh my god <laughs> peace is about to cut open a kitty no oh my god stop just stop stalling just do it Miwo stares at you. She tries to scream, but there is no sound. Do you want to cut open Miwo? Yes. Miwo stares at you. She does not know what is happening. Do you want to cut open Miwo? Yes. You cut open Miwo. Waiting for something to happen. I still can't leave. Am I DUM? I think I'm DUM. <laughs> I can't do anything. Another gifted Kim, you're unemployed. Stop. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for another gifted Kim. Then what's a chip? 
Enjoy the emotes. Doing this on mobile? Kim, do not give them mobile. It literally charges you a dollar more. Do it on desktop. Please. But thank you, Kim. Can we get some more wimps in chat? Is it a soft lock? I don't know. Oh, oh, okay. If you want a way out, there always is one, but... Is, am I gonna have to stab myself again? Do I take the knife? Okay, I think I just have to wait for the butler to keep saying more dialogue. Oh. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I sounded so excited. <laughs> okay, so if there's no exit, I can just stab. Did you cut open the kitty for no reason? Well, you know, it's the cat or me. And I chose both. <gasps> it's Basil's flower crown. You got a flower crown. Oh, no loot? Justice for me, whoa? No, guys, I had to do it. Another one? Oh my god, I went to Tina! Thank you, Kim, for another gifted! Are you trying to get a sketch card? Hmm, but thank you, Kim. Can we get some more wimps in chat? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Kim. <laughs> yeah, lol. Okay, go for it. Can us. <clears throat> Kim, you're meant to be unemployed. <laughs> okay. Oh, Mori! You came back for me! Is that my flower crown? I'm so glad you found it. How oh, cute. Let's get out of here. I'll follow your lead. Plus one, everybody. Growing watermelons has been fun, but I really miss my flowers back at home. How are they doing? Did you take care of them while I was gone? <laughs> Another? Wait, Keelan gifted, huh? Thank you, Keelan. Can we get some wheelers? Thank you! And it went to Enzi. Cool! Enjoy the emotes, man. Have fun! Thank you, Keelan! Wait, Chatters, pause, champ. If we have one more person subscribe with Prime, gift a sub, or share bits, we will have a hype train. Someone besides Keelan or Kim. Any gifters want to start a hype train? Thank you! Keelan, you also will get your name written at the end of the stream. Thank you. <clears throat> Watermelons sure are delicious. We used to cut them up and eat them all the time at the beach. I can still see Cal with those watermelon seeds all over his face. <laughs> Summer vacation with friends was the best, wasn't it? I think watermelons are my favorite too. Love me a juicy fruit. Oh, why is it getting darker? Oh, no. Ooh. So many watermelons. Oh my god, hi, Chris. Can we get some yo's? Hello. You got a key. I 
I like this. It's getting creepy. I love creepy shit. I want to see if there's anything new in my sketchbook. Nothing new. I think it's interesting because I'm going through the doors and like counterclockwise. Unconventional. Chaos. Oh. Guess I don't want to remember the pictures. Bubble for a gifted sub. Thank you. <clears throat> and you broke our daily sub goal. Thank you. Wait, Buzz. Everybody hold the phone. And what's the time? Yeah, can we get some wool bobos in the chat room? Everybody pause. Right now. It is a rare occurrence. Kim, Kobobo, and Keelan have triggered a hop train. So if you're new to Twitch hype trains, you'll see it in the banner in the chat. Basically, if you gift a sub, subscribe, sub with Prime, or it's your bits right now, you have a chance to earn Twitch exclusive emotes. Ain't that crazy? Ain't no way. Um, everybody, if you have hype emotes, put them in the chat. Which are your favorites? Those are my favorite. I like the hype high. That one's pretty good. But thank you guys. Well, Bubble, you will get your name written at the end of stream as usual. Thank you. I gifted a sub on accident, but it's worth it. When? Not on this channel, right? <laughs> what? Wait, I think... I think I did that shit too. Because I didn't understand how Twitch worked for like... A solid two months when I first started watching. Because I didn't sub, I just watched and I just sat through the ads. And who was it? Oh no, I accidentally... <laughs> I didn't accidentally gift, I accidentally g cheered too many bits in a channel one time. I think I cheered like 10,000 bits, but I only meant to cheer 100 and like miss Kip's chat. <laughs> so yeah. Oops, that was like a year and a half ago though. But thank you chatters. Can we get to level... Can we get to a level 100 hype train? <laughs> Who gifted Kobo? Resident Oiler. Okay, let's talk to the stranger. Guys, you have three minutes left on the hype train, so if you want a chance to get exclusive emotes, subscribe or cheer bits. I also have TTS enabled for bits. What's the highest level hype train? Well, it used to be five, right? But then they took away the level caps. So I think the highest I've had was like a five or a six. But hype trains are scaled differently on different channels. Um, I think the highest I've ever seen was like an Akai Senate stream or like Cutie Cinderella had a pretty decent hype train during the streamer awards. But I don't know what's the highest level. So they literally can go on forever. Okay, stranger. Our friends who have suffered because of us. Can we can we call them friends? No matter how much I want it, things can't go back to the way they were before. But why does that part of me still cling on? Is there still hope left for us, Sunny? No, there is no hope. No joy. Oh! Thank you for another gifted, Kobobo! Thank you! Wait, you've gifted 90 to the channel? You're insane. You're so close to 100. But thank you! And what's a clip club? They were in chat the other day. Thank you, Kobobo! Wait, Kobobo's our number one gifter for the month? Who gifted you this sub? 
Um, I think that was... Yeah, that was Kim who gifted you some chip. So you're forever in her debt. <laughs> but thank you, cool Bobo. <laughs> Sorry, the whip is really funny. Back to the dark space. That door wasn't- I'm not going in that door yet. I- I'm saving that for last. Not because I'm scared. Mind you. No, no. No way. Ain't no way. Ooh, this place is pretty. Oh. Did someone say TTS? Hey, okay, now one of the cause I'm nice PC to snicker, okay, but FR number one bits me. Thank you, Keelan, for 100 bits. Thank you. <laughs> The DTS is so stupid. Have you guys ever seen the streamers who have- oh, what's it called? I don't know what it's called, but you can like use celebrity voices in TTS. I'm debating if I want to enable it. I feel like it's only funny if people are in on the bit. So I'll, I'll think about enabling it, maybe in May. But thank you, Keelan. Yeah, you are the number one bit here, because we haven't had anybody do bits this month. But thank you, Keelan. Oh, thank goodness you're here, Mori. I thought I was gonna be stuck here forever. What if I just, you know, when I'm slicing the cobwebs, just slice Basil? Cause I think Basil's a bad guy. Oh, I was joking. Oh, what the fuck? Ten gifted? Well, I was trolling. I was trolling. But thank you! You should have a new badge in the chat, cause... I almost clicked ban. <laughs> oh my god, imagine. Wait, let's see who got it. Geo got it, Chris got it, Glaze got it, Vic got one, Deegan got one, Linda... Can we get some Wobobos in the chat? Holy moly! 56 subs? Guys, I'm rich. On her- on his rampage again? No, no, no. Wait, you mean me? I would never kill Basil. Now Kobobo is broke. I hope Kobobo like has a job. <laughs> but thank you! Thank you! We're at level 4, everybody. Can we get to level a million? But thank you. Seriously, thank you, Kobobo, for the 10 gifted. That's a lot of money. So, thank you. Thank you. Holy moly. Banning chatters? I would never do such a thing. Never. Never ever. But Kobobo, cool, we'll see if you have a new badge in chat. Because you can change your badges to show... I don't know which badge. Yeah, now you have a green gift badge. How many subs have I gifted in my channel? Oh, I can't see that. Damn. I've gifted over, over 100 in my channel, so, you know, we're at the same level. I think the, the green gift badge is a bigger flex, not gonna lie. But thank you. So, so I feel bad. Because, like, I don't want to, like... I don't want to farm too many donations, because you, you farm by, like, going crazy whenever you get a donation. But genuinely, thank you. That is a lot of money, so thank you. Birthday stream now has a bigger budget. Plus... 10 subs in revenue for me for a birthday stream. Now I can buy a nicer cake. I was debating if I wanted to buy like a custom one. Cause okay, I saw this one. Wait, can I show the TikTok? I'll show it later, but I saw a TikTok and a guy, he like sculpted a Pikachu cake and it was crazy. I was like, dude, I want that shit. But no, I can't do that. But thank you. Okay, sorry, I'm like embarrassed. 
I'm nervous. Nervous. Okay. Back to the game already. No more chilling. Phew! That feels so much better. I can't believe you came here to save me. I missed you so much. Now that you're here, I can finally go home. Lead the way, Amori. Maybe we have to kill Basil in game. You know, I think spiders are really misunderstood. They might look kind of scary, but they never attack humans unless they feel threatened. Not to mention they're also one of my biggest helpers when I'm gardening, since they eat a lot of the pests that can hurt my plants. You quit your job recently? That is okay. You know, that's what I did when I um, quit my job almost two years ago. Like, it was pushing my boundaries. I wasn't being paid enough. And as long as you have, like, enough money saved up to, like, fix that in between when you aren't working, then I think you're fine. Because there's so many jobs out there, right? And obviously some workplaces, the structure, like, allows you to be exploited. But if you can afford the time to find a workplace that appreciates you, one that has coworkers that will respect you, bosses and managers that will respect you, then, you know, go for it. Because... If you're looking for a career especially, that you're gonna stay with more like than two years, find a job that'll prioritize you. I've totally been there. Yeah, because you're unemployed. <laughs> Thank you, Kim, for two more gifted. Thank you. Wait, e Meg Esports is a sub? Holy. Yeah, can we get some wimps and shit? <laughs> yeah, man, you gifted to Meg Esports? I don't even watch. That's my alt channel. <laughs> Well, thank you, Kim! Thank you! So, I think, Kim, you're at... Yeah, you're at five subs. No more, Kim. You don't have a job. No more. So, Kim, you are eligible for a portrait sketch card. Oops. So, make sure you just send me a picture of yourself to my Twitter by Saturday, and I'll draw you. Smile. But thank you! Thank you. Guys, we're at level 5. That is insane. Crazy. Okay, back to the game. But thank you, Kim, for the two gifted. Six total in the channel. Wait, Kim, you're officially an oiler now. To me, oilers are not just the rich rich. You get five subs and you are called an oiler in my chat. Even if you're unemployed. Sorry, I need to stop with that bit. <laughs> Swag. But thank you. This hot train has been going on for like 10 minutes. Can we keep stalling? But genuinely, thank you, Kim. I hope you enjoy your sketch card. When I make it, of course. <clears throat> okay. Not to mention, there's also one of my biggest helpers when I'm gardening, since they eat a lot of the pests that can hurt my plants. It's all about the balance of nature. I remember a while back, he told me that a big spider fell on your shoulder, just as you were about to dive into the lake at our secret hangout spot. I know that the spider must have looked scary to you, but I promise that you probably looked a lot scarier to the spider. No offense, of course. <laughs> Ooh. I'm gonna go down. Oh no, there's spiders on Basil. That is not my nightmare. Because, like, my thing with bugs is, is if I can see it, it's fine. Like, if I'm not gardening and, like, a beetle crawls on my arm, I'm just like, okay, that's cool. But if I feel it, but I don't see it, that's when I freak out. There was one time... What was I doing? Yeah, go charge your phone, Chip. Come back later. <laughs> there was one time, like, I was weeding, I think, and there was, like, ten ants on my arm, and I didn't freak out. I was just like, okay. Oh, carpenter ants scare me. Because at my parents' house, there was, like, a boatload, and during, like, the warmer season, so during spring and summer, they would always get into the house somehow. Basically, every other night, I would feel like a carpenter ant in my bed sheets. It was gross. Ew. Okay. There's so many spiders here all of a sudden. You know what else may seem sudden? An ad, because I forgot to run an ad. 
Everybody, if you want to avoid that ad, all you gotta do is subscribe for $4.99, just $5, because we are past an hour into stream. I'm gonna get in trouble, it's past my ad break time. So, if you want to avoid that ad, all you gotta do is subscribe. You can sub for $5, or for free with a Twitch Prime. Click subscribe. See if you have a Prime sub available. After the ad, we will keep on playing. So if you don't want to miss a single second, subscribe. Easy. Okay, we do have a minute left on that hype train. But guys, no more gifted, please. No more. I only want Prime subs for the rest of the month. Rare gifter hacker? What the fuck? Huh? Hacker? Can we get some whack? Hacker's a rare gifter. Thank you, hacker! You're on the leaderboard for this month. Enjoy your bonus channel points. <laughs> Dude, it went to Peason's biggest fan. <laughs> of all the people, they give me their prime sub. Now they don't have a prime sub to give. Shit. <laughs> but thank you, hacker. Dude, so many Oilers today. Cool bubbles, stop! I am telling you, stop. Stop. Guys, we're- well, how many subs are we at? We can- we are not hitting 80 subs today. No, don't do this. Lomao. <laughs> you looking at your bake statements later today, Lomao. But thank you. Let's see who got them. Tanuki got one, Cass got one, Jade got one, Tiffany? You're real. But thank you for another five gifted, Kobo, but you are- you're at 24 for the month. You need to stop. You need to save it for yourself. Or the birthday stream. Pick one. But thank you! Guys, we're at level 6. I think this is the highest hype train we've ever had. But thank you! Thank you, everybody. Gee, uh, please don't... <laughs> I feel bad. Chatters, I feel bad. Oh, LOL. I feel bad. I feel bad. Okay. Let's go back to the game. No more farming. Oh! Ew! Why did I say ew? <laughs> Thank you for- Guys, I told you to stop. You guys never listen to me. Thank you for another five gifted, Keelan. Can we get some Whelans and chat? Oh my god. Let's see, Batty got one, Matt got one, Rocket got one, Retro Gamer, I think they recently followed. Holy moly. But thank you, Keelan! Wait, Keelan and Kobobo and Kim are getting their names in Rainbow today. Remind me. I will forget. Remind me later. But thank you, Keelan! Thank you. You guys are crazy. But, it, like, in a good way. In a nice way. Okay, I, didn't, I said I was gonna text my friend, but then I didn't, so I have to text them back. Cause like, you know how in Messenger you can have read receipts on, and then they can see when you're active? I had my phone open for like two minutes. Is this like three sub only streams? <laughs> how about, how about, how about? How about we just do... Let's see. Hmm. Because the plan was, I can do a one-off game tomorrow. Or I can do a, a, a long sub-only Stardew Valley. And maybe we could do Mario Kart if enough people want to play. Because I need to test out how team games work through online. So we'll do that for sure. Because you guys... I got way too many subs today. This was not this was not in the itinerary for today. Yeah, so I think what we'll do is... I'll still do a one-off game. Like it, we usually do. And then I'll do a long sub only either tomorrow or Friday, depending on my mood. And then Friday, April Fool's stream, of course. I must have misunderstood when you said stop gifting. How about you just do the opposite of whatever I say from now on, huh? <laughs> but genuine guys, thank you. Thank you. I feel so weird. Can't we just turn face cam off? Okay, guys, would you watch me if I became like a faceless streamer? I guess. <laughs> She's shy. Yeah, guys, I'm shy. I'm shy. <laughs> no, I don't. Because, like, I feel like face cam adds a lot. Yeah, where is Mac? Everybody at Mac in the chat.
I miss Mac. Screenshot that and send that to Mac. <laughs> Guys, we have a minute left on the hype train. If you want a chance to get exclusive emotes, cheer or subscribe. Wait, I just realized. Since that's a level 6, you guys, everybody who donated will get a level 5 emote. Wow. S Wait, are we really at 69 subs? Funny number. Please keep it at that. Don't... Please, we need to keep the funny number, everybody. Please. Okay, back to the actual game. There's so many spiders here all of a sudden. I can feel them crawling all over me. Maybe they're just saying hello? Hi, spiders. It's me, your friend Basil. Oh, that did nothing. Did anybody get new emotes from the high train? Wait, let me look at this. Let me look at the analytics. Jesus Christ, we had a level 6 all-time record shattered. Thank you, chatters. Thank you. New all-time PB. A 76% level 6 hype train. What is that emote? It looks ugly. Oh no. What is that? I'm sorry. You guys had really bad RNG. That is... I don't like it. Yeah, it looks... Okay, from a distance, it looks like a cowboy who's wearing like a... What's it called? A bandana? It does not look like a giraffe. I want my money back. No, no, no. No refunds. No refunds. But guys, we had 100 bits and 27 subs. That's our best hype train ever. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Meg Esports. We'll go crazy in April. I will give back to the channel in April. <laughs> Reroll? That is an emo, you know. Reroll. But I'm sorry, guys. You guys you guys actually got scammed. You got scammed. But seriously, thank you. Thank you, everybody who donated today. Thank you. Thank you. I'm gonna go cry later. Happy tears, of course. Ah! They're biting me! Oh, I'm probably just scaring them. There, there, spiders. It's okay. I'm not here to hurt you. Uh oh Skinny scary. What's the game again? Read the category. But for sub only streams, I'll do Stardew Valley and maybe Mario Kart. If people want to play Mario Kart. Wait, am I in the right category? Yes, I'm in Amori. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've been in the wrong game category. <laughs> Guys, oh, there's more spiders. There's so many of them, I can't get them off. Ugh. Mori. Mori, please. Help. What am I supposed to do? Dude, R.I.P. Basil again. I don't like this world. Oh, I got attacked. Oh, it's happy music. Finally. you, Sonny. You were someone I could depend on to listen. 
No problems. Or my problems, my hopes, my dreams. You knew them all. So if you're still there, please let my words reach you one more time. Oh, you, you ran away though. You know what Basil is doing right now? You know when people text you like half of a message at a time? Like when they send like one sentence at a time instead of like three sentences and one message? That's literally what Basil is doing right now. It annoys the shit out of me when people do that. Or when somebody just opens with like, hey, and then like don't ask what they want. It's like, just be straightforward. Just be like, hey, I need your help. Don't be like, hey. I need something. Just tell me what you need. It's it actually pissed me off. Thank God I gotta get paid in two days. Yeah, I get paid in three weeks, everybody. I love Twitch. That's me for real. Wait, you double text? That would I would lose my mind. Oh no, you do that too, Kim? No, please. I'm never messaging Kim ever. <laughs> my cousin does that. Are they a child? I feel like, I was gonna say, I feel like children do that, but I, there's a lot of adults who do that. People who do that, like, intentionally, hacker, stop. <laughs> stop. I hate this. I hate this. Look at this. VOD watchers. Do you not see what hacker is doing? Because, like, or, like, on Discord, too... Because you know how when you're typing on Discord desktop and when you press enter, it sends the message, it doesn't go to the next line? So people will be pinging me like five times. It annoys the frick out of me. That's why if I use Discord, I will use mobile. Because then I can like put an indent. Like if I'm sending like a long message with multiple paragraphs, I can put indentations in between. Because you can't do that on desktop, I don't think. flower I do that so they get more notifications that's toxic that is so toxic if someone doesn't answer you right away let them be I know I get anxious if I see that I miss like three messages that's what happened last night because I was texting my friend and I fell asleep and then they texted me at like 10 they were like oh you getting tired and then they texted me at like 10.30, they're like, hey, Megan. Oops, leaked my name. They said, hey, Megan, question mark? And then they were like, oh, rest well. So when I woke up at like 5, I, I had like three missed messages, and I was like, shit. But it was just them checking in. Oh, you need to hold down shift when pressing enter? Now I know. Thank you. A single daisy. Can you get me out of here? Where's my little hand guy? 5 a.m.? Yeah, I'm... Because... I don't know. I, I woke up at 5 and I couldn't go back to sleep. I did get a decaf coffee today, which does nothing. Because it has no caffeine in it. But, because when I went on my walk today, I was like, I might as well buy myself a little treat. Oh my god, it's all my friends! I can't talk to them. Hey, Mari! I don't think they're alive. Yeah, I don't, I don't like this place. Get me out of here. We found Basil. Stream over, guys. Yeah, everybody's stream is over. <laughs> Imagine. Oh, it's water. Was Mari sick? You took a nice nap.
Guys, we found Basil. <clears throat> oh, Mori, is it really you? How did you find me? Are Kel, Aubrey, and Hiro here too? I've missed you all so much. I'm glad the treehouse is still standing. Everyone works really hard to make it together. Let's go home, Amori. The treehouse is our home. Book. Toy. Game. Toast. Cat. TV. Toy. 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 I want to live there. Oh, okay, you know the guy who does doodles on TikTok? You know how he doodled a house? It's artsy as frick, right? It's a really cool art piece, but I don't think you could, like, ever live there. And not, like, have vertigo or something. An elevator? I wonder where it leads to. Maybe it can take us back home. Where do you want to go? Vast forest. Cause that's where Mari is. I can't get out. I, um, I can't press any buttons. Actually, while we're in here, can I share something with you, Amori? He loves me. I see you didn't speak quick enough, Basil. Oh. <gasps> oh my god. Hold on, Amori. I, I, I think I'm stuck. Could you help me out? Actual nightmare. I don't... I don't think that could happen IRL. Because I don't think there's enough force when the doors close. I think it's more concerning, like, if the elevator goes up and you're stuck. I think they're designed to, like, not move if you do get stuck. I hope. <laughs> oh, I don't like that. Okay, the things that freak me out the most is getting, like, something stuck in a door. Because my dad, when he was in the Navy, the only injury he had was he got his finger jammed in a door when he was, like, abroad or something. And it it pinched, like, right here. He didn't break any bones, thankfully, but he, like, one of his, he lost some nerve in his finger, so he can't, like, move it as much. Or, I hate garbage disposals. Because even though you can flip them on and they go, Gah! right? I, I'm still super scared that one day it'll glitch and it'll just turn on. The one time when I, like, drop a spoon down it or something. So I, I hate garbage disposals. I think it's because I watched um a lot of Final Destination movies when I was like a preteen. And those scarred me for life. Do not watch Final Destination. You will have nightmares. Like actually. The noise is a lot. I know it's like way too <laughs> scary. The greatest garbage disposal impression. Should I just become an impressionist? I'm already a ventriloquist according to TikTok comments. Should I just do impressions? <laughs> Yeah, but I, I don't think that'll ever happen with an actual elevator. Did somebody clip it? Clippers get on it. 
Yeah, I want to go back. I want to go back home. I want to go back to reality. Oh, there's so many doors. Have you had lunch? I had a late breakfast, but I do have my shake on standby. So I'm probably going to have it at like... Because I... Or I had a... Yeah, I had a late breakfast, I mean. Because I ate at like 10 instead of 8. So that means I have to have lunch at 2. And then dinner at 6. Because I went for a walk. And I usually don't eat before I go on walks. And I don't like eating before I wash up. It's weird. I, I'm very like particular... <laughs> I think these people are people who are hanging out. Like spending time. Ooh, it's a stranger. Did I see the sunrise? Not this morning. I kind of stayed in my room until I went for a walk, so I didn't see the sunrise. But we have like a lovely view. Back then, I wanted to save what was left. But even after everything, you left me, Sunny. I waited so long for you to come back. Even seeing you now, it's hard to think straight. I could feel my heart hurting, and I want to cover my face and hide. There are so many things I want to say to you, but the words won't come out. I just... I waited so long for you to come back, Sunny. But, you never did. I don't know if I like basil anymore. An empty fishbowl. Oh, the water is spilled out. Basil is retaliating and killing fish. That is very bad. We do not stand. I do like how it's all explaining... Ooh. I like how it's explaining, like, the story gradually. Is this Mori when she jumped out the window? Okay, isn't the illusion of somebody being trapped in a fishbowl, like, alluding to people who feel trapped or isolated? So maybe Mori is the fishbowl. And Bezo killed Mori! By pushing her out the window, because Mori took all of Mori's attention. Yeah, the stranger is Basil. It's kind of like the alt version of Basil, I assume. Similar to how Amori is the alt version of Sunny. Sunny. to see me? I've been adding out in the stumps since I got here. I'm not the best at defending myself, but I think I'm pretty good at surviving at least. Anyway, I knew we could save me, Amori. And I'm sure we'll be able to make it out of this place now that you're here. This place seems a little dangerous, but I trust you. I mean, every other iteration of Basil we've had has gotten killed. Hey, Omori, you're acting kind of cold. Did I do something wrong? Do you want to take the raft? Yes, sir. That's kind of the worst. When, like, you're talking to a friend, like, you're texting or, like, talking, and, like, you can tell that something is off, but you don't want to, like, call it out. I think when that happens, you just have to try to best to be like, act normal. Cause I don't know if like, pointing it out is helpful. Oh wait, Amori! I don't like this place at all, I don't feel safe. But, at least we have each other. Haha. <laughs> huh. 
Actually, there's something that's really been bothering me. Would you care to hear about it? Watch me as we like that bitch, Mari. <laughs> oh. That was not cool. You know what is cool? Following the channel because everybody, we are another 30 minutes into stream. So if you're new here, click the follow button. You get cool emotes and you get to type in chat. Can we hit our follower goal today? Everybody, any new followers? And if you're already following, make sure you have notifications turned on. That way you don't miss a single stream. Okay. Do you want to take the raft? Yes. I saw a power line in the background. This is awkward. Is this all that, like, Captain Jack Sparrow heard when he has the jar of dirt? Yep, Basil's still dead, everybody. It was still beating. Go on the raft again? You sound like the little five year olds who want to go on the roller coaster five million times. No, we're not going again. I am putting my foot down. Oh. I mean, we might actually have staffers lurking. I just don't know. That's why I get scared. Because usually staffers will watch non-affiliated and then partner channels. But for affiliates, they only really watch them if they're, like, doing bad shit. Oh my god. So four more doors left. Four more. Actually speedrunning. <laughs> hey, Twitch staff, take this. No! No! No, we, we give Twitch staff nice things. No, don't punch them, please. This is what we give Twitch staff, everybody. We give them hearts. Yes! No, guys, be nice to the Twitch staff. <laughs> None of them are here, probably. Oh my god, is that Sans? Sorry, the one go-to, like, joke setup my sister has is... Oh my god. She'd be like, oh my god, is that blank? Whenever a character looks like a celebrity or like a, a TV show character? <laughs> so because of that, I'm making more of that type of joke, and I hate that type of joke. It's like, that's such bad comedy. Just saying like, oh, this looks like Blink. Or some stupid one level analogy is so bad. Or simile. I don't like these sounds. Oh! Wait! I missed something! No, take me back. I saw something. There was a mirror. Have you guys ever had Katsu Burger? There's a few locations in... In Washington and then California, I think. Katsu Burger is the best thing you'll ever have. Because Katsu is like fried meat with the panko on it. So they have like fried Katsu hamburgers. You can get pork. You can get beef Katsu. It's really good. Expen My roommate got it for us last night. 
because he was feeling nice. Even though I had already done dinner prep, but it's good. If you have a chance to try Katsu Burger, it's like a mid-level price range, but it's really good. It's like gourmet burgers, but it's like somewhat affordable. The line is always really long. Sad. Ours wasn't too busy, because I've been there several times, because there's, um... I think there's like five in Washington. But I've only been to the one that's closest to me, and they're never busy. Okay, let's get the key. I think Mari got terminally ill, and then she unalived herself. Ooh, hey, it's, it's, it's our friend. For so long, you kept the truth shut out. But something made it slip. And the hole that it made, it won't stop spreading until you find the root of it all. The one that has seen the truth? Will you guide me to him, Sonny? I don't want to. Basil's kind of scary right now. Wait! No! I missed something! <sighs> it looked like there was a table with a picture on it. I'm getting scammed. Him? Yeah, I don't know. It's gotta be the shadow guy. Is that Mari? Oh, anyway, so Casa Burger, they have like different seasoned fries, which are really good. We got the curry and then we got the 12 spice. So my hands still smell like curry. Yeah, they smell like curry. Even though I washed them and took a bath twice. Okay, that's basil in the ground. And then Mari. Mari. Oh, everybody's in the ground. Yeah, everybody is cherry Kool-Aid. Oh! I need to see if there's more lore. Okay, it doesn't seem like there is. Two doors left. I tried finding my way out, but I kept getting lost over and over. I'm sorry. You must be tired of saving me all the time. I should have tried harder. Anyway, everything is fine now that you're here. Let's go home. Don't we have, like, different homes? Because Basil has always said in these little rooms, We should go home. We should go home. I, I still think Basil is actually bad. Or Basil is like mentally ill and is kind of like leaked into us. The whole time I've been here, I've been looking through my photo album to keep me company. When I was feeling scared, I would look at all our happy memories together. It really helped me keep my hopes up. I feel like... There are some photos missing, but maybe I'm just imagining things. How are Aubrey, Kel, and Hero, anyway? I hope you all don't worry too much about me. I can't wait to see everyone again. What about Mari? He's not asking about Mari. I, I think Basil made me kill Mari. Oh, the music looped. Weird. Hero? Is that you? Oh, Mari! Look, it's Hero! 
He didn't tell me if anyone was already here. Ooh, turkey! If I take the arrows, it's gonna take me back. I'm not doing that. Wait. No. I, I can't go further. I'm, I'm not falling for this trick. I ain't doing it. Okay, I have to. Oh. They're safe. Hey, it's the cat. Isn't, like, the cat the leader of this world? Cal! Aubrey! It's so good to see you guys! How have you been? Did you miss me? <laughs> Wait! What? What? What are you guys doing? Sudoku. Oh! are squeaking. Dude, did Basil really get knocked out by some little bitch-ass rubber ball? Okay, not gonna lie in dodgeball. You know when you play dodgeball in school, they have those big, like, red thick rubber ones? And then they also have these small little styrofoam ones? I swear to god, the little styrofoam ones were worse. Because you could throw them faster so they could go, like, rocket speed. And since I was super short, because, guys, I'm 5'2", so imagine, like, 10-year-old Megan being, like, 3'7", okay? And everybody else was, like, 4'10". Since everybody else was taller, people would throw the ball and they would miss, and it would just hit me in the face every time. It was the worst. Man! Aubrey always gets what she wants! Hi, Amori! We were hoping that you'd come by soon! Wanna play cards with us? We were just about to start another game. Kill and Aubrey have been fight Kill and Aubrey have been fighting a lot late. A lot again. You would think they'd get tired of it after a while, but they're both just so full of energy. Yeah, energy to kill. Oh, well, where's the key? Oh, can it kiss? I can't touch the picking basket. Oh! Do I have to? Yeah, when I touch Basil, he squishes. Oh, there's blood. Okay. I mean, paint. How many times must Basil get murked? I don't know. I think it's what Omori wants to do. Okay, I'm gonna double check. I think that was all the doors. That's all? Okay. Let's see what's in the final door. A statue of a religious figure. These were outside of the people's houses. You feel as if it is judging you. And steak. Would you like to eat some? Yes, sir. It 
Delicious. Okay, I can't run in here. This world is pretty, though. Mari's picnic basket. Would you like to save? Yes. Okay, still two days left. I won't step on them anymore. I just wanted to see if anything different. Is there a piano in the church? Sunny, the truth is here. You've been running from this for far too long. But this time we can face it together. Oh, the way that the stranger waddles is weird. Okay, the red light disappeared. Sunny! Why did it end up like this? Sunny? I I'm... I'm so sorry. Will you forgive me? My best friend? Okay, Basil made me kill Maureen. It seems like Basil wronged, him, wronged us in some way. Do you want to save Basil? I mean, we kind of have to, okay? We don't want to be the asshole. Basil. There's something out there. It's calling me. And it's calling you, too. Let's go together. Yeah, th I think this is the door that's in my house that goes to the backyard. There is no light bulb here. Uh, it's... It's so much creepier when you see, like, the, the drag marks instead of the footprints. Because it just shows that they're like helpless. Because when you see footsteps, you're kind of assuming like, oh, they got away. But this is like, oh, they're being dragged away. So sorry. Will you forgive me, my best friend? Please. It hurts. Tell them to let go. Wait. Wh what are you doing? Tell them to stop. 
Please, tell them to stop. Help me! Oh! I didn't press anything. I'm not walking, it's literally doing itself. We're awake. Hero's gone. Piano music is playing. Guys, is Mari actually alive? Ain't no way. Are we gonna see our friend? Nope. An empty picnic basket. Would you like to save? Two days left. Oh! Oh, it's Mari's room. The window is open. You know, waltzes were always my favorite. That's why I chose this song for our last recital. But you always hated it, didn't you? How I'd lock myself away on the piano? All that practicing, playing the same song over and over? When you first picked up your new violin, you were so eager to play with me. But keeping up with something isn't so easy. Maybe I pushed you too hard. I'm sorry. I just wanted it to be perfect. We never did get to play at that last recital. Did you want to play it with me now? Hero. Whoa! You scared me there, Sonny. Sorry for bursting in like that. I could have sworn I heard some music. You must miss Mari a lot. It's been hard for me, too. I still think about her every day. I just don't understand why she chose to leave us. The way she did. But I knew her as a person would always want us to be happy. Even if it wasn't without her. You should really get some rest. Go upstairs, I'll come join you in a bit. You should really get some rest. Okay. A grand piano. The word Amori is etched across the center. The bookcase has been cleared out. Cardboard boxes are littered across the house. I don't want to go back to bed, though.
See, this is the double doors. Wait, was Mari, like, hanging out at the treehouse? Oh, no, I can go inside now. It's a friend. Aw, oh, you little bitch. Okay. Empty. There's no knife in the kitchen, so I still have my knife on me. The fireplace. There are nails stuck between the bricks. There was a door here before. But there is nothing here. Okay, back to bed, I guess. A very comfortable bed. Would you like to go to sleep? Yes. One day left. Yay, we're in the human world. Finally. I don't like the fake world. I like the real world. Someone's at the door. You know what else is coming your way? An ad. Because everybody, we are two hours in the stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing Humble Thumb. Or... You can link Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a Prime sub available. Any primers? Um, after the ad, we will keep on playing. So if you don't want to miss a single second, subscribe. Ending now. I usually stream for three to four hours. I know you're new here. Also, if you're new here, click the follow button. Can we hit our goal? We're about halfway there. <laughs> 34 hours? Dude, that'd be insane. I'm not doing a subathon just yet. <laughs> I will be doing a 12 hour stream for my birthday, April 24th. Stream ends when you beat Amori. Yeah, mods change the title. Wait, my to-do list is gone. Hero. Good morning, Sunny. Rise and shine. I noticed the to-do list with the chores your mom gave you, so I finished them all. Dude, Giga Chad. Hope you don't mind. Also, I made you breakfast. Dude, can I just marry Hero? <laughs> can I just make him mine? Come down and get it while it's still warm. Kel's already on his second plate. Oh, he had a little apron. Cute. Let's see if our little friend is here. Nope. An empty picnic basket. Would you like to save? Yes, sir. Stay the night made us feel safer. That's why we can go in the rooms. Nope, I can't go in the backyard. Mm -hmm. 
Top of the morning, Sonny. You better start eating before I finish it all. Actually, most of the bacon, though. Another ba another plate of bacon coming in hot. Oh boy, all for me. Thanks a bunch, bro. <laughs> Who could that be? I'll go get the door. Why are you into the door when it's not your house, Kel? Kind of weird. Ah, it's you! Kim. Ew! What is all of this? What the heck, Kel? It's probably Aubrey. Or maybe it's Mari? An unfinished plate of breakfast. The dishes are squeaky clean. Why didn't we pack this bookshelf? Mom's collection of books. Oh. It's not Aubrey. Huh? What's going on over there? Dang it, Kel! Now I have eggs all over me! Well, I'm sorry, but you're the last person I'd expect to see here. What are you doing here anyway? I was just about to get to that. It's, ju it's just, it's Aubrey. She's not answering her door or her back door, or the rocks have been throwing at her window. She was really upset yesterday. I know this is her fault somehow. Tell me what you did to her. We didn't do anything. She's the one with the problem. Hold on, Kel. If Aubrey's that upset, we should at least try to do something to help. This is Aubrey we're talking about. We've all known each other since we were kids. You weren't there when she puts Basil into the lake. I told you. She's different now. We shouldn't bother with people like, people like her. It's true that she changed, but that doesn't change the fact that I still care about her. Wait, is he going for two grills? And even if she doesn't show it, I'm sure Aubrey still cares about me too. That's just the kind of person she is. I don't know about that. Today's our last chance to do this before Sunny leaves. There's no way I can just let it end like this. We should at least try to talk to her. Well, me and Sunny can tag along, but you're gonna have to be the one who's doing the talking. She listens to you the most. Thanks, Kel. Hey, Kim. Thanks for asking us for help. You're a good friend. Huh? Um, sure, whatever. Why don't you head out first? We'll meet you there. Okay, then. See ya. Why did Kel pelt her with eggs? I still don't understand that. Okay, still can't go in the backyard. Yo, Sonny. Thanks for letting us sleep over last night. And for spending your last few days with me. You're a real friend. High five. Do you want to give a high five to Kelly, user? It's how you deal with intruders? I mean, yeah. I have, like, a baseball bat. I'm just like Aubrey. Empty picnic basket. Would you like to save? Yes. down, Kim. Everyone has bad days. You know, Aubrey always bounces back. Oh, is this Aubrey's house?
Hello? Is anyone there? Come to think of it, have you ever been inside Aubrey's house before? I don't think so. She always came over to play with us. It's gonna be a hoarder's house, and I'm gonna be triggered. Anyway. I don't remember hanging out at her house at all. Hello? Aubrey? Is anyone home? Hello? Uh-oh. Oh, it looks like the door was open. Let's go inside. Oh, no. Sorry. Hashtag triggered. <laughs> Trash is strewn across the floor. Wardrobe. A mirror. Are we gonna find Robin in the toilet? No. <laughs> Let's go in the attic. Oh, she has a rabbit! Literally me. Yalri, how are you feeling? What the heck are you guys doing here? Get the hell out of my room! We're sorry for intruding. It'll only take a bit. We just wanted to make sure you were okay. I'm fine! I've been hearing some things, but I just want to hear it from you. Can you tell me what happened yesterday? Nothing happened. You pushed Basil into the lake! You know he can't swim! I didn't mean to do that. I just meant to push him away. He could have drowned. I said it was an accident. Look, I'm sorry, okay? You're the one that keeps showing up and acting like you're better than everyone. Well, you're the one going around bullying Basil and stealing his stuff. Stop talking like you know anything about that. I keep telling you that it's none of your business. But it is my business. You, you and Basil, and everyone here, you were my best friends. Alright, alright, I see the problem here. This is just your typical Kel and Aubrey fight. Just make up, you two. You've done it so many times before. Hey. These are the missing photos of Mari. They're... They're all I have left of her. But you know it's still not right of you to take them from Basil. These photos belong to him. Well... It's no use now. Even if we have these photos, I already threw the rest away. They must be long gone by now. That's not true, Aubrey. Sonny has them right here! <coughs> Sorry, Kel's voice kills me. <clears throat> what? He does? But how? I could have sworn I threw them away in the trash. Unless you and Sonny... <laughs> you really dug through my trash for this thing? That's kind of gross. <laughs> Aubrey, let's put Mari's photos back in the photo album. All these photos, they belong together in one place. Hero took the photo album from you.
Come on, guys. We should do this together. Press B by accident. Um, man, it's been a while. Where did these go again? Why don't we just ask Sunny? Yeah, Sunny, you still remember, right? You always had a great memory. Uh, dude, I don't. wrong, I'm pressing A, and it's not placing it. Oh, these are all so cute. Okay, that's not right either. So it's blacked out if it's the right spot. Got it. Oh, wait, that was it. Bro, this is gonna take forever. There's so many pictures. And so many memories of Mari. RIP. She's so pretty. Obviously pictures that they took of each other and none of the pictures seem forced because I know when I was little my parents would like take pictures and like force us to smile and it made me like not enjoy taking pictures and it made any memories I had seem fake and I think with the rise of the digital age like social media a lot of parents will like like family vlog they'll post about their like unborn kids and it just seems like you're commoditizing your life and i think it's fine if you want to do that as an adult and like become an influencer but like if you have kids i would say like don't post it like just keep it to yourself because your kid doesn't necessarily consent to it all the time because i know my sister and i both we told our parents to stop posting us when we became adults pictures. Like, I bet if I had, like, a little camera, I would have done this when I was little. My birthday. It's my 12th birthday today. I thought my friends forgot, but they all surprised me with a strawberry cake. Oh wait, this is Basil. I feel so lucky. This year is looking to be a good year. 
February 18th, my birthday. Another group photo. This was a little after I opened all my presents. Mari brought me this photo album and everyone else brought me film for my camera. I'll try my best to use it all. Yeah, we've read all of these previously. I'm only gonna read the Mari ones. Wait, they're cuddled up on the couch. Are they, like, gonna bang? February 18th, my birthday. Mari and Hero fell asleep on the couch. They look so cozy together. <laughs> I hope they don't mind the photo. Mari's dad might be kind of mad if he saw it. <laughs> Easy. March 3rd. Here and Mari washing dishes for breakfast. We're staying over with Mari and Sunny this weekend. It's getting warmer lately, so we're about to go to the park. Kayla says there's a secret lake behind some bushes, so we're all gonna go check it out. Okay, this picture is weird, because it looks like it's taken from the outside window looking inside the kitchen. Kind of weird, Basil. Not gonna lie. Hmm. March 31st. It's already the last day of March. We're having a picnic with Mari at our secret lake spot. Mari wanted to take a picture of everyone. Say cheese. March 31st. After eating all the food, everyone fell asleep, except me, Hiro, and Mari. Something unfortunate happened when I was taking the photo. Um, thanks a lot, Hector. I'll have to cover it up with tape later. What does that mean? Who's Hector? Did, like, somebody shit in the pool? April 9th. I caught Mari carrying Sunny on the way home from school today. He must have fallen asleep on the bus. I thought it was so cute, so I got my camera out as quick as I could to snap this once in a lifetime photo. Sometimes I wish I had a sibling. April 21st. Sunny and Kel gave up on making flower crowns and ran off, but Aubrey and I got the hang of it really fast. Everyone thinks a flower crown really suits me. Maybe you just flowers, okay? Oh my god, hi, Crystal. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Twitch notice failed you again? Just follow my Twitter and have Twitter notifications on. Easy. But my Twitch notifs have been failing me again. I never get notifications for Hassan anymore. But I get notifications for all the other channels I have notifications on, so I think Twitch just hates us on now. Sad. March 25th. Mari butter everyone popsicles, one of every flavor. Sunny got lemon, Hiro got root beer, Kel got orange, Harvey got watermelon, and Mari got grape. Mine was banana. It tasted okay. The subs? Yeah, chat went crazy. Shoutouts to Kobobo, Kim, Hacker, Keelan for gifting today. They're insane. March 25th. All of her shoes in a circle. Can you guess whose shoes are whose? June 22nd. Mari says she wants to get a summer tan. I'm scared to fall asleep in the sun since I get sunburned really easily. Um, I'm not sure what Kel is doing here, but he's probably having a good time. Oh, jeez. <laughs> are they are they together? June 22nd. Hero's sleeping on Mari. He's all tired out from the swimming. Well, it seems like Mari won't be able to get her summer tan after all. Dude, if you're this buddy-buddy with your friend, they're trying to smash. Oh! <laughs> June 22nd. We're about to head home, but I managed to catch one last photo with Mari and Hiro. They look so happy. A match made in heaven. August 4th. Mari says this beetle is a giant stag. 
suddenly fell from a tree and surprised everyone. Hiro was too grossed out to look. I'm not gonna cry. Stream ends when I cry. <laughs> August 16th. All of us hanging out in our brand new treehouse. Looks like Sunny is finally reading the book I showed him. I want to spend every day in here, but it's a shame that summer vacation is almost over. I hope we get to use this treehouse more next summer. August 18th. We went to Hobbies to read the latest edition of Captain Space Boy. Everyone's so into it right now. I'm sure it's all everyone is going to be talking about when school starts. September 6th. I'm playing cards with Cal, Hero, and Aubrey. They're so easy to read. They can't hide anything on their faces. Mari baked everyone cookies from scratch. They were chocolate chip and super delicious, like always. September 6th. Looks like I have the winning hand. <laughs> but nobody knows that yet. September 9th. Sunny giving Mari a big hug. Mari doesn't come home until late now because she's taking extra classes to prepare for college. Me and Sunny have been hanging out a lot, but I'm sure he still misses her a lot. September 22nd. Mari practicing her part for a big recital next month. We're all going to go watch. It's going to be Mari and Sunny's first performance together, but I know they'll do just fine. We'll all be showing our support from the audience. Wait, this reminds me- Oh no, you guys- You're, you know, you're live April? Cause they had a piano and violin too. I can't. I cried so hard when I read- When I watched you in April. And then I read the manga and then I cried doubly hard. I can't. I'm not ready for this. September 22nd. Mari getting a little camera shy because she's made a small mistake. Don't worry, Mari. Just keep going. No one will even notice. September, 20 September 22nd. After some begging, Sunny came to join Mari for a recital practice. <laughs> They're still working out some stuff, but they already sound so amazing. I know they're gonna do great. Go, Mari. Go, Sunny. You can do it. And that's all. Are you done looking at the photo album? Yes. No, we haven't. I think this is nearing end game, but I don't know. There. Now everything is back where it should be. Looks like one photo is still missing, but... At least the rest of them are back together. Now, doesn't that feel better? We really did have a lot of fun together, huh? Yeah, I guess we really did. I'm sorry, guys. I've been acting like such a jerk. I'm sorry too, Aubrey. I really haven't been treating you so great either. Alright, apologies accepted. Now we can all be friends again. Who wants a hug? Wait. Something... Something happened in the book, right? I saw like a blue flash. Come on, hero. Not now, you're so embarrassing. I'm, I'm good, thanks. What we need to do now is check up on Basil. I hope he's feeling better today. Aubrey, knowing everything I heard from Kel, I'm sure you need to apologize to him. Yeah, I know. Thanks, Aubrey. It's good to have you back. Now, let's get you out of this house. Hmm, okay.
that's what's her name. Kim. Aubrey's bed. Ooh. Hate that. Aubrey, get a new PC. A side table is being used to cover up a hole in the wall. Hi, Tina. Yeah, you got gifted a sub earlier. Now you better praise Kim for the rest of your life. And but welcome in, Tina. Can we get some yos? Hello, Kim. Or er, Tina. Oopsie. <laughs> I mixed up the names. Oopsie, I'm sorry. Cancel me. Team is ready. I feel like something bad is gonna happen. I think we're gonna go to Basil's house and Basil's gonna be dead. Because if you die in the fake world, you die in real life. This bunny's so cute, though. Bun Bun. Oh. I'd rather have a cat, though. Um, hashtag triggered. Okay. Yo, Aubrey, are you okay? Hey, Kim. I'm good. Thanks for ever thanks for bringing everyone here. Hey, guys, guys, Aubrey's here. Yo, Aubrey, are you feeling any better? We even saved a taffy for you. What happened in there? Your face is all red. Do you need me to teach someone a lesson? Don't worry about me, guys. Sorry for ignoring you all earlier. Hey, it's no biggie. We're just glad you're all right. I'm walking to you. <laughs> right, Charlie? Yeah. <laughs> I have no idea what voices I gave these guys. <laughs> Aubrey, Aubrey, let's go hang out at the park. I want to show you some cool new moves I came up with. I wasn't practicing all night. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I can't. <laughs> that sounds fun, but maybe later. I have some things to take care of first. Well, I'll hang out tomorrow. I promise. No, I, I think we're all gonna die. Ah, uh, okay. We'll see you later then. <laughs> Aubrey. Don't keep us waiting too long. You know I won't, Kim. I'll be back before you know it. Dude, I was like slipping between like Boston and like Southern a little bit. Okay, Basil's house is to the right. Because right is right. Polly, how's Basil doing? We were wondering if we could hang out with him today. Oh. Hello, everyone. I'm afraid Basil's in home right now. He is in the hospital. Did somebody stab him? What? What happened? Oh, my, my apologies. Let me clarify. Basil's in the hospital visiting his grandma. She was rushed to intensive care yesterday evening. Oh, no. I'm really sorry to hear that. Do you know when he'll be back? Dude, fucking Kel. Insensitive jerk. I'm not exactly sure. Maybe sometime in the afternoon? Sorry. Would you mind if we check back here later? We're all really worried about him. I don't mind at all. Please come by to visit. I think Basil would appreciate having some friends over. I'm happy to know that Basil has friends that care so much about him. Oh, it's nothing. Friends are supposed to be there for each other. Right, Albert? Yeah. Sure. Anyways, we'll be back later. See you, Polly. Okay, see you. Well, I guess we have to wait until he gets back. Is there anything you guys want to do until then? I'm okay just hanging out and doing whatever. Then I vote somewhere indoors. It's way too hot today. Sure, maybe we can hang out at our house a little. And then later when it cools down, we can all go see the treehouse. Oh yeah, we should do that. Especially since Aubrey's with us now, too. Our old treehouse, huh? I haven't been there in so long. 
Yeah, we haven't yet either. We just wanted to go see yesterday, but it's too dark outside. How about you, Sonny? What did you want to do today? It's your last day. You should call the shots. Yeah. You should decide how to spend your last day in far away town. Lead the way, Sonny. I want to go home. Thank you for the alert, Tina. Hi, Ethan. Can we get some yo's? What time do you keep your AC on in Celsius? Dude, I'm from the States. We don't use Celsius here. I would love to keep it at a nice, chill 55 Fahrenheit, but my roommates like it hot, so it's at a steaming 70. Okay, yesterday I ended stream early, and I think it's because I was overheated. Like, actually, because the AC was at 75. Like, we had it set to 75, but it was at 80. I think I actually overheated. So the AC is at a lower temp. Guys, can we get the cat? L states? I thought you were from the states, Ethan. What? Don't tell me you're an EU frog. You're way too mean to be an EU viewer. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. Ethan is a reform chatter. Okay. Where'd the cat go? Oh, you're in Canada? Even worse. Wanna be Americans? My check. Where's the cat? Hi, Mac. Can we get some yo's? Mac, you're very late. I feel like the cat went to the treehouse and then it's gonna be dead because I killed the cat in game. Okay, I wanna explore town a little bit before I go home. I just got out of work. Okay. Hope it went okay. This little baby. Wait, are isn't this? This is this is Kel's mom. Yeah, Kel's mom. Well, hello, boys. Good to see you're finally spending some quality time with me. Oh my gosh, she's such a bitch. Please stay for a while. We're having the best weather today. A blue picnic basket. Nothing like Mari's. Holy sub goal, yeah. Some chatters went crazy. They got me a level 6 hype train. It was insane. Shoutouts. Ah, dog nart. Cal, your old man is such a fool. Got a beautiful picnic, but I forgot the most important ingredient. Meat. Could you spare some time and buy me some of the good old cheap stuff at the other mart? Here's some cash. Just talk to the meat man in the back. He'll hook you right up. The meat man? Ooh, plus twenty dollars. Old hobo. Ah, it's you, good lads. I have some wonderful news. By a stroke of fantastical luck, it seems that I have struck gold and won the lottery. Lucky bastard. <laughs> we have a sub only stream tonight then? Depends on how long Amori goes for. Cause I, I wanna try and beat it today. If not, if we don't do a sub only tonight, then I will do a long subscriber only either tomorrow or Friday, where I'll do Stardew Valley and then Mario Kart with the viewers. That way we can practice how group tournaments work. But for subs. <laughs> Apple guy. Drink apple juice. Have you ever heard the phrase, an apple day keeps the doctor away? The same concept applies for apple juice. Apple juice supports hydration. It contains beneficial plant compounds and may support heart and health. It may also protect your brain as you age. There are no downsides as far as I'm concerned. There's a frick ton of sugar. So would you like to buy some apple juice for $2? No! $2 is way too much. Okay. That's fine. As long as you're not buying any orange juice. Orange juice is so much better, though. Pretty boy. Well, life's been all kind of stressful lately, but people watching out here helps me put things into perspective. I might make it into a habit to come to this park more often. 
I guess sometimes all it takes is to relax and stop and smell the roses. Yeah, apple juice tastes good, but it's not as good. Oh. Oh, good scene. Oh my god. Wait, who got auto-modded? Somebody got auto-modded just now. <laughs> Ethan said, We would never want to be y'all hillbilly rednecks. No, a lot of you Canadians want to be us. <laughs> Dude, my nose is so itchy. <laughs> hey, Sunny. Sorry I was so mean to you before. I think seeing you just caught me by a surprise. Though I guess that's a pretty crappy excuse. I hope you're doing okay and stuff. I'm sure everything was hard for you to deal with. Sometimes I think I was the one that should have been there for you. I don't know if I'll really ever get over Mari's death, but... It's okay to take it slow. To allow yourself to feel every emotion. And to have patience. Anyway, I... I just want you to know... That I still care about you and stuff. I've been thinking about this since I last saw you, but I think you're looking a little pale. And kind of thin, too. After you move, promise me you'll go outside more often, okay? No, I ain't ever going outside. Ew. Kim and I found each other in a different chat. Did you guys say hi? <laughs> Sometimes I'll see my chatters in other chats, but I won't say anything. The only time I've, like, added another chatter I knew was Vora, because I saw Vora in Extra Emily's chat a while ago. And I was like, oh my god, is that Vora? And then they were like, people, hey. <laughs> yeah, we said hi. You guys are so cringe. <laughs> That's cute. I mean, I'm sure you guys will recognize names. The stench of this man is indescribable. Smelly hobo. Hey, bub. Could you spare a few nickels? Really appreciate it. You know what else you guys can spare? Um, some follows. Can we hit our follower goal today? Because we are another 30 minutes in the stream. If you're new here, click the follow button. You get cool emotes and... You get a diamond shot. And if you're already following, make sure your notifications turned on. That way you don't miss a single stream. Yeah, I think the only chatters I've seen... I've only seen Vora. I think it's because not a lot of my viewers watch larger streamers, and I only watch larger streamers. Let's give him... Let's give him five bucks. Because we had nine bucks, we got 20 from our dad. Let's give him five bucks. I do, but I guess we don't watch the same streamers then, Crystal. Sad. Oh, it says you have donated a total of ten dollars to Smelly Hobo. Thank you kindly. Wait. Hey, bub. Thanks for helping me. You've been a real friend. So, I got something special for you. Hold all your hands for me and close your eyes. Ew. You feel something cold in your palms. Better than warm. Better than warm. You got a gold watch? You like it? Since you've been so gracious, I thought I could spare you some of my wares. <laughs> That's real gold there, I swear. Bro, you could have sold it and not be homeless. It's real gold. Dummy? Yeah, I, I only will watch Ludwig, but I will never actively chat. Hello, youngins. I see you have some trash with you. Thanks, I'll be sure to dispose of this properly. Here's three dollars for your help. <laughs> Intimidating girl. When Baby told me about her crush, I had to see him for myself. So far, he's a no-show, but Baby told me that we're looking for someone with an obviously fake blonde wig. Huh. Baby has pretty bad taste in guys. Who's gonna look after her when I go back to college?
Short hair girl. I told my big sister about my crush. She wanted me to show him to her, so we're standing around where he usually hangs out with his friends. Ooh, stalker. Okay. You know when you're in school and you have like multiple classes throughout the day and then you have a crush and then you try to figure out their schedule and then you try to figure out which path did they take to get to their class so you try to go to the same path so you can maybe walk into them and maybe talk to them and maybe walk to class together? Um, just me? Okay. <laughs> Olive Beanie. Cousins by chance, lovers by choice. Mons? <laughs> I do that? See, it's not just me. I don't have to really do that. Do you, do you just have classes? There was one semester where I had like four classes with my crush, and then the next semester I only had one, and I was so sad because we had walked to like class together. Dude, man, you're so cringe. <laughs> Just ask him out already. Olive Beanie. Hmm. Looks like the bus is late today. Mood. We gotta buy some meat. Angel. Look at these rare, super, and expensive trading cards. I want to complete my collection, but I only have $5 on me. Man, it sucks to be a kid. Whoa, what's this? There's a fresh $20 bill in my butt pocket. This must be my lucky day. <laughs> I guess I can afford at least one super rare card today. Plus 20, everybody. I can't describe how intimidating it is to ask someone out. I've done it. Four times. And they've all failed. But every time I would gain more confidence. So you know, sometimes you just gotta do it. Okay? If they say no, then it's not meant to be. If they say yes, that's cool. Maybe it'll work out. Don't be a little bitch. We, we talked about this on the Valentine's Day stream, but it's like... Confessing to someone is far different than, like, actually dating someone. Because if there's no feelings... Excuse me, if there's no feelings there initially, then it's... It's whatever. I've done it before, but we knew we liked each other. Then that's great. That's the best scenario. I'd never be able to go to that class again. True. I would drop out and take an L? No, don't do that. It, guys, it doesn't matter. Nobody gives a fuck. Frick. Don't worry, you're fine. It does not matter. Just wear a wig to school every day. Colorful girl. This place is kind of small, but it has a lot of old and rare collectibles. People even come all the way from the city to shop here. I turn straight, have a husband, grow out my hair. Sounds good. <laughs> now, if I can understand why you're nervous, but... Never hurts to try. Do you want to read comics with your friends? Yes, sir. Oh, they're all so cute. Kel being overdramatic as Frick. Hey guys. Wait. It wasn't me who asked out my coworker. It was he asked me out. But imagine how weird, how much worse it would be to like ask out a coworker and then not work out. If you're asking out like somebody in your class, there's like 30 other people in your class. Versus when you're working with somebody, there's like max three. So, you're fine. 
Your semester ends in May. Okay, Mac, I want your birthday present to me to be asking out that girl, so you stop talking about it. <laughs> that is what I want for my birthday. Huh? Yo, champs! Just going on a whim here, but would you like- Would you be interested in buying off my last pet rock? Here's the go for- it. $25? But you seem just like the right guy for this one, so I'll let it go for 10 what do you say? No, it's out of my budget. I only got seven bucks. Well, alright, but this pet rock is calling your name. I can feel it. I don't have ten dollars. Guitar guy. Hey, it's you guys again. I'm still working towards earning my enough money to move to the city so I can become a big star. Will you help me reach my goal? Anything will help. How much do you want to donate? I'll give you a buck. Because you are obviously more well off than the homeless guy. Oh, I've given him $11? Oops. Yes, I'm getting closer and closer to getting my ticket out of here. Thank you. In return, I'll pay, play you an original song. No, I don't want to hear it. Okay, everybody. Get your lighters out. Or go on your phones. Okay, make phone streamer. Bro, he's still going. I did not want an encore. I gave you a dollar, bro. Thank you. Hey, yo, Gino's! Ooh, pizza, like a real pizza sounds good. Right. I'm right. I take pride in becoming a musical connoisseur of sorts. If you play a CD on the jukebox over there, I bet I can tell you who the artist for the track is. I'm good. Glasses, man. Dang it. I'm trying to fix this old arcade machine, but I'm missing a rare and important piece. It looks like it was just bitten off right here. I wonder where it could be. Dude, who's eating the arcade machines? Hmm. Pizza. Sounds delicious right now. <laughs> pizza man. Hello and welcome to Gino's Pizza. What can I get for you? Wait, I, I need to buy meat. Grass in a bowl. It was me. It just looked yummy. Ew. I will sing a song. Ooh. Okay. Okay. I could do that right now. Yep. Okay. Oh, it's so weird. Like taking the headsets off. Okay, let us find a song to sing. Mariah Carey again? I don't know any of your other songs. I'm a fake fan. Okay, so chatters, if you're new here, people can use their channel points and I will sing a song for free. There's a playlist of all my other singing clips. You can feel free to check that out at your leisure. Oh, I need to change that command because it has my name in it. Oops. Stutter. Maybe I can do stutter. Get up, I'm stuck. Yeah, I'll do stutter too. Try stutter. It's been a while since I've sung this one. I don't know if I've sung this on stream or it's been a while. This is a Maroon 5 song. So, if everybody could spam your favorite animated, your favorite hype emotes in the chat. If you got a new hype train emote, put it in the chat too. 
But I'm gonna do the final verse. <clears throat> Guys ready? Wait, I gotta turn the game audio off. There we go. Okay. You knock me down, I can't get up, I'm stuck. Gotta stop shaking me up, I can't eat, can't sleep, can't think, sinking under, sinking under. You're just a fantasy girl, it's an impossible world. All I want is to be with you always. I'll give you everything, give some attention to me. All I want is just you and me always. Not bad. Not bad. I was doing that like in a higher pitch than normal little because I usually do it kind of low. That was fun. That was actually fun. <clears throat> All I want is just you and me always. I'll give you everything. Give some attention to me. Oh, I didn't even do the stutter part. Because I have an actual stutter. Because, <laughs> like, the final, like, bridge verse is like... <clears throat> Give me affection, I need your perfection Cause you feel so good, you make me stutter, stutter Yeah, that's, that's the actual name of the song, I, I just usually don't sing that part But you guys like it, was it good? Type 1 <laughs> But thank you Crystal for redeeming, thank you <clears throat> Get up, I'm stuck, gotta stop shaking me up not bad for not singing that song for like six months. Thank you, Ryan. Thank you, Crystal. Okay, I can't afford to buy anything. I'm a brokey. I only got $26 in my name. That was very nice. Thank you. I get to sing one song per stream if Chatters redeem it, so. Save up some channel points and I'll sing again. Fix it guy. Well, welcome to Fix It, where you can buy stuff and fix it yourself. What can I interest you in? How does he only have flowers? It makes no sense. Rough guy. Okay. <laughs> okay, dude. Man, Basil would love this. These are the flowers that are in Basil's garden. Hello. Here. This is for you. You got a flower clip. Oh. Cute. Miss Candace. Hi, hi, it's me, the happy and cheery Miss Candace. What would you like today, smiley, smiley? Okay, I'm still a brokey. Please come again, or else. Smiley, smiley. Cute girl. Well, welcome. We hope our candy makes you smile. I told you, curtsy. It's smiley. S-M-I-L-E-Y Uh, yes ma'am Look a W Wait, I saw a ladder back there Can we cop this? Nope, damn it 
I mean, I don't think that lollipop would fit in her pants anyway. We can get some Drugos. Promises. You kids need anything for cuts or scratches? Maybe actually. Okay, I'll come back here if there's nothing I want from the other stores. Hey, we gotta talk to the guy in the back. Meat man. I have one job, and it's to sell meat. Used for making hamburgers. Um, since our pops gave us $20, let's buy $20 worth of meat. So it'll be $14, yes sir? I hope we meet again. <laughs> you know who I will not be meeting again? The non-subs, because everybody, we are three hours in the stream, so... It is time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad-free viewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have an Amazon Prime available. After the ad, we're going to keep on playing. We're going to beat this game today. Surely. So if you don't want to miss a single second, subscribe. If you're one of the lucky few who would not receive a gift today, then get boomed. 3 out of 10, shut up. Didn't you give me, like, a 10 out of 10 ad break yesterday, Crystal? That was actually kind of crazy. Yeah, surely we'll beat the game. Chilled meat. Fashionable mom. Ah, oh, I wonder what I should cook for my daughters tonight. Although, I don't cook very often, so maybe I should opt for takeout. Dude, if I had takeout every day, I would lose my mind. I mean, it would be convenient and nice, but... I've very much come to enjoy, like, making stuff from scratch. Other Martin lady. Hello! Yummy fish! A cat's favorite food. Wait. Maybe? Because the cat ran away. Maybe we have to lure the cat later. I'm gonna buy it. I'm gonna buy it. I don't need heels. I want to get a cat. In game and real life. Okay. Can I go back here? No, I can't go in the back room. Damn it. Mr. Baker. Welcome to our family bakery. What would you like? Dude, all of those look so good. Just me looking for birthday cakes online was very difficult, let's say. Okay, I'm gonna buy some heels. Let's buy one band-aid. Oh, why do you call me son? I think it's weird when, like, adults call you son. I mean, I've never been called son. But I think it's weird. Okay, let's get out of here. You never had a pet? Oh. We're basically begging the property owner to let us get a cat. <laughs> like, I dead as. I'm on the point where, like, I'm gonna make a PowerPoint. I feel like Sun is a mask version for Han. I guess, yeah. Hold on a second. I wanna buy a drink. Um, no. No. Not this one. What? You're buying soda, but you're passing on a good old orange, Joe? How could you? Ew, you still drink orange, Joe? It's so grossly sweet. Like, it was made for babies. Oh, yeah? If it was made for babies, why would it contain 100 mili 150 milligrams of caffeine per can? Do your research, Aubrey. <laughs> Whatever. Everyone knows orange Joe tastes putrid. You're probably the only person in the world who buys this crap. Well, now you're getting personal. How dare you answer my dear friend, Orange Joe? What was the last time you ever tried it? Wait. Was it? Okay. 
in the fantasy world, wasn't there like an orange character who was like, Oh, go find my long lost brother, orange something. I can't remember his name. Uh, I'll show you. Kel, what are you doing? Hey, this cancer design is from like five years ago. And it's expired. I told you, no one buys this stuff. Worry not, my dear friend Orange Joe. No matter what, I'll still drink you. Mmm. Delicious. You're gross. <laughs> and you owe me a dollar. Yeah, yeah, I'll give it to you later. Dude, Kel is a jerk. He stole money from Aubrey. She should beat his ass. Yeah, I... To be honest... <laughs> to be honest... <laughs> so when I was working at the daycare, there was a lot of kids, okay? And it took me a while to memorize names. And... I might have called some of them Hun when I could not remember their name. <laughs> okay, because, like, you know how, like, in any classroom dynamic, there's, like, kids that are, like, stand out? And, like, usually the quieter ones, they don't attract as much attention, so... You kind of don't, like... I guess engage with them more? As much as, like, the more energetic kids. So some of the more quieter kids, it took me longer for me to, like, memorize their names. Because they weren't, like, bothering me all the time. They weren't like, hey, Miss Megan, help me with my homework. Or, hey, Miss Megan, come play with me. They would just, like, keep to themselves. Which is nice. Because everybody has their own, like, social dynamic or social energy, right? But when I think about the daycare now, I only really remember, like, the bad kids. <laughs> Like, all the little shitheads, I remember their names. But all the good children, I don't remember. <laughs> Which is bad. Children are stinky, yeah, their hands are gross. And they always want to, like, hold your hand. Dude. I could never work in a daycare now, it's disgusting. I don't think we ever had to deal with, like, piss or shit. But... Children m remind me of children. Wise words, water. Wise words. Can we get some peace? I to yo's. I water. Meg phone streamer for a second. Wait, guys. I just realized. You know how I said I don't want to go by my real name. I'm literally doing. Cause don't I have like channel emotes that have Meg in the emote code? Wait, I can't find him. Yeah, look. Meg Binoculars. Meg Cry. Meg Phone Stream. Meg Winning. I- they all have Meg in the emo code. I need to change that. <laughs> I can't be near a child for more than 10 minutes without them driving me insane. Depends on the kid. Depends on the kid. Uh, Meg Phone Streamer. My friend is sad. <laughs> Okay, coast is clear. Let's deliver the meat. You gave meat to Kel's dad. Thanks, champ. This is just what I was looking for. I'll make some tasty hamburgers. You should all drop by later in the evening. You definitely want to try some of these deliciousness. Who subscribed? Who did it? But thank you! Plus one, everybody. Another sub goal met. Thank you. Who was it? <laughs> we need to thank you. Thank you. It's probably just a resub. But thank you. I don't have much patience, so I just keep my distance from children. Dude, don't ever work for a daycare. I ain't never doing that again. It's way too much. Who ruined our 69 subs? <laughs> not me. It was not me. The guy has 70 subs. In insane. But for now, go on and enjoy yourselves. The weather is great today. Okay. Now that I've explored town, 
I think I want to explore the residential areas again. And find the cat. Because I did spend $10 on the fish. Oop, my bad. Wait, was that a prime sub water? Fog you. If you share the message in chat, then we can see it. And TTS is enabled for resub messages. So say something funny. If it was you, if not, then cringe. Wait, I can't- can I go in this house? There's no response. Oh, why can't I just walk in? That is weird. Guys, please lock your house's doors. Please. This house is cute, though. A yoga mat. Yoga is good for you as it strengthens the connection between your body and spirit. At least, that's what your mom told you once. I keep mine wide open? What? Huh? <laughs> Mods? <laughs> Drama? Red glasses, lady. And that was like the time we- yeah. And then? Honestly, I think that- yeah, definitely. School principal. Did they smash? As I was saying, can you believe? And her. But then. Mm-hmm. Did they smash? Why is your hype train a badge purple? It says former hype train conductor. And then orange is current hype train conductor. So I guess purple is kind of like OG. No, it's, I had my cursor and that's literally what it said. Orange means you were the latest hype train conductor and then purple is former. From a previous hype train in the channel. I didn't know that either. I learned something today. Are we gonna see our friends? No. No ghost today. Oh! This is... Kim's house. Found a coin! Plus one. There's no response. No response. Come on! Just let me in! I think I have an emote for that. not the email code. Hold. Oh, I was close. It's just alternating cats. It's, uh, Eric Andre. I mean, it's really good. <laughs> Non-followers wanted to chat in my chat. <laughs> I feel like there's a big criticism for people who use follower only chat, which I personally use 10 minute follow. Cause I just don't want to get hate rated. I check off many boxes for discrimination. Now that I'm disabled, that's another box to check off. No response. So it's like, if you have 10 minute follower mode, even like just zero minute follow mode, you can easily avoid a lot of negativity or bots coming into your chat. So even if it's gonna hurt my growth, maybe I just won't get new followers every day. But if it allows for 
a chat room to where I don't have to stress all the time about new chatters, then I'll gladly take it. Oh my god, Mari? Artist. Oh, my dog Lucas ran out the door again! He's always trying to get out of the house. Sometimes I wonder if he's only lives here for the food. Oh, where'd he go this time? Sad. Do we need to find the dog? Do you want the copy pasta? I'll give it to you. Okay, that's Aubrey's house. lady. Oh, hello. I remember you. You're the boy who chose the wallpaper for our house. I see you brought your friends. If you're here for the party, I'm sorry. It's still a bit early. Oh, shoot. That's our bad. We'll just come back later. Huh? Huh? Do you guys smell that? It smells like something is burning. Oh, sorry. One second. Actually, um... You guys wouldn't happen to know how to cook, would you? I might need a little help with dinner. You need help cooking? Well, today's your lucky day. My brother here is an amazing cook. He'll definitely be able to cook something right up. Huh? I, I will? Oh, thank you. Please, come inside. Do side quest. trouble you like this. It's my first time cooking for so many people, and so I'm a little nervous. No worries. We'll help you out, won't we, guys? Won't we? Oh, alright then. Come on, team. I'm gonna put you all to work. Huh? Wait a second. Even me? Yeah, of course. We used to cook together all the time when we were kids, didn't we? Thank you so much. Feel free to use any ingredients. I don't have a lot, though. Don't worry. I know we can make something delicious. Let's get to work. Aye, aye, Captain. You can't just make something out of nothing. It's very difficult. You need to, like, know how to cook to do that. Dude, what is Kel doing? He's just eating slop. Wow, what smells so delicious in here? Oh, hello, Sean. Our new friends are just helping me prepare dinner for tonight's party. Well... It looks like you guys are doing a great job. I'm done sitting up outside, so let me help too. Yay! Now all of us can cook together. Phew, all done. With your help, this party is going to be a great success. Thank you all for your help again. You're all such genuinely nice people. Anytime. Thanks for trusting us with your kitchen. We really enjoyed cooking with you guys. Yeah, this was really fun! Can't wait to eat everything at the party tonight! We'll be waiting for you. Take care of yourselves! Ooh. That was like the side quest music, I think. Oh, it's so cute! Obviously she decorated this room, right? Are we gonna see our friend? church. Mincy is diligently sketching away. Kind of weird. Creature. I'm afraid we won't be holding a sermon today, but feel free to use this place to collect your thoughts. Everyone is welcome here.
What? Oh. Oh, did we buy flowers? A headstone. Our dearest Mari. The sun shone brighter when she was here. The grave could use some flowers. Do you want to leave flowers at this grave? Yes. I knew I, it was a good thing to buy the flowers. Because remember I bought extra? I bought like two bouquets when I had to buy um, Hero's mom flowers. Hey, Mari. It's me again. Sunny Kill and Hero are with me this time. Do you visit Mari's grave a lot, Aubrey? Oh. I never thought about this, but... See, like, Mari's buried in this town, right? Like, when they move... That's kind of like more... Closure, you could say, right? I never thought about that. Yeah. I try to, although some days it's a little hard. You guys visit sometimes too, don't you? Every now and then. But maybe I should have visited more often. Hey, Hero. How are you feeling? I am okay. I'm glad we're all here to see her. Hey, Mari. I'm sorry I haven't visited you yet. I'm sorry I haven't visited you yet. I was being selfish, I think. It's been so long, but I still miss you more than ever. I'm... I'm sorry I wasn't there. I'm just... really sorry. Hero, you don't have to be so hard on yourself. Yeah, we're here for you if you ever need us. Huh. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Don't worry about me too much, okay? Here. This is for you, Mari. From all of us. Do you want to have a picnic with Mari? Yeah. White egret orchid. In the language of flowers, it symbolizes the phrase, "My thoughts will follow you into my into your dreams." Old beardy. The spirits have been howling all day. I pray for this neighborhood. Someone will be grieving tonight. Is he foreshadowing? person got bread. Bread. Smells toasty. Let's get out of here. I was not ready for that. Uh, I just want to go back to my little happy world. Why is the door open? Don't do this shit. 
You got trash. Oh, Kenna's. All American guys' eyes are fixated on the TV. Number 85 was wide open. What kind of pass was that? I don't play sports or watch sports. I think it's boring. All American mom. The last pie I baked smelled a little strange when I took it out of the oven. I hope I'm not losing my touch. Oh, there's more trash. Put it in the trash. Dude, your trash can is right next to the TV. Right here, dude. Gonna see our little friend? Nope. Green juice in a can. A custom made fish tail you can wear over your feet. <laughs> what? I guess the wife is a beach girly. Oh, it's the kid. Hey, neighbor. How's it going? Blue haired girl. Hey, Cal. Oh, and who else is with you? Oh, wait. I recognize you. It's Sunny, isn't it? Sorry, it's been a while. I think we only met a few times. My family has always lived here, but I was just sent off to boarding school a few years ago. And just came back about three years ago, I think. Hey, Sunny. Chris is my next door neighbor and she's really cool. She's the fastest swimmer in school. But she's in the water people compare her to a mermaid, or a shark, or even a torpedo. Oh, Cal, you never showed on compliments. <laughs> Aren't you trying for the junior varsity basketball team this year? I'm sure you'll be a shoe in <laughs> Dude, is he trying to smash? Well, I'll try. I've been playing every now and then with strangers at the park. I think I'm getting better, but it's hard to tell. <laughs> but if I practice basketball as much as you practice swimming, I'd probably have a better chance. Dude, he's, he's flirting. He's flirting. Chatters, take notes, he's flirting. And she's kind of flirting back. Smash her pass? No. I'm obviously smashing Hero because he's in college, just like me. And he knows how to cook. He's caring. You know, I care for people a lot. I want somebody to care for me. Make phone streamer. Sorry, I got an email. I got another test result back. Honestly, and besides, even though I love swimming in pools, I love swimming in the ocean even more. I love everything about the ocean. The beach, the sound of the waves, even the smell of seaweed. Ah, uh, <laughs> sorry, I'm gonna sound a little obsessed. If everything is okay, I'll look at the test results later. I'm not ruining my mood right now. <laughs> I'm okay. My, my friend is sad posting, so I'm making sure they're okay. Or they're not, they're sad texting, not sad posting. I just say sad posting because I think it's funnier. Um, that's totally fine. It's gonna be passionate about something, isn't it? Dude, he's such a simp. A wholesome simp. <laughs> I guess. Actually, I think this all started because I went to boarding school on an island and really enjoyed my time there. The ocean reminded me of my friends I made there. I well, hope maybe I can see them again one day. But... For the time being, I guess I'll just be collecting seashells and stuff.
I used to do that when I know I failed a test in college. Look at it when I was ready for bed. Nah, I'm the type of person to where like, I just don't avoid shit. Like, if I get an email for a test, I'm opening it right away. Cause I, it's like the, the anticipation is what kills me. I hope to get happy soon. Yeah, me too. It's like they're going through shit. So, you know. I'll make sure they're okay. You avoid it? Nah, I don't avoid shit anymore. It's probably just the doctor being like, Yeah, your spine is broken. <laughs> That's probably all the email is gonna say when I open it. I've gone semesters where I don't check any of my grades. Giga chat, honestly. Giga chat. I can't avoid the anxiety just amplifies if I do that. Same. 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 Dutch bros coffee, probably. Because Kim is bougie. You know, the story kind of reminded me of this, but Sunny's actually moving away from here really soon. Maybe you could give him some tips on how to handle moving away to a new place. Oh, Sunny is moving? Um, well, being away from my friend was pretty tough at first, but change is just a fact of life. It's the memories we make with them that we should cherish. You know what? I just decided something. If you have any seashells, can you bring them to me? They're kind of hard to find around here, but I'll make sure it's worth it. Do we have any? Please, tell me we have some. Oh, I do have one. I sold feed pics, it's okay? Dude, why don't you share with the chat? <laughs> I'm kidding, Twitch stuff, I'm kidding. That's a joke to make peace laugh. <laughs> it worked. <laughs> Dude, hook, line, and sinker. Anything for peace? No, don't become a simp, please. We don't need any more simps in chat. <laughs> Dude, Kim is my new favorite chatter. Out of all the new users we have, I think Kim is, like, consistently funny. Okay. Did someone say feet chatter for not talking about feet? Should I ban? Should I make feet a ban term? Okay, let, let's actually, let's actually think about this. No. But when is it contextually, like, not bad to say feet? By foot? Like, when you're talking about how far something away is? Last feet spam? <laughs> Hi, baddie. Can we get some yos? Peace runs a fascist chat? Dude, I'm a leftist. Of course I run a fascist chat. Right? That's what the media says. I went to the gym and my foot hurts. But that's not feet, because I've never heard foot pics. I've only heard feet pics. I'm actually debating. Should I ban feet from the chat? I see you, Kobo. I see you trying to skirt the rules. Should I ban feet? Am I anti-American if I ban the word feet in my chat room? It's a unit of measurement? Wait, true. But we do have a lot of EU viewers here. Hmm. I'll think about this. <laughs> if you guys keep abusing the word feet, then I will ban it. But I think we'll leave it for today. But I never thought about that. Because, like, everyone clowns about feet pics, right? But, like, nobody actually takes it seriously. They hardly talk about you specific things though. True. <laughs> Can my sketch card this month be my foot? Ew. I'm actually horrible at drawing feet. I'm really good at drawing hands though. Get okay, back to the game. Oh hey, you found a seashell. You give a seashell to blue haired girl. Wow, it's such a cute one. <laughs> Thank you. Where's my gift? What a conversation to walk back into the room on. Guys, we're we're scaring the new chatter. Guys, we need to stop talking about feet, please. <laughs> please, we're scaring the new chatters. The blue haired girl is fiddling with something in her hands. Hey, no peeking. 
<laughs> They'll be okay. Says you. Jeez. <laughs> Lol, I'm good. We're trolling. We, we do a little bit of goofing and gaffing here. G new chatters should be scared? Hi, Kel and Sunny. If you see any seashells, can you bring them to me? Wait, do I not get a gift? Oh, that's bullshit. She wants multiple? She's asking for too much. Does this count? Nope. But we gotta find more seashells if we wanna smash. belongs to Hector. A bunch of family photos. Hell sure has a lot of relatives. Can someone do my homework for me? Um, maybe for like a hundred gifted subs I'll do your homework. Are we gonna see our friend? Nope. <gasps> Cutscene. What's wrong, hero? Oh, I know. There must be a spider in this room. Don't worry, hero, I got you. Now where is that pesky little... Oh, it's in the trophy. I got you now! Man, she just... eats it. It's alright now, hero. You can take it easy. The spider's gone. Show it to me. Huh? Did you say something, Hero? Show me the spider. Oh, that's right! I'm gonna leave the stream on for my dog! Oh. I don't know if it's the sound or the music in the game or what, but he seems to like watching the screen. Oh my god, that's so cute! I hope you had a good time today, Ryan. And hi, Ryan's dog. Well, thank you, man. Glad we got to chat with you more today. Hope you had a good time. I hope to see you again, man. That's honestly so cute. <laughs> Dude, if I had a cat, my cat would be an iPad cat. Maybe the dog likes it, because, like, you know how a lot of the music is kind of boppy? And, like, you know how it seems like... It's like you know how there's like different tones and frequencies. I feel like this game probably plays with that. Dogs like peace and I swear all animals love me. Cause when I went to my friend's house to meet uh, their cats for the first time, and they're very reclusive, they immediately liked me. They immediately like ran up to me and like were nuzzling. All dogs woke up to me. I heard a rumor that peace is an iPad baby when she eats now. Okay. You know, when I watch videos, the thoughts go away. Make phone streamer. Yeah, good luck at work, man. I had your stream on around my dog and she didn't care. Well, I can't win over everybody, it seems. Not for everybody. Here, look. See? It's really dead. I'm gonna go flush it down the toilet now, okay? Dude, wasting water. Just throw it in the trash. And I'm back. But the spider is gone. It's like magic.
I'm literally on my iPad right now. <laughs> okay, isn't that such like an anxious Zoomer thing to have like two screens on? Like you're on your phone scrolling TikTok and have a hand and have the TV on? It's me all the time. I allegedly used to do people's math homework in college. At least, hopefully you got something from it. Either it be money or just more practice. Just don't- FBI might be watching, so don't let them hear. Also, new sub rule, everybody. Can we get to a million subs? Jeez, we're at 70 subs. You guys are crazy. I never thought I'd see that number again in my life. What's the thing? I forgot markers? What are you doing? Oh, pens? Are you trying to find out what pens I use? The Kylie art pens are pretty good. If you're looking for good gel pens, I'd recommend Sakura gel pens. But hi, Nix! Can I get some yo's? Ah, thank goodness. Hero, or oh, hero. I feel like your fear of spiders has gotten worse. You should really try to work on that. Oh, you need to buy some pens? I see. Yeah, I would recommend V-ball pens for like regular ballpoint pens. Because it's pressurized ink. You just can't bring them on an airplane, but they glide pretty smoothly. You do have to put a bit pressure a bit of pressure down, but usually the ink dries pretty quickly. For V-ball pens. Uh, make phone streamer. What if a spider shows up and I'm not here? There's just GG's. He's gonna have to Sudoku. You really think- Oh wait, wrong voice. You really think that could happen? Man, hero. This is one of those rare times where I feel like the big brother. Oh, back here. We gotta play some video games? <laughs> what is Kel doing? It's not even playing. Of course the quiet kid is gonna be good at video games. Okay, let's go home. I wanna see the treehouse. Walkie talkie. Bye, Nix. Don't get fired. Jeez. <laughs> but thank you for popping in. <laughs> Sorry. <then. laughs> Wait, is it evening already? Okay, hero. Bye, Nix. It looks like the sun is about to set. Did you want to go see the treehouse now, Sunny? No. How is it evening already? The lighting never changes throughout the game, and that is what kind of bothers me. Let's see if Basil's home at least. Oh, he is. Basil? Aw, oh, they didn't bring her wheelchair. Basil's not home. Polly. Basil's lived with his grandma since he was a toddler. His parents always seem to be too busy. I've only ever seen them once. Okay. Controversial. But if you're this type of parent to where your kid is always with a babysitter, you're always out of town, and you spend, like, let's say, as little time as possible with your kids. 
not a good parent. Like, why'd you even have a kid if you're not gonna care for them? Like, money is not gonna equate to love. <laughs> Thank you for your help again. You're all such genuinely nice people. Okay, there's no party. So we came too early. I think the last thing that said was a timed event in the evening was the hamburgers. Oh, we should all drop by later in the evening. Okay, it's not time yet. Having leftover Chinese? Very nice. Wait, I should have my lunch. It's it's 2.30. It's past my lunch time. I'll have my protein shake. Ooh, those crab rangoons are so good. But they're always way too expensive. A lot of places near me will charge like one to like two dollars per. Oh, uh, my protein shakes? Um, they have chocolate, vanilla, and strawberry. I chose strawberry and vanilla. This one's strawberry. Pork fried rice, sesame chicken, and egg roll? Okay, I feel like sesame chicken is basic, but it's always gonna be good. <clears throat> it looks like the sun is about to set. Did you want to go see the treehouse now, Sunny? Yes, sir. Wow. I guess you really are moving away, huh, Sonny? When I see this empty house, it feels so sudden. But for you, moving away must have been a long time coming. I hope you can find some peace out there. Or, you know, some happiness. There have been a lot of things that were unsaid these past few years, and painful memories that we kept to ourselves. But even through all that, I'm relieved that we were still able to become friends again. I'm happy that we're all here. So that we can face this together. The despair. XQC despair. <laughs> Sorry. Hero's sad face is so funny. Should I make a PSA2 despair emote? <clears throat> it's okay, Hero. I'll go first. Hey, Sonny. When you move away, do you think it'd be too much trouble if you could... Aubrey! Sonny! Are you guys coming? I thought somebody died. A actually... Never mind. It's nothing. Dude, was she trying to smash? Can I do it? It's evening now. Toys long forgotten. Discolored by weather. Oh, that's the stump. Oh, did they cut the tree down? This is where Mari... Yeah. It is. Oh, trigger warning. It feels like forever ago. But I can still remember that day perfectly. 
That... That day was really busy. In the morning, I went out with my mom to buy some nice clothes and shoes. We spent all day shopping and didn't get home until the afternoon. I remember that day, too. I went out to get a haircut with Dad. Oh, yeah. You were there with your dad, too, Aubrey. We were preparing for something, weren't we? Yeah, we were. We were going to watch Mari and Sunny's music recital. It was supposed to be that night. But... Sorry, I thought I heard a rumbling. There's a car outside. I thought it was the game. <laughs> well, when we came home in the evening... Even after all this time, I still don't understand why she did it. I... I don't know if any of us ever will. Hey guys, let's, let's keep going. A pinwheel blows freely in the wind. I'm scared. Oh. The treehouse is still here. This place has seen some better days, but it looks like everything is right where we left it. All our old stuff is still here! Hey look! Here's our playing cards! I was the best at card games, wasn't I, guys? Mr. Plant Egg? Oh, you're so dirty! Look at all these old books. So this is where all my cookbooks went. Ah! I think I just stepped on a jack! Oh man, such good times. Guys, we're having a very serious, like, emotional moment in, like, the coming-to-age teenage film movie. And you guys are talking about takeout. What is wrong with you guys? I personally prefer, um, dim sum over takeout. Hmm. Why did we have a toaster in here? <laughs> Oops. Oh, it's the last picture. Don't forget. It's in the toy box. You put the toy box key in your pocket. Hey, look! Sunny found a photo of us! Is it gonna be like a note? Or it's like her beating heart? We all look so happy. Wasn't there a photo missing from the photo album? That must be it. Hey, you're right, Kel. Take out your photo album, Sonny. We should add it in. Basil's memories. I love the voice of Kel. I'm glad you like it. Because it kills my throat. <laughs> but I think it's so funny to give Kel, like, this voice. Because it kind of reminds me of, like, a kid who's going through puberty. He's trying to sound, like, more mask than he is. Because <laughs> Kel, like, seems to be, like, a little bitch. But he's, like, athletic. And I think that voice is perfect. There. Now the photo album is complete again. 
You know, this is probably the last time we'll all be together in this treehouse. Now that the photo album is complete, we should look through it one last time. Good idea, hero. The photo album is already out, so might as well, right, Sonny? Let's start from the beginning. Okay, so we've seen these all... We've seen all these photos before. So I'm only... I'm only gonna look at the new one. This one looks... Oh, it's faded more so because it's been in the treehouse for years, probably. Who got auto-modded? You sound like an old lady, was the band term. You sound like the old lady in the Spongebob episode with the chocolate. CHOCOLATE! I don't remember what she says. All I remember her saying is CHOCOLATE! <laughs> August 14th. Ta-da! All summer, we've been working on a treehouse in Sunny's backyard, and today it's finally finished! Here when his dad did most of the work, but Aubrey and I made paper plants to put in the windowsill. We all did a pretty good job, if I do say so myself. Are you done looking at the photo album? Yeah. Oh, Mori. I miss her so much. Hi. I miss her too. Hey, come on guys, why the long faces? Look at all of us back together again. Mari would be so happy for us. Yeah, you're right, she would be. If only Basil could be here too. Ooh, is Aubrey- is Aubrey gonna like- have some tea? I- Basil had to do something. Huh? Hey, Aubrey, what's up? Oh, dude. Okay, where is the toy box? That's Aubrey's bat. A baseball bat. Mari used to play softball, but quit when she injured her knee. Arby stuffed toy, Mr. Plant Egg. A toaster. A calendar. The date of the recital has passed. Obvi. Plants made from paper. <laughs> what a gauge sport. I mean, it seems like she was dating hero so maybe she's like straight or bi we don't know because uh, uh, i don't want to go too deep into it but you never know what people are struggling with so it's important to be as kind as you can to people and you should never blame yourself for somebody else's struggles like you should not feel guilty if, like, your friends or your family are sad, or if someone you know is struggling, you can't feel like it's your fault or that you didn't provide enough support because everybody has their own limits and whoever is struggling has limits on what they share as well. So, yeah. Well, what if it is your fault? Well... If you feel like you've wronged someone, then you need to communicate effectively and explain your actions. Because I feel like a lot of people, when it comes to social interactions, there's a lot of uncertainty, a lot of miscommunication. So don't... If you, like, did something wrong or did something to piss somebody off or, like, did something petty, just apologize. Genuinely apologize. And, like, talk it out. So what you're saying is ghost them? No. No. TLDR. You never know what somebody is struggling with. So, just be kind. Because you never know how much 
negativity that person is facing either externally or internally. So if you can be a light in their life, I think that's more than enough that you can do. Or that's like the bare minimum you can do. <clears throat> Plants made from paper. Aubrey and Basil made these together. Do you believe in karma? Okay. I believe in karma, not in the, like, philosophical sense. Like, I don't think the earth puts that negatively back towards you. I think karma is more in the sense of, like, individual interactions. So, like, if I'm shitty to my sister, subconsciously over time, she's probably going to be more negative than me. But, like, if I'm just shitty and being rude to, like, people I don't know... Those people aren't going to have too much of an impact of my own life. Not saying that I'm going to be rude to people I don't know. But I think that I'll have less impact on my life in general. Because a lot of people... Okay, I'm agnostic is what I'll say. <laughs> I'm agnostic. So I don't think there's any higher power controlling any outcome of life, whatever. But I think a lot of your immediate connections, like friends, family, coworkers, and everybody within that kind of circle, a lot of how they interact with you is dependent on how you interact with them. Because it's very easy for someone to shift a negative opinion of you. Have you ever been mean to someone on purpose? No, not really. Only person I will get kind of like bitchy with is my sister, but she knows whenever I get in those moods, it's kind of warranted. I think heaven is wherever we want it to be. Yeah, your mom's house. <laughs> you know what is some chatter's personal hell, though? Watching ads, because everybody, we are four hours into stream. So it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad-free viewing all month long. Or... You can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe. See if you have a Prime sub available. Non-subs get sent to hell. By watching ads. <laughs> that was so bad. <laughs> your heaven is a Taco Bell with free Taco Bell. But then think about the workers. They don't work for free. Okay, I actually need to use the restroom. So, chatters? You know the drill. Everybody, put your favorite emotes on the screen. Or in chat and they'll show up on screen. Ain't no way. I'll be right back. Um, no music, actually. Uh, just sit in silence with your thoughts, everybody, please. Yo, 
I forgot to put it in emote only mode. <laughs> Oopsie. Did somebody say a bad word? Foot micro. What is that spam, Patty? What is wrong with you? I did wash my hands. Don't worry. So stupid. Oh my god, I can't. Okay, let's play the game, everybody. Wait, did I run an ad? Let me check. I Okay, I did. Because... If anybody streams, I don't use the little button. I use the slash command commercial. So sometimes I forget. Okay. <clears throat> Back to work. Can we have a stream with an ad every 10 minutes? Wait, I can actually, because I don't know how often you can run ads. Let's see. How often can you run ads on Twitch? Okay, so Twitch recommends the Twitch help article running ads. Wait at least 15 minutes between ad breaks. Huh. <laughs> Go Bobo with the great ideas. Everybody would cancel me if I ran an ad every 15 minutes. Even though that's what the big boys do. <clears throat> Heroes cookbooks. Mari bought them for his birthday. Kel's old shoes. He forgot his stuff at your house frequently. Typical Kel! And the big boy streamers stink? Okay, what if I become a big boy streamer? Would you guys all become hate watchers? Everyone would sub? Okay. Chatters. Out of all my subscriptions, prime example today, I usually have uh, um, five people who sub with prime and then seven to ten people who manually subscribe or have the recurring sub. So that means out of all my regular viewers or lurkers too, only I only have guaranteed about 15 subs every month and that's with one ad an hour so you guys think do you guys think i could triple my sub count if i ran four ads every hour i don't think so everybody would click off yeah you guys go crazy with my channel i have no idea why am i pick me girl Uh, usually with channels my size to have this many subs, um, they do um, different types of content, we'll say. So, thank you. A yo-yo. You only knew how to walk the dog. You're funny slash for real for real? Thank you. I mean, I feel like there's a lot of hidden gem small streamers. It's just... It's hard for people to get discovered, and then also people don't know what to do when they start getting bigger. Emote only chat. <laughs> oh, I did sub only chat. Oopsie. <laughs> Emote only chat, everybody. <laughs> Have fun. Spam your favorite follower, your favorite sub emote, favorite anything. Oh. You know, after everyone drifted apart, I felt so alone. But now I realize I was the one who was pushing everyone away. 
In the few months after Mari died, everything changed so fast. Sunny and Basil became more closed off. Cal made a bunch of friends playing sports. And heroes always seemed to be busy studying. I was so angry at how life kept moving on. I felt like everyone abandoned me and abandoned Mari too. But I couldn't see that everyone was dealing with the pain in their own way. After Sunny stopped coming to school, I saw Basil sitting alone during lunch. So I asked him if he wanted to study together at his house. He seemed kind of uneasy about it at first. And after I begged him, he agreed. The walk there was really quiet. Basil wouldn't even look at me. And when we got to his room, I tried to talk to him. But he said he had to go to the bathroom and ran off. That's when I spotted his old photo album on his bookshelf. I just wanted to go through the photos because... Well... I guess I just wanted to see everyone happy again. But... When I opened it... Basil had blacked out all the photographs and marker. I couldn't believe it. He had even blacked out Mari's face. All our memories together? I felt like he had destroyed them. I was so confused and angry. I thought he was a nutcase. So, instead of trying to understand him, I stole his photo album and started calling him a creep and things like that. And eventually, I wasn't the only one calling him names. I feel like scum for that now. But you know what? Ever since then, all I've been doing is trying to cut myself off from everyone. It's kind of funny. What I've been doing is worse than what Basil did, yet I'm the one who was angry at him. I'm such an idiot. Hey. It's okay, Aubrey. We've all made mistakes. At that time, I didn't really understand what was happening. I was afraid that I'd somehow made things worse. So I just decided to stay out of it all. I'm really sorry, Aubrey. And I'm sorry to you, Sonny. I was a pretty crappy friend. You were still pretty young then, Kel, but I'm the oldest. So I should have known to take care of everyone. I... I just... Ah. Huh. No. No, it's fine. Everyone's here now. So it's okay. I don't... I don't deserve friends like you. Don't be silly, Aubrey. Of course you do. During all this time, it's pretty obvious that you still cared about us. I mean... Just look at the photos in the photo album. There's no trace of any of the black marks they were you were talking about anywhere. You can see all our faces just fine. I don't suppose they all just clean themselves, did they? It's alright, Aubrey. I promise from now on. <coughs> Sorry, I hate Kel's voice. It's alright, Aubrey. I promise from now on I'll always be there for you. Yeah, I promise too. We should all be here for each other. Hey, you know what? I think this is the perfect time for a big group hug. Group hug? Ah, uh, yeah, count me in. Wait, just one second. Ready or not, here we come. home later today. I need to apologize to him. And I think right now he's probably the one that needs us the most. Sad. You guys are free. You'll best behave. Now 
I can say all the bad words I want. No! No, don't you dare say the P word. P words equals ban. But this is all American family. So I have to go to the birthday party, barbecue, and there's one more thing. Oh! Oh, the grandma died. Oh no. That was a ghost! Rip Bozo? Jesus Christ, man. The grandma was terminally ill. Just like I'm gonna be. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Reporter. I work at the news station in the city, but sometimes I drive to Faraway Park during my breaks. There's just something really relaxing about this place. <laughs> Peace. <laughs> nah, I'll be fine. I'll just be bedridden when I'm like 40. Guys, I'm gonna pull the disabled card whenever I can, because I think it's funny. It's the only way I can cope. No, don't say the feed word. I will ban it from chat. Hamburger. Sorry, it's my sister. Yeah, I don't like furries either. <clears throat> hey champs! Here's one burger for each of you, as promised. You got four hamburgers. Wow. It's been a long time since I've seen all four of you hanging out. Reminds me of when you were still children. <laughs> Aware. Sonic! Good luck with moving away tomorrow. Remember to visit every now and then. I know Kale is gonna be lonely without you. Ah, Dad! Stop it, you're embarrassing me! <laughs> Here's a lesson from your old man. As you get older, it's gonna get harder and harder to make friends. So if you think you have a good one, it's important to cherish them. Friends can be for life, you hear me? Shut up, but too real, too real. I'm walking away from my father. No, I'm not doing a Roblox stream. That's another reason why I'm not doing Minecraft. Because I don't want little, literal five-year-olds watching. No, I think people like the furry suits because it's like escapism. That's why they like it. They don't necessarily want to smash. Some people do, but not all furries want to smash in the suits. I know that. I watched a Vice video on it. Okay, Mac, if you're gonna stream and play Roblox and Minecraft, you're gonna have literal children viewers. You're not gonna have any subscribers because they're gonna be stealing their mom's credit cards and getting in trouble and banned from watching your stream. You you do not want to play games that are gonna attract literal children. Okay, what do I need to do? I did my barbecue. The birthday party and then basil. But it's my channel. I can do what I want with it. I would sleep on it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. We'll talk about it later, Mac. Who <laughs> feet sleeping stream? <laughs> oh my god, that go crazy. Would you ever sleep on stream? I thought about it. I wanted to do it as a gag, but I can't sleep comfortably without having like no layers of clothing on besides like a shirt and undergarments, okay? So I, I would, it would be a sleeping stream, but I don't sleep. Hi everyone, come on in. 
The party's already started. I don't blame it. Yeah, I overheat way too easy. I want to save up to get like a cooling mattress. Because one of my friends, I think, has a cooling mattress. But they don't want a cooling mattress. But I also don't want to use their mattress because that's gross. So... Because my mattress insulates way too much heat. Dude, look at Kel just chowing down. Are cooling blankets a thing? I don't know. I'm trying to save for... Or my friend might buy me a weighted blanket for my birthday. So I'm trying to find some cheapy ones. Because I, I like to sleep with, like, three layers on, because I like the weight of it. I would do a sleeping stream where I wear my outside clothes in bed. Okay, the only gimmick that I like about sleeping streams is when people play, like, super loud videos that wake them up. That is the only good sleep stream content. Otherwise, it's boring. I feel like a big reason why people, or the bad degen people, watch like sleep streams is so they can, they have their eyes glued to the screen, waiting for you to like, waiting for your pajamas to like ride up a little bit too high. Or your shirt to write up, and I feel like that's icky. Because, like, all I can think about, because when I when I think of any content online, I think of both the actual substance of the content, and then also the target audience. That's why, like, I'm very adamant against, like, kids posting content. Because when I think of, like, kid content, I think of P-E-R-Vs, Okay. So it's hard for me to not think about like the negative people online. <clears throat> Please relax and have some food. You can stay as long as you like. Reasonably. I'm gonna stay all night. An unfinished plate of food. An unfinished bag of potato chips. I haven't been to a party like this in a long time. We have parties in college too, but they're not as, uh, quaint. I'm glad everyone is enjoying the food, though. It's the culmination of our hard work. A big old chicken roast. An old pie. Well, today is our last day together, huh, Sonny? It's nice that we have a chance to celebrate with everyone before we head off for new horizons. Just enjoy yourself and relax for now. We're in good company. Salad. Ew, I hate salad. I would take the rose home with me. Would you just, like, shove it in your pants? In your pockets? It'd probably be very warm. It could be like little hand warmers. <laughs> A tea room. Best not touch it. These are prone to getting lost. Gruff guy. Rambo Gumbo. Vance. Oh yeah. Free food. When's the birthday stream again? Mon- Shit. No, I didn't want to leave! Is it over? Oh, it's not over. Okay. April tw Monday, April 24th. I'm gonna be- I'm gonna be streaming on my actual birthday and then celebrating with friends after. Hey, it's you! Darn! I guess this party isn't cool anymore. <laughs> Just kidding. Nerd. Anyways. Abby told me you're moving away tomorrow. That sounds kind of sucky, but I'm sure you'll be okay. Oh, that wasn't me grumbling. That was my stomach. I better start on this food before it's all gone. Yeah, look at Kel. Parties aren't really my thing. But this is kind of nice. Hmm. And I guess it's true what they say. Food always tastes better when you cook it yourself.
Okay, I want to check the church one more time, because the only thing left to do is basil. There's a cat. Oh, we didn't see the black cat that ran away earlier. The orange cat looks hungry. Feed it some fish? Yes! The cat left a gift for you. You got trash. Thank you. My next special day is my cake day? What? What type of cakes? The food kind, right? The spirits have been howling all day. I pray for this neighborhood. Someone will be grieving tonight. Oh yeah, Basil's grandma died because we saw the ghost. Reddit join day is your cake day? Mac, you are perpetually online. Oh my god. Jesus. Redditors. Ban all Redditors. <laughs> Dude, I can't. Twitch and Reddit goes hand in hand, but Reddit is kind of like, ooh, red flag. I don't even have a, uh, I don't even have a Reddit account. Me neither, and it's gonna stay that way. Okay, let's rip the bandit off. Oh, thank goodness you guys came back. Is something wrong? Well, Basil's back home, but he's not talking to me. Oh no. Is there anything we could do to help? It's a bit hard to say right now. When Basil came back, he went straight to his room and locked the door. I haven't been able to get a word out of him since. Maybe he just needs some time alone. But, I don't know. I'm just worried. Did you guys try to talk to him? Of course! We'll do whatever we can to help. Thank you, everyone. Feel free to come in whenever you're ready. I didn't see any dogs running around. Oh, I can go in the artist's house. Oh, the dog came back. Yay! Smile. Hey, have you guys seen my idiot little brother Angel? I gave him some money and sent him off on some errands this morning, but he hasn't come back yet. Knowing him, he probably just forgot. If you can find him, can you check up on him? Tell him his sister is growing impatient. Okay, I think we saw him at the comic book store. unfinished painting. My Reddit is a private thing. I think Mac looks at memes. A diary? Do you want to look through faux facts? Faux facts by Angel. Do you think Genshin Impact is a red flag? I think it depends on their playtime and also how much money they've spent. Because I think anybody who spends excess amount on any gacha type game is a red flag. Because then they're spending less money on buying new treats. So yeah, I think it's a red flag. <laughs> a 
stinky poop. <laughs> oh my god, that's me, Kel. Knife. Quiet. Mystery. Oh. Thank you for reading! <laughs> me trying to make a webcomic? buy one thing of meat. Damn. Okay, well, before we go to Basil, we need to go to the comic book store, because that's where Angel is. And before we do that, we can sell some trash, get some money, maybe buy something. Because I want to see if I can afford to buy another fish. Because we still haven't found that black cat from earlier. R slash anti work. <laughs> Wait, did I talk to this person? Oh, short hair girl. This is the first spot where I met my crush. I hope he comes by soon. Oh, wait, I have to sell my trash. Put it in the trash. Hello, youngins. I don't know if you've been watching where you've been stopping, but there's quite a bit of trash around this town. Dude, one dollar per bag of trash actually scam. I do so much free work around here, they're exploiting my free labor. Go home, your sister is worried. Hey Angel, your sister is looking for you. She said she sent you on some errands earlier today. Huh? Errands? What errands? Oh, poor rat! I forgot I was supposed to buy some art supplies to her this morning. Uh, uh oh. So that's why I had that money in my pocket. Oops. Hey, uh... When you're talking to my sister... Did... did she look angry? No, she looked happy. She was concerned more than anything. <laughs> Is that so? Well, you can never be too sure, can you? Bald dads are hot? Bald isn't bad, it's natural. Okay. Not liking somebody who's bald is like not liking women with gray hair. It's just natural aging. There's nothing to grab. Mods. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That's when you just grab their neck. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, have you guys heard of Johnny Sins? <laughs> yeah, no, yo, I'm not live. <laughs> my mom told my dad she'll leave him if he goes bald. What? I thought they loved each other. <laughs> I should probably head back now. Just to be safe. I'll catch up with you guys later. I, uh, I gotta go. I only have three dollars? Okay, no more fish for me.
An empty picnic basket. Would you like to save? Yes, sir. You know what else you guys can save? My channel by following. It's free to follow. If you're new here and you like what you see, click the follow button. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. And if you're already following, make sure your notifications turned on. That way you don't miss a single stream. I was gonna make a joke, but I don't want to trauma dump. As long as it's not crazy. And it's actually funny. Is it appropriate to say you're hot? No. Don't sexualize your streamer. I don't like being- wait. Do I have a command for that? Exclamation flirt. That's not the command. I actually have a command for that. Let me hold. Let me find it. Actually. It's a mod command. One time I hit on piece and she yelled at me. <laughs> I want Channel 4 Redemptions where I get compliments. No, you guys would literally be way too happy to get those. Oh, this was it. This is the command. Please, chatters, no simping in chat. Go touch grass. Do not itemize, idolize, or sexualize the streamer. She is not your online girlfriend. Respect her boundaries and do not direct vulgar messages to her whore. Call her pet names, etc. It makes her uncomfy. Be a wholesome chatter, please. Yeah, that's the command. Exclamation simp and shit. Yeah, I don't... Because I had a chatter a while ago. They were like a somewhat regular chatter, but they, they haven't chatted in a long time. But they opened with, Hey, beautiful... And it was like they're probably their fifth time chatting. And I was like, whoa, stop it. Because, like, once you start, like, itemizing or, like, using pet names with somebody you don't fucking know, freaking, like, a YouTuber, streamer, anybody online, it just. The dynamic is weird. And you don't want S T A U L K E R's, no matter if they're, like, grills or guys. Is calling you a weenie hut junior? No, I'm a big kid. Okay, I'm almost done with my drink. I'm gonna finish my drink. Oh, a, a thing that I want to clarify is you can be like, in general, in general, when I say you, I mean in general. Um, you can say, oh, your hair is cute. Or your shirt is cute, but you cannot say you are cute, because when you're pointing at a specific thing, you're not putting the person on a pedestal, you're putting like the item that they're wearing, or like their hair. Your Pikachu is cute? Yeah, I got it in Japan. Okay guys, only call your girlfriends and shit cute and hot. Only call your girlfriends. And boyfriends, I guess. And, and be friends. And be friends. <laughs> Only call them pet names. Don't call randos online. <laughs> anyway, rant over. How long is the game? It said it would take four hours once I got all the keys. And it's been four hours. But we're also stalling. So probably another two hours, hopefully. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't... Because like when I was looking up tutorials... It said four hours, but I didn't, like, read what the content was, because I don't want spoilers. Your outfit slays. My PJs are shook. I'm wearing joggers, but you can't see them. But thank you. I like this top a lot. <gasps> I call moms hot. Is that okay? Yeah, because they're not in chat. Stream elements got me acting up. Well, you guys like robots now? To each their own. Let's go talk to Basil. 
what happened to the Eevee on the chair? It didn't, like, sit well, so even if I taped it, it- because it was filled with beans, so it was too heavy to stay on the chair. Like, anytime I moved, it would fall off. Just like my channel. Oh, cutscene. Hey, Basil. It's Hero. I'm here with Cal, Aubrey, and Sunny. We're all here to see you. Is there anything we can do to help? Is Basil dead? We just want to let you know that we're here. Let us know if you need anything, okay? Maybe he just needs some time to himself. I'm really sorry to bother you. Don't worry about it, Polly. We've all been there before. If I've learned anything from these past few days, is that friends should be there for each other. Hey, Basil. This is Aubrey. I just wanted to say that I'm sorry for the way that I've been treating you. Will you please say something? We just want to know that you're okay. I think we should stay here for him. Yeah. Last time we all made the mistake of leaving each other when we needed each other the most. This time, we'll stay together. Polly, do you think we can sleep here for the night? Oh, you're all so kind. Of course you can stay over. I think Basil would really appreciate that. I know it would mean a lot to him. Awesome! I call the couch! Oh, this is all happening so fast. S okay then, since Kel wants the couch, everyone else can have a quilt. We have a lot of those. I'll go grab them now. Dude, how can Polly not know that the grandma's fucking dead? Does she not pick him up at the hospital being like, Oh, where's grandma? you get the couch? Well, duh. It's because I called it first. Ow, that hurt! Do y'all like Chipotle? I've never had Chipotle. I want to try it, though. Oh. Oh, Basil. Why can't you see that everyone is here for you? Basil's gonna be dead. Do you wanna hang out with your friends? Yes, sir. have nothing in the UK. <laughs> Their McDonald's is probably better than ours. Ooh. Hey, Sunny. I know this probably wasn't the last night in town you were expecting, but I just want you to know that even though you're moving away tomorrow, we'll always be friends. Ah, that's so cheesy, Hero. Hey, I'm just saying what I'm thinking. <laughs> Hero's always been such a big softy. Just like you, Aubrey. What did you say? <laughs> it's nice to hang out like this again. I've been busy with school and studying. I didn't really have much time to make friends anymore. Well, you'll always have us, I guess. See, I was right. Look who's the softy now. Hm. But yeah, it's true. I know we'll always be there for each other. Just like I know that Mari's still here with us too. She's in the room right now. You know, I hope we'll be able to see Basil before you leave tomorrow, Sonny. 
It would be nice to have a proper goodbye. Yeah. Man, I'm getting sleepy. What the? Is he asleep already? Yep, that's Kel for you. That part of him hasn't changed a bit. Hey, Sonny. Thank you for everything. It's probably been tough for you to leave the house after all this time, but... I really appreciate you for doing it for us. And hey, tomorrow's the big day. I hope you're not too worried about moving to a new place. If anything, you got us. Life gets better. You just have to stay positive. Hmm. Life gets better, huh? Hey, Sonny. After you move away, you should, like, maybe come visit once in a while or something. Yeah. Then we can all go out for some sandwiches. Or maybe we can all go to the park or the beach or just sit at home and watch TV. Who knows? We can do anything. <laughs> that sounds kind of nice. Do you think my new friends can come too? Of course they can, Aubrey. You don't have to ask. The more the merrier, after all. Come on, guys. It's time to sleep already. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Good night, guys. Good night, Kel. Good night, Aubrey. Good night, Sunny. See you all in the morning. Don't worry. Everything is going to be okay. Will you forgive me? My best friend. Please. Oh, it's sunny. Oh, my game just... That was my capture card, not the actual game. I have traveled to uh, Montana because I went to Yellowstone National Park on a road trip a few years ago. Otherwise, not really. Oh, and then I went to Alaska because my grandma paid for a cruise when I was like eight, so I don't remember any of it. But I went to Alaska and Canada. Sunny has entered the white space. I can't run. And I can't hide. Was it cold? Yeah. Just running, running, running. Wait, this is just like Harry Potter. <laughs> Come on. <gasps> home sweet home. Huh? Ew, it's looking at me. Look, his, his head is... The eyes are changing direction. A sketchbook. Take a look inside. There's no drawings. A tissue box. Nothing but static. 
Let's talk to Amori. Says nothing. Typical. A light bulb hangs from the ceiling. Do you want to destroy it? Not yet. That seems like what I'm supposed to do, though. Oh, I can't open the menu. I can't Sudoku. Because I'm not Amori. I'm Sunny. A light bulb hangs from the ceiling. Do you want to destroy it? Yes. It's a friend. What will Sunny do? I cannot run. Attack something. Something drags Sunny into the shadows. Sunny attacks something. It does nothing. Let's calm down. Something taunts... Oh, I missed it. I'm gonna heal first, because I'm afraid. Something drags Sunny into the shadows. Wait, that's the same sound when we find a computer key. The phone. What's for dinner tonight? A um, meal prep. I made pork yesterday. Something bites Sunny. Oh, these are all the previous little villains. Am I facing my past demons? Something entangles Sunny in sticky webs. My speed fell. My attacks do nothing. Let's do a focus. Because I said my attacks increase next round. Gosh, if I face my demons, GG, same. <laughs> okay, my attacks do nothing. I, I just gotta outlive, outlast, and keep calming down. If I faced my demons, one would be me. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh. 
You're gonna go to bed? Okay. Hope you had a good time, NZ. I assume you're a Omori fan, so hopefully I played well. But thank you for following and enjoy the gifted sub. Hope to see you again. Get some rest. Don't let the ants bite back. Don't. Don't let the intrusive thoughts win, please, Mac. <laughs> Okay, this one isn't attacking back. I cannot run. Wait, it was persist! Sunny, persist. Oh, every enemy has a different skill. Something sways in the wind. I'm gonna focus. You feel like your life is in danger. Is that- Trigger warning, trigger warning! Oh, I can only persist now. Sunny persists. Sunny took us to 43 damage! Your lungs tighten up. Sunny took 17 damage. Your heart beats out of your chest. Uh, gotta keep persisting! Gotta keep pulling through, everybody! Sunny took 19 damage. Your fingers won't stop trembling. You hear your breathing begin to steady. Calm down. You hear your heart begin to steady. You're gonna calm down again. Keep breathing. You gather all your courage and learn to overcome. Overcome. Gather all your courage. You got a light bulb. I can't go down. I think this is the path that led to Basil's house. It's a cemetery.
Did, did, did Basil take pictures of Mari dead? Because Basil keeps saying, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, can you forgive me, my best friend? And Basil seems like the type who's like artsy. Like, you know, the cliche serial killer who loves taking pictures of like really gory shit. Because if it was like the police or investigators who are taking pictures, they would not take Polaroids. How dare my message? What did you say? Why are you guys doing like vampire RP in the chat? We're talking about biting your mothers? Weird. <laughs> Weird. This is wrong with you guys. Maybe the police are aesthetic. No, they like killing people. A cab. <laughs> okay. Guys, this is serious. Mari's dead. An empty picnic basket. Would you like to save? Yes, sir. Ooh, Basil's Meadow. Sunny, you're finally here. I've always dreamed that you would come back for me, but maybe it's too late. The truth of that day will be hard to accept. When you see it, you have to stay strong. And if you can, please, forgive me. You got Basil's photo album. I think Basil took pictures. You know who else is gonna get caught doing something bad? The nonsense, because everybody, we are five hours into stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subsribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a Prime sub available. After the end, we're going to keep on playing, so if you don't want to miss a single second, subscribe. Easy clap. Guys, can we stop doing vampire RP, please? Being weird. Stop simping for each other's moms. Oh, wait, I have to turn that overlay off. No emotes on the screen. We hate emotes. You're short enough to bite ankles? Kim's shorter than me. Kim is one inch shorter than me. Don't diss me for my <laughs> vampire emoji. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Okay, I can't press any buttons. Short chat. Hi, Tina. Where is this?
Sorry, I was like actually invested. Hi, Crystal. I did not forget you. We're using the Hunger Games franchise. It's about um, capitalism. And I actually love it. I think Basil was there. Mom. My only daughter is gone. And you? You were my only son. I can't lose you as well. It, it does shine a border, but it's very faint. I missed it. Alright. On a good date, I'll be 5'10. Ideal <laughs> meal. Okay, it's very hard to see the flashing border. Guys, should I get new glasses for my birthday? Okay, I actually can't find it. Oh, there it is, okay. I did not want to go here yet. The door is locked. Can we say the site I buy direct? No. Because I have a very wide face, a lot of women's frames don't fit me, so, so I usually buy men's frames, because they're usually wider. I usually go to America's Best. This person is breathing steadily. There's also something kind of like inherently messed up with media how they want to take images of like traumatizing events and it just seems so exploitative and I think with how sensationalist a lot of modern media has become um, prime example shoot school shootings to where there's either like a mass casualty event, a national disaster, and a lot of people treat it as like yesterday's news. I'm not saying that things should not be covered, but I think privacy of any individual involved should be respected. Like, I don't like when people take pictures of like, crying family members of victims. I think it's so gross. Or like with the recent school shooting in Tennessee, how there was that one picture circling around of that kid crying on the school bus. I can understand that that type of imagery is impactful, but it just seems gross to publicize it. 
Because you're taking a picture that is monetizable. That is showcasing someone's traumas. And like going through a traumatic event. Seeing this, it just... Basil is like fucked up, right? I think Basil is not good. see four kids playing in the forest. Oh, you see four kids talking to a giant statue. You see four kids riding a minecart. You see three kids and one toast. You see four kids climbing a ladder to space. You see five kids having a picnic. You see four kids riding an elevator. You see four kids talking to a whale. I'm so cold, I don't know how to warm up. Get a blanket, yeah. <laughs> oh, not all the beds have a person in it. This one's IV is broken. This person is not breathing. <gasps> Did Basil, like, pull the IV? Yeah, that's the only broken IV line. Did Basil, like, do something fucked up? Is that why, like, Sunny isolates himself? Because I think they were in, like, late elementary when this happened, or very early middle school. The door is locked. Door is locked. Looks like they're carrying somebody up the stairs. Okay, it's someone walking down the stairs. Wait, I didn't get the journal. Okay. Probably Mari at the bottom of the stairs. I see Basil's shadow. This person is not breathing. Some Mori. Basil. Sonny! Don't worry. Everything is gonna be okay. Kappa. I think Basil is evil. 
Mari's calendar. Today is the day of the recital. Wait, I have blood on me! That's blood on my face. C okay, because anytime Basil sees me in the real world, Basil is really scared. Did I kill- Am I going back to my original theory that I killed Nari? Okay, I think what's happened is that Mari unalived herself in the tree, they found her, they took her to the hospital, and she died at the hospital somehow. There's blood on me. Okay, I need to turn my ring light brightness down because it's bothering me. It's also affecting my ability to see my screen. Yeah, there's a little bit of blood on my hands, too. Okay. Okay, I'm not going to go for that yet because I see all these photographs. The blood cannot be washed from your hands. Oh, now I'm trailing blood. Yay. Mari falling down. Getting up? Oh, someone's grabbing her arm. She's, we're getting her up. Wait, I'm like losing fingers in that graphic that pops up. Okay, me clutching to Mari. Another finger gone. Minus three. Okay, this loops around. It's a weird angle. the violin. <laughs> Look at all these instruments. The recital we didn't go to. Play this one. Oh, that one either. Okay. There's no piano. Did I kill Mari?
Hi, Tanuki. Welcome in. Oh, the... Ah! <laughs> an eye. Back here again. Do you want to screw in the light bulb? Yes, sir? Hmm. When I sit in the chair, I'm happy. Nothing's wrong. Everything's fine. Do you want to pick up this photo? Not yet. Hey, it's me! Smile. I can't go outside. It's me pushing Mari down the stairs. Or reaching out to catch her, because I would never kill my sister. Scar can never- and people say that we don't emulate what we see in film. How could you push her? I don't think I did. I don't know. Could be an accident. Guys, it was a Mori, not me. I'm Sunny. Sunny would never- Mari. Oh my capture card glitched. <laughs> okay. The lighting in this area is cool though. I'm not gonna lie. I'm walking really slow. Did I push her down the stairs and tie her up? Rhetorical? Yes, rhetorical. Rhetorical. Don't answer my questions. I just think out loud.
But how would I be strong enough to do that? The toy, the toy chest is there. Maybe someone helped? Yeah, Basil definitely helped. I think it was an accident. No going back. Did she break my violin? I got angry. I pushed her. Didn't mean to push her down the stairs. Oopsie! Now I have a dead body. What am I gonna do? Basil, what do I do? Oh, we should tie her up. But why is Basil at the bottom of the stairs? Wait, that's me putting her on the bed. Yeah, I was gonna say, maybe Basil broke it. And blamed Mari. Because Basil is jealous. Okay, so Mari fell down the stairs. They brought her upstairs, so they're like, oh shit. Maybe she just needs to take a nap. And they're like, oh wait, she's dead. Let's... Do this instead. A very comfortable bed. Would you like to go to sleep? No. I'm gonna go wake up that fucker Basil. Do you want to save Basil? Yeah. I'll save him and then I'll kill him. He's an accomplice. Sonny, it's just you. I'm glad you came. It's... it's so good to see you. I came to you that day. The day Mari died. When Mari... when Mari fell, you... you couldn't have done it. It was something behind you, wasn't it? You're a good person, Sonny. 
I know you're a good person. A good person wouldn't do something like that. After all this time, you finally come back for me. But tomorrow, you're going away. How could you do that? That's mean, Sonny. That's so mean. Ooh, walking backwards. Ah, uh, th there's something all around us now. Can you see it, Sonny? There's no way out of this, is there? Where are you going? Stop trying to leave me! Stop it! Stop it! I don't want to be alone. Not again. You can't leave me again. No. You wouldn't leave me. That's not like you, Sonny. It's something behind you again, isn't it? Ah, there it is now! Do you see it? Stay away! Stay away from Sonny! I'll protect you no matter what, Sonny. You can count on me. When something killed Mari, when something ruined all my photos, I didn't say anything. I don't want people to think it was you, Sonny. Sonny? Sonny wouldn't do something like that. Don't worry, Sonny. I'll save you again. Something behind you. I'll get rid of it once and for all. Sonny? Don't be scared. I'm scared too, but this is for the best. Everything is going to be okay. He's going to kill me. He's going to kill us both. Isn't this the most positive and least depressing game ever? Yes. <laughs> it's great. Everything is going to be okay. What will Sunny do? I cannot run. I can calm down, persist, and focus. Let's focus. Oh, I'm still afraid. I gotta calm down first. You tried to focus, but nausea overwhelmed you. Basil's eyes are red from crying. You want to run. Okay, let's calm down. Not be scared no more. No more, no more. You tried to calm down, but your lungs fought to breathe. Basil reaches inside Sunny. Does three damage. You want to run. Cannot run. <laughs> oh. I mean, killing Basil makes sense because Basil saw me. Do the deed. Oh, uh, okay, I'll persist. Sonny! There's no way out of this, is there? You try to persist, but you couldn't hold steady. Basil reaches inside Sonny. Takes four damage. You want to run. But I cannot run! I have no skills. Tell me, Sonny. Am I selfish for doing this? I do damage. You want to run. You cannot run. No longer have skills. I gotta attack. Sonny. Do you hate me? You want to run. 
Can I run? Still no skills. My attack meter is going up though. Am I finally gonna be able to do an ult? Definitely know what's for dessert though. Your mom. Easy. Please! Stop it! You want to run. You cannot run. Stop struggling, Sonny. I'm... I'm so tired. You want to run. Oh, the attack meter says everything is gonna be okay. The little heartbeat pulse turned into text. See, look at the little bar. <laughs> Everything's gonna be okay. Peace, I do love. <laughs> I still cannot run. No skills? I'm stressed out. But now we're stressed out. I hate that Twenty One Pilots song because I would hear it on the radio all the time. And I didn't know it was Twenty One Pilots. And once I learned it was them, I was like, oh my god, that's why I hated them for the longest time. Best album by them is Vessel, obviously. And then Trench. Trench is actually really good. Still cannot run. How do I do the ult? I can't use my ult. Okay, I have more health than Basil. Basil's gonna die. Oh, wait, actually, uh. <laughs> Maybe Basil might actually kill me. I thought you said ult. I meant like ult. You know, like ultimate attack? Ult? Did I say ult? 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 I'm gonna kill Basil! <laughs> Why? Why won't you stop? I was like, why is my vision half? It's because he stabbed my eye. It's actually a cool effect. It's morning. Gotta follow the cat.
honey. You found your way back home. I don't know if I've ever said this properly, but... I'm sorry for causing you so much trouble. When I gave you my photo album, I really did want you to have it. But somehow, whenever I try to help, I always end up burdening you instead. Even back then. All this pain we've been feeling, the guilt in our hearts, even if you try to bottle it all up, it all comes out somehow. I want to say that everything will be okay. That we have no choice but to carry on. But that's up to you. Aubrey, Cal, and Hero are good friends. You have to trust that they'll forgive us. It's hard to truly believe that, but... The photos in our album, they're not just photos, they are real memories. Our memories! It's proof of our friendship! Hold those pictures close, and remember what you want to protect. <laughs> I'm sorry. It looks like I'm burdening you again. The path to your future will open soon, but only you can decide what to do in the end. It's not much, but I'll be cheering you on. You know the phrase, what would you do if your best friend killed somebody? Would you help them bury the body? Is that why Basil is our best friend? Sonny, let's make some new memories together, okay? Go home yet. I gotta sneeze. <coughs> Your acknowledgement of the truth has come at a great cost, but it is not too late for redemption. Fortunately, you still know the way back home. I gotta go home. Wait, that's not my house. <laughs> I guess I don't know which way is home. Don't forget. It's in the toy box. Oh, the photo album? A shoe rack. Mom's shoes are a mess as usual. God damn it, Mom. have a tow box in here. Baskets full of baby toys. I haven't gotten around to throwing them away yet. Oh, we used to share a room. That's Mari's bed. Almost time. 
You've been through a lot these past few days. You must be tired. We all make mistakes. You've been running from this one for a long time now. It's tough to own up to them sometimes, but you'll forgive yourself, won't you? You can do this, Sunny. You've worked really hard to get to this point. There's only one left. Th There's only one thing left to do now. Is Sunny going to jail? Juvie, at least, because this happened when he was probably ten. Know that I'll always be watching over you, okay? As long as you remember me, I'll be here. Wait! The door's there! Hardware boxes are scattered across the floor. <gasps> no, I don't want to open the box yet. No, 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 no. I don't want to face my demons. I'm... No, 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 no. Not yet, not yet. I want to see in the backyard. We always had a large backyard, so it's nice to finally make use of it now that there's a treehouse. The treehouse is further back. But I can still see my favorite tree. Is it gonna be her beating heart? Yeah, I was gonna say jerseys over long sleeve shirts, kinda uh, too frat, bro. Do you want to unlock the toy box? Yes. It's gonna be my bloody violin. It's the violin. You got a violin. Oh, are we gonna play together? Strands of long black hair are entangled with its strings. You got sheet music. The paper is torn and wrinkled by blood, but it can still be read. An open toy box. I told Joe Omori killed Mari. I mean, Sunny. Oh, she's gone. The cat's gone. A grand piano. The word Amori is etched across the center. Okay, if, like, the kids tried to cover up her death, right? How would, like, a little ten-year-old know what, like, unaliving is? That is, like, very disheartening. Because, okay, I didn't know about suicidal ideation or, like, unaliving until I went on the internet when I was, like, 12. Otherwise, I had no idea. I was clueless. So, it's... It's kind of like, how would the kids know what it is? And then also, like, know how to cover it up. Like, one of them is fucked up. Basil and Sonny, one of them is fucked. Ay, Dios mio. I knew a lot of stuff at a young age, but, like, I didn't learn about those more mature things. Until, like, I went on the internet. Like, it's not like... I don't think you inherently have those thoughts. I think they're learned. 
I don't know. Because I feel like, like, anxiety and depression, that's, like, genetic and then also, like, situational. Like, trauma can trigger it. But with unaliving, is that, like, instinctual or is it learned? Or, like, ideation, I mean. I'll have to look that up later. I don't know. Anyway, trigger warning. Let's go in the backyard. I can't click on it. Shit. Yes and no. I don't know. Mari's bed. And mine too when I had nightmares. Oh. A very, very comfortable bed. It used to be Mari's, but she switched to me when she noticed I had trouble sleeping. There's only one toothbrush in the cup. I think it... I don't know. I think somehow the violin broke. Sonny got mad. Pushed her. But it looked like she was in a gown already. Like in a hospital gown. Or she was wearing like a dress for the recital. Oh. Cute. His mom pretty, though. <laughs> A nice big TV. Watching Saturday morning cartoons here was the best. A TV remote. Dad gets really mad when it goes missing. Even if it's usually stuck in the couch. Some small toy cars. Kel must have forgotten to take them home again. I'm gonna go outside. Time to face my demons. Let's walk on the sidewalk. I don't wanna get hit. Was shots fired. Hero. Yeah! I got just what I needed. Uh oh, my hand doesn't look so good. You can't just tell people that, Kel. You have to keep a good poker face. Ah, uh, what did you get by me, Mari? I just got here, silly. Here, I brought cookies for everyone. Well, Basil taking a picture. Basil, are you taking a photo? Oh, yeah. Aw, <laughs> oh, man. Don't take a photo when I'm struggling like this. Oh, don't be so dramatic, Cal. It's just a card game. <laughs> huh? Another photo? And what's so funny anyway? Is there something you're not telling us, Basil? Don't worry about it. You'll find out soon enough. Okay, I'm still playing as Sunny. You look at Kel's hand. It's a four, a six, and a six. Hey, don't look, Sunny. It's... it's too horrible. Ah, uh, I'm gonna lose, aren't I? Not if I stack your deck. Hero. Mari's cookies are the best, huh, Sonny? Oh, Hero, don't be so humble. 
You know, your cookies are way better than mine. Hey, that's subjective. Mari's cookies... Uh, Mari's cookies have much more love baked into them. I could eat them forever. Oh, stop it, Hero. You're embarrassing me. Dude, they're, they're smashing. You look at Aubrey's hand. It's a two, a five, and a ten. Hmm. What do you think, Sonny? What should I do? Decisions, decisions. Aubrey's stuffed toy, Mr. Plant Egg. A stuffed toy of a girl with pink hair. An old TV. Cal brought it up here, but was pretty bummed when he found out he couldn't use it. Yeah, you need power, dummy. You look at Basil's hand. It's a jack and an ace. Shh. Don't tell anyone, okay? I'm gonna snitch. Oh. You look at your hand. It's an ace and an ace. Tough luck as usual. Wait, I don't know how to play cards. Is that good or bad? I'm gonna go outside. Are you sure you want to go? Yes. You remembered. The smell of freshly baked cookies. It smelled better knowing that Mari made it from scratch. The violin mended a part of itself. You know, trip down memory lane while staying in the left lane. I think the end is near. Is is a is Sunny gonna like murk himself? That seems like the only solution. Or not solution. The only outcome. Cause I think it's obvious at this point where it's like an accidental death. They try to cover it up as a unaliving. But it's like they were kids, so. Would they ever get, like, punished or prosecuted? I think once you try and cover up a death, that's when it becomes... bad. Bye, Tanuki! Thank you for hanging out! Enjoy your gifted sub with... I'm not... I'm not sure. But you know what I am sure of? An ad break. Because we are six hours in the stream. So... You can avoid that ad break by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad-free viewing all month long. Or you can link Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a Prime sub available. Okay, since this stream has gone on for so long, um, I will be doing a subscriber-only stream tomorrow. <laughs> just a long sub-only stream tomorrow, okay? Okay. We're not- I'm not gonna do an evening stream today. <laughs> I've already gone for longer than I thought. Cause I thought I could beat this in four hours. I subscribed to watch double the ads? What? You know, Twitch streamers? They can enable subscribers to have ads. It's crazy. So like, if I wanted to, if I wanted to be mean, I could just make the subs watch ads as well. <laughs> so that way the only way you can avoid an ad is with Twitch term. Like there's literally a toggle in my creator dashboard that I can enable. So if one day I was feeling mean, I could just do it. <laughs> I won't though, I don't want to betray my viewers or scam. Okay. Hero. Then what's the point of subbing? To get emotes. And that's it. I feel like the Twitch model for, or the benefits to like a Twitch sub could be more. 
but not a lot of creators utilize sub-only streams. I think if it was more common and accepted to do sub-only streams, I think more people would subscribe. But people are kind of shamed to do sub-only because it's seen as exclusionary. That's why I'm trying to do sub-only streams semi-regularly now when I'm very small. That way it's kind of part of my channel culture if I do grow larger. It's a secret club. Yes, sir. Get back to the game. And there, the watermelon's all cut up. Come on, everyone, take a slice. Yay, thank you, hero. Look at you, such a big, strong man. Dude, she's flirting. Ah, uh, not now, Mari. <laughs> Dude, they're, they're smashing. Sorry, I just got really sad thinking. If Mari's death was like accidental, because it seems like Hiro feels very guilty. Like he probably has the guilt that he wasn't like checking in on her enough or didn't realize what could be wrong with her. But if it was like an accidental death cover up, then that's gonna fuck everybody up. No, they're in high school. They're in high school. High schoolers sometimes smash, okay? I feel like that's normal. I didn't. Because I had four failed confessions. <laughs> anyway. Whoa! Nothing beats a nice juicy watermelon on a hot summer day. Story time? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> How would it be an accident? That's why you don't have fights at the top of a staircase. You do it in the living room. As you play Mario Kart. And you like shove your sibling a little bit. You don't shove him downstairs. Hey! Don't take a picture of me while I'm eating basil! Ah, I'm sorry, Aubrey. I just thought you looked cute. I'll show you when it's ready. Well, okay, fine. I trust you, Basil. I can save. Why can I save here? We'll see if that stays. <laughs> Months. It says question mark. I think we're in a time loop. A beach chair. I heard the cat. Are you sure you want to go? No, not yet. Hero's beach bag. It matches with Mari's. Oh, cute. Mari's beach bag. It matches with the heroes. Aubrey's pouch. It fits her perfectly. And fully eaten watermelon. It was delicious. Kel's backpack. It's way too big for him. Would you make a side eye milk? What would that even look like? Can you get a cat for your birthday? I am begging and pleading if I could get a cat. Because the, uh, the current dilemma is at the property owner's house, which is my roommate's father, okay? Nepotism, nepo baby. They have a stray cat that is in their garage and they're like feeding it. It's like litter box trained. It's good. It, it's like in between a kitten and a. It's like a tween cat. And. But they don't want to bring the cat to this unit because this unit is newer than their house. So they're on the fence of a cat. And I, because my sister and my roommate, they'll go to the house and like take videos and pictures of the cat. And I'm like, oh my God, it's so cute. And I finally, the other day, got to see the cat in person. And okay, 
Cats love me. They love me. I've never had an animal not like me. And right when I walk into the garage, like the cat is nuzzling up against my leg. It likes me. And it's so cute. So we we are trying our best to get the cat. Because the biggest concerns I can hear the cat in the game. Because the biggest concerns that he has is um, fur and scratching. But with fur, you just gotta freaking clean. It's not that hard. Already clean, decent already. And scratching. You can have like the little claw caps. I was researching them. And they essentially work as like a barrier between like the actual claw part. So that way when they scratch, they do the motion. They don't actually scratch surfaces because it's like little plastic caps. It's kind of like putting gloves on them. Yeah, scratching posts too, but the, the nail caps will work better. So, because in my head, if there's no demerits to it, or if there are problems, there are solutions, then it should be fine. But ultimately, that's not my say. Because we, when we initially signed the rental agreement, they said no animals, but... You know... You gotta get pet specific cleaning supplies, and that's not a problem. My sister said that she was willing to pay for anything. So... And a cat would literally make me so happy. It'll make my depression literally go away. Like, actually. Because, like, I I'm the type of person to where... Um, I like caring for things. Like, caring for people. Like, I like doing housework. I like caring, okay? So, like, if I had a cat... To be able to put that energy into, like, something... That doesn't need... Emotional care back. I think it would be really good for me. My plastic bag. It's functional. And like a cat will love you and I want love. I'm on my incel arc. Basil's tote bag. It's a little small but he likes it. Relax, unwind, and enjoy. <laughs> my dog didn't make mine go away. Honestly, such a scam. People need different things for healing. But I think a cat would actually really help. Because, like, you know how they have, like, the, um... What's it called? What's it called? Service animals? But then they have, like, service animals that are meant to, like, help with anxiety? How long have they been deciding? A few weeks. Because they found the cat a few weeks ago. Oh my god, thank you for the follow! Plus one, everybody. So, yeah, emotional support animal. I would literally be so much happier. Because I remember when I went to my friend's house, and they had the cats, right? And I saw them, and I was so happy. And I remember I was just sitting in the living room, we were watching a movie, and I saw the cat just, like, sitting on the carpet. And I was looking at it, I was like... Thinking in my head how happy I would be if I could have a cat, and then I started crying. Because <laughs> I was like, oh my god, I'd be so happy. Sorry, I'm actually tearing up thinking about that, because, like, I was so, like, emotional in that moment for some reason. Anyway, I'm fine, I'm fine. <laughs> it's happy tears, happy tears. Are you sure you want to go? Not yet. Tell him you'll make the cat famous? Should I make a cat IG? Guys, 24-hour cat stream. You remembered the taste of watermelon. It tasted more delicious when you ate it with everyone in the hot summer. The violin mended a part of itself. Cat emotes? No, we're not doing that. Mm -mm. Only my face. So that is how I get clumped. Oh, I can run. Okay. Running in the rain. Hmm. It looks like everyone fell asleep. I guess it's just us three now. Everyone must be feeling sleepy after such a big meal. Thank you for cooking for all of us, hero. Ah, it was nothing. I'm just practicing a little. I'm glad you liked it. 
One day, you're gonna be a world famous chef and you're gonna cook me lots of yummy food. Huh? Wait, I am? Of course you are. I believe in you, hero. Well, if you say so. I'm glad you're using your camera more now, Basil. You seem to be enjoying your new hobby. Yeah, I guess it's pretty fun once you get the hang of it. Wait a sec. There's something strange in this photo. Hector? How could you? Yeah, the dog shit. I was literally joking about that, but you can see like a little poop in the background of that picture. Oh, I can move. Oh, we're in memory lane. Oh. Hey, Sunny. I took a photo of everyone earlier. Want to see? Screw Basil, he helped me cover up a murder. This could not have been a good shot, but Hector had to ruin the photo with his poop. Ah, uh, maybe I can cover it up with tape later. Oh, hey little brother. Sorry, did I wake you up? You look so peaceful sleeping there. Reminds me of when you were just a baby. Hey, Sonny. Can I poke your brain for a minute? I really love cooking and all... And Mario always says I'm really good, but my parents want me to become a doctor. Do you think I should become a chef? Yeah, why not? If your grill wants it... Huh. Maybe. We're still young. We could dream big, right? Yeah. Hmm, but yeah. My mom's gonna have something to say about that. Have you ever had a pet? Yes, I used to have a pet rabbit when I was like... Eight? And then he died when he was like eight. Cause we raised him from a baby. But I didn't like he was cute and all. But he wasn't sociable. And the things with rabbits is that they basically live in a perpetual state of anxiety, so they get scared re really easily. Because they're they're prey, right? So I I don't think I can handle a rabbit, because then I would just think about how sad the rabbit is. I like cats because they're more independent. But our rabbit, we had him from when he was a baby because we got him from somebody's garage off of like Craigslist. And then um, he, he passed away because rabbits can live till like 10 if you really try, but he, he had a stroke and then he fucked up his leg. We didn't put him down. He just died one day because my parents couldn't afford to like get him treatment. So, for like the last six months of his life, he just had a fucked up leg, and it felt bad. That's why, like, I told myself, too, I wouldn't, like, if I live alone, if I live alone, I wouldn't have a pet unless I could afford, like, surgery if it needed it, because, like, obviously, if you're sick as a person, or if somebody you live with is sick, you're obviously gonna prioritize and get them procedures if they need it, but a pet, it's kind of harder to financially justify it, you know? That's why, like, you ever hear the stories of, like, oh, I had to put my dog down. But it's like, no. It, in most cases, sensitive topic, okay? Sensitive topic. But it's either a decision of putting them down or getting a procedure done or, like, them living in pain. So it's like... And it sucks. Because, like, we pay out of pocket. Mm. So it's like, I don't want to, like, have a pet if I were to live alone and, like, not be able to afford getting it, like, emergency medical help if it needs it, you know what I mean? Because I, I felt bad for my rabbit because he was in pain for the last, like, six months of his life because we couldn't afford it. <laughs> Your dog is moving further away from you on the couch? Yeah, it's, it's hearing what we're talking about. But definitely, if we had the cat, we would get insurance for it. Everything it needs, we'll buy. And by we, I mean my sister. What do rabbits even do? They sit, look cute, and eat, and shit, and piss. 
Mari's cookies. Hector. Ew, I stepped in the shit. Imagine committing pet insurance fraud? <laughs> Holy. <laughs> I want to leave. You remembered. The feeling of sleeping in Mari's lap. It felt more comfortable because you knew that no matter what, Mari would always keep you safe. The violin mended a part of itself. Clearly, rabbits are for the IG pigs. True. My sister has been watching like a lot of rabbit videos and cat videos. Like literally last night we were watching like cat videos for like an hour. <laughs> oh, wedding? Kel. Hey Sonny, hey Basil. What took you guys so long? Sorry. We got carried away playing this new game where you Fight each other with these things called pet rocks. Basil! Basil! Take a picture of my new raincoat! Oh. Okay. One sec. What did the rabbit look like? Um, he had... His fur changed color over the years. Um, when he was born, he was like a very light, medium... Kind of like a burnt, orangey brown. But since he was an indoor cat, as years went on, uh, he shifted from brown to gray. We called him Nutmeg because of his color when he was a baby. And he had a white and gray tail. When made y'all decided to get a rabbit, my mom wanted a pet and she found a listing on Craigslist for free bunnies in a garage. Yeah, it's kind of like how if you don't go outside a lot, your hair changes color. Like, if you look at my hair, it looks black, right? It's But it's a very, very dark brown. Back when I used to go out more, it was like more of a medium brown. But it, it's basically black now. It's like keratin or whatever. Because different types of rabbits have different types of keratin levels. Like, you know how there's like rabbits who shift from brown to white, typically the wilder or the wild rabbits? He turned into Sunny? Yeah, we've been playing this game for so long. Do you like it, Sunny? It's my favorite color, pink. Ew, pink is a gross color. No, it's not, Cal. You're a gross color. That doesn't even make any sense. Oh, Sunny, that reminds me. Mari and I were talking about dyeing our hair together. Mari says she's gonna dye her hair purple. Purple? You wanna know what color I choose? Pink. Wait, are you saying you wanna dye your hair pink? Ew, that's weird. Why would you ever do that? I don't know. Oh, I think I read the wrong voice. I don't know. I just thought it'd be cute. Mari thinks so too. Hmm. I'll never understand you two and your crazy ideas. I think pink would look good on you, Aubrey. What do you think, Sunny? Yeah. Sunny says he thinks that pink is a great color. Wait, do I communicate through Basil? Because Amori is like, or Sunny, is either like very nonverbal or mute. So it seems like Sunny and Basil communicate, or Sunny communicates through Basil. See? Even Basil and Sunny agree. You're the one who's weird, Kel. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, are you going on ahead, Sunny? Don't worry about us. We'll catch up in a minute. Wait, can I go home?
I can't go home. Yeah, my sister, she has dark brown hair, but sometimes she has like medium brown highlights in it, depending on how much sunlight she gets, and it's really pretty. You remembered. The sound of falling rain as it hits your umbrella. It sounded more calming knowing that you're standing next to your best friends. The violin landed a part of itself. I think it's raining less. Are you sure you don't want to be in the photo, Sunny? Sunny's a bit camera shy. We all have those days, don't we? It's okay, Sunny. You'll get used to it soon enough. Wow, this cake looks so amazing. You really have done yourself your... You've really outdone yourself this time, Hero. Yay. Thanks, Hero. I love strawberries. Basil, Basil, what do you wish are you gonna make? Hey, you can't ask that, Aubrey. Or else it won't come true. Huh? Is that how it works? Then, in that case, I wish that Cal would get straight A's in school. Hey, you can't do that. Oh. A wish? Oh. But what should I wish for? I have everything I could want right here. Cringe. Oh, I know. I think I'll wish for... Just kidding. It's a secret. Aw, I want to know though. Guys, if we don't hurry, the candles are going to melt. Are you? Are we all ready to sing? Yeah, you bet. Did you want to start us off, Mari? Sure thing. <laughs> Anna, one, two, three, four. Pause, I gotta mute, I gotta mute. That was my sister, but it wasn't. It was just my roommate closing his door. <laughs> Oopsie. Coast is clear, everybody. Because usually my sister will text, like if I'm live, I gotta text her that I'm streaming late today. Because usually she'll text me right before she comes to my room, so I was like, where's my text? Happy birthday, thank you. Oh, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you. Yeah, my sister is the same height as me. I'm not singing the song, I'm gonna get copyrighted. Blow out your candles, Basil. Make a wish. Dude, look at Kel. You remembered. Basil smiled as he was about to blow out his birthday candles. But you also remembered. As Basil made his wish, you made one too. At that time, you wished for everyone to be happy. The violin mended a part of itself. Oh, it's snowing now.
If you can't swim, all you gotta do is know how to float. Wow! A new basketball? Thanks, bro! No problem, Cal. You can thank me by doing a little better in school. Uh huh, you bet! <coughs> okay, Sonny. It's time for you to open your present. This year, you. You get just oh wait, Mari, why am I reading in my normal voice? It's Christmas. This year you get just one present from all of us. It probably doesn't look like much, but we all had to save up for it together. Yeah, me and Paisley even started selling cookies and lemonade in the summer. And Mari and I took a job at the bakery for a while, if you remember. Yeah, so they're in late high school. They're like 16 at least. Panic at the Disco is a good band. It was. <laughs> yeah, I don't like the newer stuff as much. <laughs> and me? I had to deliver newspapers every morning for like three months. And you know how much I hate mornings. Well, you know this, Mike? Be a lot of pressure, but it's been a while since you had to quit playing the violin. Mari told us about how you always sit in the room with her when she's practicing the piano. And there was even a time I caught you trying to play your old mini violin, even though it was too small for you. Anyway, this was Basil's idea, but we all decided to pitch in for a really nice one. So, yeah. We hope you like it, Sonny. This is from all of us to you. Like it, Sonny. Go on and try it out. <laughs> Talk to me when you know how to float. <laughs> Guys, the left eats itself. Stop it. <laughs> you felt a tingling in your fingertips, as if it was, as if on its own, your body ready the violin to play. Dibs on breaking it. I want to show up being pushed down the stairs. Oh my god. I think Basil broke it. And then Amori got blamed for breaking it. And then he got mad at Mari. And then he pushed her. Oopsie, he fell down the stairs. You remembered. The anxious feeling in your heart as you played the first note on your new violin. That it scared you, but you didn't mind. Because they believed in you. No matter what. You don't want to dis- You didn't want to disappoint them. Because they were your friends. Because in the pictures, it looked like Basil was at the bottom of the stairs. And the violin was right by him. In the pictures. The violin regained its shape. In fact, Basil was just taking photos too. I mean, we don't know if that was like real or not, right? Because that was kind of in the dream worldy state. Oh. Okay. You remembered. Okay, these are all my memories. Sonny, you're finally here! After this point, it's gonna be up to you. You know, before we met, I had a lot of trouble fitting in. Even after we all became friends. I always assumed you were gonna leave me eventually. Which they did. But, when the others were busy doing things, 
You always seem to have time for me. You would listen to me talk for hours and hours. I could always rely on you to do that. I know we've missed out on each other for the past few years, but it doesn't have to stay that way. People always tell me that I'm denser, that I'm kind of careless, but I'll always be here for you if you're okay with that. Sunny, you know that you're not someone who likes to take the lead. This has been really hard for you, but you have to put a little bit of trust in us too. Cal looks like a coconut head, Loki. Because you've done something bad doesn't make you bad. You've had to live with this pain for so long, and you've been keeping it all inside. It might be easier to ignore your problems, but it's okay to cry about them too. There's more good times to come. Life gets better, and you can be the one to make it happen. Dude, when are we gonna get to read Amori's manifesto? Because he's gotta have one. Modern day Aubrey. Whatever happens next is going to be your call. But we're here for you because you want us to be. And we really hope that this isn't goodbye. Mari's picnic basket. Hello, <laughs> Ma, <Lamar>, what? <laughs> Wait, what did I even say? Did I say? I, I thought I made a joke. What did I say? I actually can't remember what I said. Because I hate my big brain. What did I say? Oh, wait. Omori's manifesto. <laughs> I thought it was funny. I'm an edgelord. You know who else can be a fellow edgelord in chat? New followers. Um, if you follow the channel, you get cool emotes and the ability to type in the chat. And if you're already following, make sure your notifications turned on. Can we hit our follower goal today, everybody? <sighs> I want to save. Backstage. You can do this, Sunny. I promise to stick with you until the very end. Yeah. I think we'll always be best friends. That's the game with you two, right? Where's Basil? Isn't Basil my friend? Whatever you end up choosing, we'll always want what's best for you. Keep us in your thoughts. We'll be cheering you on. No matter how far you push your feelings down, they'll always come back somehow. And what you do with those feelings, that will be your truth. Hey, Sunny. Break a leg for me, alright? We believe in you, Sunny. An empty music stand. Do you want to place down your sheet music? Yes, sir. You place the sheet music onto the music stand. The stage is ready for you. Do you want to play the violin? Why not? This isn't real. None of this matters. I'm gonna wake up and find Basil dead by my own hand. I blush too, everybody. Don't worry. I like making people blush, though, because I'm a flirt. IRL, not in stream.
back here. It's less fun when the person you're flirting with can't tell you're flirting because they're slow. That was actually something that annoyed the shit out of me with my previous partner. Because I'm a flirt, okay? I remember one time, story time, story time. I remember we were like hanging out. We were about to like watch a show or whatever. And we were like sitting on his bed. And I was like, oh. I was like, my shoulder feels kind of sore. And he was like, oh, okay. That sucks. He's like, you want some ibuprofen? And I'm like, shut up, shut up, shut up. I'm an adult. I'm an adult. And I was like, yeah, my shoulder has been hurting all night or like the past few days. And he's like, oh, that sucks. And it's like, bro, you're so fucking dense. You're so stupid. I was obviously, that was an in for a neck massage. And then we'll see where it goes. So stupid. <laughs> But yeah, he was dense as fuck. And then there was one day where I, like, I sat him down. I was like, okay, when people say this, they want this. If somebody invites you over, they're trying to smash. Like, just the basics. If somebody asks to go drinking past 6 p.m., they're trying to take you home. Like, he didn't know basic shit. Yeah, don't flirt with your coworkers or customers. That's weird. Okay, we're back in the blank space. He was like, it's my sister. I might have to meet soon. Good one, Crystal. Good one. Typical. Okay, what will Sunny do? I can't run. Typical. With a violin. Okay, hey, calm down. Encore. Your juice will not fall for three turns. Allegro. Attacks three times. Cherish. Heal your wounds and come back stronger. Oh, okay guys, I have to mute. I have to mute. Writing fanfic about real people is weird. Mods ban Kim. <laughs> Sending myself to jail good. <laughs> okay, let's see. What is gonna be the strat here? Now this is this seems like an actual fight. Okay, Cherish takes no juice. So I think what I need to do, we need to kill him one, okay? But this seems like attacks three times, Allegro. Wait, I have 300 health, holy. That does a lot of damage. Yeah, I know when y'all are joking. I know when, I can tell when y'all are joking. Juice will not fall for three turns? Oh, that. I did it wrong. Okay, let's do Cherish. 
I need more juice. Friends. Friends are supposed to be there for each other. Okay, I got full juice. Full juice. Okay, let's do Encore. That way my juice will not fall for three turns. Then I can use the triple deck. Mori slash Wild. Sunny took a lot of damage. Loki, I get scared people take my jokes seriously. That's why you have to work on a tone and inflection. If it's in person, you can obviously tell when somebody's joking. But like when you're texting or like in a Twitch chat, it's very hard to tell. So, I think you just gotta feel out the vibe. You also have to think about like how your messages look if they're just red deadpan. If it's like too crazy when it's red deadpan, then maybe don't type it. And I mean in general, not just in my chat. Just be mindful. Okay, I did Encore. Wait, I can't do Cherish anymore. What the fuck? Sunny strikes three times. Mori took 47, 61, and 63 damage. Mori did not succumb. Oh, are we never gonna kill Mori? He's bloody now. Okay, let's do Cherish. Sunny studies his breathing. He remembered Aubrey's wish. I hope he can find some peace. Or, you know, some happiness. Amori erases the enemy. Huh. It can't be erased. Let's do Allegro. Wait, I'm doing no damage! You've caused so much suffering, yet you do nothing. And you've earned nothing in return. Oh, he's at a third health. Holy. I need to heal. So when he comes down, he covers 150 health. I like her. Thank you for the follow. Use on whom? Your friends will never forgive you. They'll abandon you like you did them, and that's what you deserve. Amori did not succumb. Ooh! Hands! Very nice. Cherish. You remembered Hero's promise. Last time, we made the mistake leaving each other when we need each other the most. This time, we'll stay together. You tell yourself that you don't want to be a burden to others, but the truth is that you're selfish. You don't want people to depend on you. attacking. Oh, he's at full health again. This is scary? No, it's not. It's a, it's a video game. Video games aren't scary. When do you think about others? How long are you going to let people take care of you? You say you care, but you're a liar. You've never done anything for anyone else. You're useless. Less than useless. You're sick. Dude, hashtag trick. Okay, I have to calm down.
people like you don't deserve to live. It can only calm down. People like you don't deserve to live. Oh, let's just attack. Because it seems like my attack does slightly more damage than Amori's do. People like you don't deserve to live. I'm gonna attack one more time. He has very little health. People like you don't deserve to live. Amori did not succumb. Who is that? Whose face is that? I usually have dinner at like six or seven. Or four, now that I'm on my more rigid schedule, but now, today, since I had my protein shake at two, I should eat at six. Oh! I can't run. Oh, I can cherish. Finally. I guess I could do one cherish per reset. You remembered Basil's hope. Oh. Maybe one day, things can go back to the way they were before. Capo. Your friends are wrong about you. The person they love isn't you at all. You let them believe in a lie to protect yourself. Okay, I'm gonna do Encore. That way I can keep my juice. Oh my god! You're nothing but a liar. And when they see the truth, they'll hate you as much as you hate yourself. Okay, I have to calm down. If they knew the truth, they'll never be able to regain their trust. No matter what you do, it will be hopeless. All you do is make things worse. It would be better if you just die. Oh, I don't want to attack. I need to allegro. It would be better to just die. Gotta come down. I need to heal. Well, that was a lot of health. Holy. It would be better to just die. Okay, I'm gonna calm down. I just need to get some hits in. Oh my god, I, I can't even, like, afford to heal. Or, I can't, I can't... I think, next round, I need to save the Cherish for when I have the lowest amount of health. It'd be better to just die. Don't like, bro. pisses me off mood it's so cute because my sister and our roommate because the roommate is her friend they'll eat dinner together every night and it's so cute and they'll just watch tv because they're literal ipad kids but i usually will eat by myself 
because they usually eat a little bit earlier than they do, and I don't like eating when people are around, honestly. Okay, let's attack! Attack you. <gasps> it would be better to just die. Mori will not succumb. Oh, I have skill! Okay, now I should do Cherish. Because I have very little health. You remembered Mari's request. You'll forgive yourself, won't you, Sunny? Never. You killed Mari. She loved you, and you killed her. <laughs> I didn't do it on purpose. What is this dubstep? <laughs> Too real. I kill this grill. <laughs> Aubrey loved her. And you killed her. I didn't do it on purpose, guys. I was 10. Cal <laughs> loved her. And you killed her. See how he's not mentioning Basil? He partially played the name Basil. I'm gonna calm down. Okay, isn't it well now in some cultures you're like the houses are built to where like it's supposed to be multi-generational? I cannot imagine living with my parents. Like even, because I moved out when I was 23 with my sister, right, and she was 21 at the time. Even that was too long. Basil loved her, and you killed her. I'm gonna, wait, I should not attack, I should. streamer house and invite all my chatters. <laughs> so don't worry. Calm down. Uh oh. Shit. Guys, stream over. <laughs> there was no retry. Come on, Sunny, beat yourself up. Jeez. Hello, Basilite. Welcome in. Can we get some peace eye to yo's? Hello. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. Welcome in. Do you want to continue? Yes, sir. <gasps> I 
I rise. We rise at dawn. Or oh, back here, okay. What would Sunny do? Play. Best part of the game? I mean, we'll see. Damn, we got a whole private hospital room? That's expensive. My mom must be rich. 
Okay, so this is when we wake up after we beat the shit out of Basil. We killed Basil. Flowers from Cal and Hero's family in Aubrey. Sending a little get well sunshine your way. We miss you, Sonny. Nothing but static. Not peace and thinking of the bill? What? I'm a capitalist. Of course I think about that. <laughs> oh, no, it's not a separate room. This is a connected room. Never mind, he's a brokey. He's a brokey. Can't afford your own room? Imagine. A table lamp. Oh, no. I thought we were going to see our friend. An empty bed. Have you ever spent a night in a hospital? I... The time I ate glass, story time. Check the VODs. Um, I checked into the hospital at around... Um, Yeah. Wait. No. No, I'm thinking of a different time. The time I ate glass, I checked into the hospital around 4, and then I checked out at around 8, because I had to get x-rays done and shit, so it took a while. And then another time, I went to the hospital because I had, like, really sharp chest pains, and probably anxiety-related. This was about a uh, year and a half ago. And my mom was convinced I was having a heart attack, so... Because we have a possibly a history of early onset heart disease and stroke, so my mom was freaking out, so... I went to the ER. Wait, no, this was pre-pandemic. Shit. Never mind, I'm getting my timeline wrong. This was pre-pandemic. Um, so I went to the hospital at around 6, and then I checked out at midnight. Um... And I still had to go to work the next morning, and I had to be at work at 4. Um, but they concluded it was just anxiety, and which is what I told my mom, but you know, she doesn't believe anxiety is real. So, I didn't spend overnight at a hospital, but I almost did. But it's like, I never had anything severe enough to warrant an overnight stay. But it's... The, both the times I had to go to the ER, I had to go alone because my parents didn't want to stay with me. They were just like, oh, you know, you got to go by yourself. So they basically just dropped me off. So I had, like, no support. I had no, like, nobody with me. And it sucked. And this was back when you could have somebody wait, wait with you in the waiting room. And they were like, no, you can go by yourself. We'll go back home. And it's just like, okay. But, like, if something is wrong, you'd probably want somebody to, like, sign papers. But, it's whatever. It's okay. Oh, I can leave. That's why, like... I've had, like, my best friend, like, offer to go with me to, like, my recent medical appointments, but only, like, family can go or your partner. And you, you can get, like, you can ride off and have, like, a family friend go, but it's still, like hard to get that approved because like it's not like i want them in the room but like just like in the waiting room is nice sorry i don't know why i'm crying <laughs> I'm, no tears have fallen i'm fine can you lie and say y'all are dating we well, used to date <laughs> but yeah we could but then what they do ask if you bring like your boyfriend or your husband in especially the your male partners they will, they will ask you in private, are they abusing you? And I, I get very uncomfortable. Um. Because, um, I used to go to appointments with my sister. Because she doesn't know how to, like, fully communicate properly. So, they always ask you, the patient in private, oh, like, is this person, like, being nice to you? That type of thing. Are you here by choice? Um. Because often, like, abusive partners will force themselves to go with you to your appointments like whether it be like a partner like a like your domestic partner or like a, a marriage or your spouse sorry 
<sighs> yeah, they also have to ask you if your parents go with you too, and it just feels uncomfy. locked. Hey, it's my friends! The door is locked. And I think a reason why, like, that thing is specifically triggering, like, when they ask you, like, oh, is this person, like, bad? It, it just bothers me, because, like, I know that they're not bad. And it would just, like, it would hurt me to think that they would doubt it. But obviously, it's procedure, right? You have to ask those questions, but it still kind of, like, feels, makes me feel bad. That it's such commonplace. Oh, I don't want to see Basil. Ew. I want to hang out with my real friends. Thank you, Ken. Oh. I shouldn't leave yet. I have to confront my demons. Dude, hospitals are so difficult to navigate, though. Even if they have, like, directions in the elevator in the hallways, it's still confusing. Like, I remember when I was checking in, because this was my first time going to this general hospital, and they were checking me in, and then the person at the desk was like, Oh, okay, your appointment is on the third floor. What you're gonna do is take the elevator to the third floor, take three rights, and then a left. And I was like... Because everybody in front of me in line was like, Okay, and then they would just walk. I was like, wait, 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 I need to, like, actually write this down. <laughs> it's kind of like when you take directions from randos on the street. It's like, how do you not write it down? Do you have it memorized? No, so write it down. I don't know how people steal babies from hospitals. Anybody can walk into a hospital, and most anybody can walk out. So, it's kind of like, if you retrieve the child, it is very easy to escape with the child. Which is kind of scary. Not really. I mean, in my area. But both of the- any clinic I've gone to has been pretty... not secure. <laughs> Parents wear an alarm? Oh, I don't know. I, I don't have a kid, so I don't fucking know. You have to be buzzed into the room. What if they climb into the vents, like in the spy movies? <laughs> yeah, let's talk to Basil. Oh. Is Basil dead? Oh no, did I kill Basil? Uh oh. It's juvie time, baby! Oh. Why is everybody in Basil's room? Look at my little slippers! I have to tell you something.
Is this me, like, on the way to Juvie? Just jump cut to Omori Inju. <laughs> Is that their guilt going away? Thanks for playing. Hmm. What now, though? Did Sonny smile at himself in the mirror in the hospital room? I think you got the secret ending. Like a good ending? New menu screen? Badges. Reach the good ending. Oh, bye, Keelan. Man, there's- Oh, it's because I didn't do a lot of the side missions. Okay, chatters, do you guys want to watch, like, the endings on YouTube? Because we can do that. We can sit and watch them all. Because I, I kind of want to see him. Would you guys be down? Oh, give flowers to Mori. I did that. Okay, we'll do that. But before we do that, I'm a little bit late. For what, you may ask? An ad. Because we are seven hours into stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad-free viewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if your Prime is still available. Wait, I have to run the ad. Well, no. Okay, so let's do final thoughts. Um, this game was quite enjoyable. It's very similar to Undertale in the sense where you... You want to, like, enjoy what the game has to offer. In terms of, like, world building and, like, character design. It's really, like, charming. I think it's a bit long. I think my playtime is at around 35 hours. That's also because I'm playing on stream. Um, the little side quest did seem annoying. A little bit. Like, I know in the final few streams I did, I was like, I just want to get through. I want to get through. I want to 
finish the main story. Um, so my initial theory was correct. That Omori did kill Mari. Not intentional. We could say. I still... Basil and Omori are very close. Or Sunny are very close. And that was evident in the drawings that were in both um, Sunny's journal and then Amori's journal. And I think them keeping that secret made their friendship validated and stronger, even if they didn't talk. Like, you could see in the real world where um, Basil would see Sunny and he got very scared, right? But there's still, like, no explanation as to how the violin broke. And I don't know how it broke, because it was at the bottom of the stairs. They're pro I think, like, I still think Basil broke it. Because it was at the bottom of the stairs where Basil was. I don't know. But it's, it's obviously about escaping and not facing your problems, right? Which I think it's important to do. You gotta face your demons. But you have to do so in a safe space. Like, obviously, covering up an accidental death is way up there. <laughs> but the overall themes remain. Like, you have to be willing to rely on people. And then also... Be accepting that you may not be ready to face things. You have to have the safeguards in place to do so. Like, you can't force yourself to face everything at once. And I think you also need to surround yourself with, um, good people. I thought Sunny broke it because he got mad? I don't know. But what would have triggered that argument? Because, like, what, what I'm so kind of confused about is there's, like, in the little photo sequence where he's trying to find the photos that Basil took of them killing, I mean, hiding Myri's death, there was, like, sequences where she had, like, an IV. There's no real answer, but the, the, the more popular theory is that Sunny got mad and broke it. But why would he break something so precious to him? I mean, we'll probably find out when we look at the other endings. Because we can do that. When you're mad, you don't really care. I guess. I've never, like, felt that level of emotion. Oh my god, hi, Evelyn! Can we get some yos? Hi! Um, I've never, like, felt that amount of, like, anger or frustration. So, oh, my fun streamer, sorry. So, I don't know. Hmm. But it looked like Mari was wearing a dress. Like, it looked like she was wearing a hospital gown. Hmm. Okay, let's watch the other endings now. I'm gonna go. Okay, are- is- Are the endings, like, scary scary? Peace and love. Bye, Mac. I feel like there's one ending where Amori unalives himself. That has to be an ending. So, trigger warning. Okay, let me find... Let's change my category to just chatting. That way people don't know that I'm playing the game. Recap. Let's put trigger warning in the title. So trigger warning, watching all the endings. You've been lurking this whole time? Don't worry about it, we love lurkers. Okay, but I have to... Okay, so now that we beat Amori finally, after two months, I mean three months, 
Um, there will be a new game slot for Wednesday for the story game. So if you guys have any suggestions for other like more mid-range story games like this, it could be Pixel. It could be like kind of horror. I kind of want something more wholesome. Um, but yeah, tell me. Put suggestions in the chat over the next few weeks. I will buy a new game for the Wednesday time slot. Okay, so. The unpacking game? I already played that on stream. It's on my VOD channel. But thank you for the suggestion. Okay, I have my audio connected. Spirit Fair. Okay. Let me... I will write that down, actually. I'll keep notes. Because the thing I have to keep in mind, I wanted to fill at least a month worth of stream. So about 12 to 20 hours worth of gameplay. So Spirit Fair. S-P-I-R-I-T-F-A-E. Spirit Fair. Thank you, Evelyn. Okay, let's find video. Okay. Let me... Good to time. Yep. I want to see you play Little Nightmares. I don't... I've seen, like, full playthroughs of Little Nightmares, and I, I only want to do blind playthroughs for, like, the story games, because I feel like you get full effect for that, right? But... I... Is it bad that I don't like Little Nightmares? I feel like it's kind of boring. I don't like platformers, that's why. Okay, so... Mori All Endings. Okay, so all cutscenes. How long is this? Hmm. Bad ending. <gasps> wait, Charlie did a video on it? <laughs> Omori, wait, did I get the real ending? Oh, uh, trigger warning. Okay, let's look at the cutscene one. Yeah, I don't know what this is. <laughs> okay, I don't... Okay, are there timestamps? I wanna... Bro, I hate when people don't put freaking timestamps. Just put a timestamp. Ugh. Okay, we're just gonna- it's only 11 minutes! It's only 11 minutes. Why did it not default to HD? Okay. No matter what happens. Promise me that we'll always be there for each other. Isn't this like the opening cutscene? Yeah, this is the opening cutscene. The title is Amori All Endings All Cutscenes. Promise me. Can you guys hear it okay? I think it's at a decent level. At that time, I saw everything. Ooh, was that leaked in the start of the game? When you stood here before? Did you see it too? The guilt, the ghost, our little friend. Something behind you.
There weren't that many cutscenes in game now that I think about it. Okay, so these are the final cutscenes. Oh, that was the thing I missed. Wait, I, I need to go back. Okay, so it's the keyhole into the white space. So is the white space kind of like the toy box? Where he just doesn't want to face it. Like face the actual reality. Oh, back to reality. Okay, and then this is when we're fighting. I, th I think I was supposed to lose in that fight. Imagine if Amori was just like, Chuk! he's like, your little swan song didn't work on me. <laughs> Wait, is that an ending? Hashtag spoilers. Wait, is it actually? Oh, so is that? Because I apparently have the good ending. So it's probably the bad ending. Where I just feed myself, keep feeding myself the delusion. They're honestly adorable though, so cute. Th this scene right here was cute. Not gonna lie, I wish I was the younger sibling. Stuffed animal looks like the little sprout people. Sprout mole? Oh, 
Oh, is he drowning because he's drowning in guilt? Wait, something DC'd. Oh, it's my video game catcher card, okay. This is weird to see, like, them fully animated, though, because usually it would just be stills throughout the whole game. I almost cried on stream when that cutscene played with the orchids. It reminded me of Snow White a little bit. Okay, this video was a scam. It literally just shows the good ending. Okay, that's stupid. Let me find a different video. Because that, that literally didn't show the other endings. It just showed the good ending. That was dumb. Okay, I guess we gotta... Um... Trigger warning. Okay, this one does it have timestamps. It does not have timestamps. Oh wait, the oh okay, okay, okay. Trigger warning. Trigger warning. So apparently, these are the endings you can get. There is neutral ending variation one, something ending. Um, neutral ending variation two, knife or unaliving ending. True route, bad ending. True route, good ending, which is what I got. Um, true route, good ending. Directly to the recital, scene to ending. And then secret ending, secret scene. Hmm. What time is the sub-only stream? Probably normal, 11 o'clock. Okay, well... We aren't gonna sit through this whole video. One point two five speed or speed running. Oh wait, I can talk to them when they were sleeping. Okay, Kel has always been there for you, and even though he's a bit careless, it okay, normal speed. I can't read that fast. <laughs> You'll really miss him. Aubrey has always acted true to her feelings. Even though she has trouble admitting how much she cares, her actions don't show that. She always had, she's always been a little hard to understand, but you can trust that she'll always try her best to do the right thing. You'll really miss her. A very comfortable bed. Would you like to go to sleep? Oh! I could have gone to sleep there? Oh! Okay, so if I would have gone to sleep, I wouldn't have fought Basil then. Oh shit! Okay, okay. Oh, cause then, then I wouldn't have been properly facing my demons. I would have just gone back to sleep. Oh, okay. Please, Sunny. You shouldn't be seeing this. You're supposed to be moving out today. On your way to a fresh new start. We'll take care of everything here. Go on ahead. We'll be okay. I think. Why Basil? Why did you do it? Sonny, why does this keep happening to us? I'm 
so sorry, Basil. Please forgive me. I'm so sorry. Oh, same shit. Oh, oh, our little friend is there. Uh-oh. See, that, that's what happens when you don't face your demons. They follow you. Do you want to look in Basil's room? Yes. But this is when I fall asleep, so this isn't real. So in the dream, Basil's already trapped. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. Wait, in my Twitch shadow, does it say Amori endings? <laughs> all the Amori endings. I just put all the endings. That's so dumb. <laughs> Oopsie. Now people have context if they're just clicking in. I'm going back home. You shouldn't disturb the others this late at night. Oh, she went in the bedroom. A very comfortable bed. Would you like to go to sleep? Wait, so I went to sleep at Basil's house and I went home in the dream and fell asleep. Oh wait, I need to turn my screen brightness up, like, actually. Okay, at 50% brightness now. Welcome to white space. Wait, I could have gone back? You've been living here for as long as you can remember. Oh, and I just murk myself? Oh, there's another door. That's dumb. <laughs> Pointless. Where do I wake up? Back at home. Wait, which ending was this? This was neutral ending. Wait, wait. that's the moving person. May you live a long and happy life. Oh, that's weird. For a mover to say. Goodbye. 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 There's flower on the kitchen countertop. Flowers. Oh, never mind. That's breakfast from the day before. It looked like flowers. Your mom is waiting for you outside. What kind of future awaits you, I wonder? My friend isn't there. Oh. 
Oh, because we're carrying the guilt still. Damn. Mom's car is waiting for you. Oh, we don't even get to say goodbye. Damn. Where are there sirens, though? Did I still, like, merc Basil? Because the fight didn't happen in this scenario. Or maybe I... Huh. Because, okay, when I fell asleep in the sleepy bag, like, all my friends were upstairs, it seemed like they were gonna kill Basil. So they were like, oh, we're gonna make all your troubles go away. Ta-da. So, I think in this one, they just killed Basil. Uh, by they, I mean Aubrey, Kel, and what's-his-face? Hero. Huh. Okay, so let's skip ahead a little bit. Ew, it's it's do you want to know no no don't don't leak don't leak i am thinking out loud when i ask questions i think out loud it's rhetorical oh there's no badges oh so that's just the end uh, that was very weird okay so in this one i still fell asleep in the sleeping bag Wait, Polly, why? Why am I so useless? Please, Sonny. We shouldn't be seeing this. You're supposed to be moving out today. Getting a fresh new start. We'll take care of everything. Go on ahead. We'll be okay, I think. Okay, trigger warning. This is the one that has the unaliving in it. Why, Basil, did you do this? Yeah, so in this dream, they know that Basil helped cover up, at least. No, I, I did beat the game. I had the good ending, somehow. I have no idea how I got the good ending. Uh, right now, we're just watching all the alternate endings on YouTube. Smile. So, I did beat the game. I had the good ending. Do you want to look into Basil's room? There's nothing here. Oh, his room disappeared. Because this is still like the dream state. <laughs> Just checking if we can murk yourself now in the street. Oof. Bro. Yeah, that's a bloody Mari, I think. Can we kill Mari again? Oh, there- There's growth above the bed, like her hair. Oh, it's the ceiling fan. Okay. I didn't catch that the first time.
Welcome to White Space. Okay, I'm gonna skip this. Okay, same thing, you unalive. Sudoku. Because there's nothing left in this world now. Oh, because in this alternate ending, we grab the knife. Oh. If it happens in game, it happens in real life. I mean, he's bleeding on the same bed that Mari laid on. True route, bad ending. Dude, I do not like this dubstep remix. It's horrible. you choosing to fall asleep in the sleeping bag and then not because I didn't fall asleep in the sleeping bag at all I just went straight to Basil's room and didn't go to sleep then I beat the shit out of Basil Yeah, the same thing. I couldn't heal. It says game over. Wait, do you want to continue? Oh no, okay. But I didn't give up. Well, the only reason why I would have pressed no is if I could have gone to like a save point and gotten heals, but there's no heal mechanic in this fight, so it would have made no sense to not keep it trying. Welcome to White Space. Back here. Just 
So this is why we just fully give into our delusion. Oh. No! It's a long way down. Do you want the jump? Yes. Close your eyes. You'll New OP? Be here soon. It's your knees and she Why does it sound so happy? going to his happy place, his delusions, or his, his dream world, so it, theme-wise it makes sense, it's just off-putting. Holy, dude, this OP bangs! <laughs> I wish I had this ending, that's crazy. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. How tall is this hospital? Slash J slash SRS. It was not spinning. Achievement unlocked. Close your eyes. Oh, and he's not. Ooh. He's not in the main menu screen. Ooh. Awkward. Okay. Okay, true route good ending with a Mori full fight. No, please, extra scene after credits can only be seen if you water Basil's garden at the dream world. Okay, so this is the ending I got. Okay, let's see what done is an end. Um, 33. Okay, so this is what we played on stream. We did the fight. Game over. And then we came back. And then this cutscene. Oh, well, this is still the true ending. I misread the time. Cause see, like the time codes right here. True route, good ending, directly to the Renaissance ritual scene to ending, and the secret ending, ending scene. Okay, so what timestamp? <laughs> Thirty-three seventeen, right here, and then forty-two. Wait, I had the best ending? No way. 
I wasn't even trying to get the best ending. Okay, so the main differentiating factor to get that little cutscene at the end where it has a Mori and Basil in the hospital is watering the plants. Which I did. You're too good? Yeah, I actually did a playthrough properly. <laughs> Damn. Guys, am I am I a real gamer? Am I a gamer? Okay, so basically the main factors between the good ending and the bad endings is falling asleep at the sleepover. You're not supposed to fall asleep. You're supposed to beat the shit out of Basil. And then Yeah, that's it. Yeah, face your demons, everybody. Don't shy away from your problems. You gotta face them at some point. But do so when you're ready and strong enough. But dude, that was crazy. I didn't think I would do a good route. There's a different route you can do too. Yeah, the person in the comments pin said that there's other routes you can take too. But yeah. Hmm. I got the good ending. I'm just happy to hear that, honestly. I'm very happy. Okay, everybody. We, we, we've been live for a long time today. We beat the game. Finally. Finally. We also got to see the alternate endings. I'm very proud that I had a good ending. I had the true ending. I'm very happy. Um, so what we are going to do now is a fan favorite segment of stream. Uh, which music should we do? Let's do something happy because that game was kind of sad. Let's do Wii Fit music. So, if you donate to the channel or use your channel points, I will write your name. We are going to do calligraphy, everybody. We had a lot of uh, subs today, so we have a lot of names to write. Because we had a hype train. Shoutouts to the Oilers. So, as I'm getting that second camera set up, let's run an ad. Because we're basically at 8 hours of time. So you can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or... You can link Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe. See if you have a Prime available. That's the deepest game I've ever seen. Nah, I think Minecraft goes crazy. <laughs> well, I'm so glad we beat this game finally. By we, I mean me. With no help or assistance. Smile. Okay, let's, let's get to it. Okay, I'm gonna change... The leaderboard to daily that way i don't miss any subs okay chatters don't freak out also thank you for all the new followers today okay i'm changing the leaderboard to daily minecraft stream i ain't never playing freaking minecraft minecraft is for babies Chatter's new pin message. Go follow my Twitter. Please. I do funny haha -ha tweets and go live tweets because I know Twitch notifications can be kind of funny. Ooh, Resident Evil. I'm watching my friend play the Resident 4 remake in Discord calls on the weekends because they work every day. So yeah, I would play Resident Evil, but it's not my type of game. Just watching gameplay of all the different Iterations of it is not my type of game. I would be so bad. I'd be horrible. Oh my god. What is this? Are these portrait cards? Ain't no way. If you get five subs to the channel by Friday, by the end of the month, you will get a custom portrait card drawn on stream. Something like this. Right now we have... I think five people eligible for a sketch card this month. Ain't no way. So let's go. Okay. So you can use your channel points, and I will write your name as well, if you're bro <laughs> well, Let's do Euler names first, everybody. I don't want to fun. Now, okay, I need, we need to think of what we're going to play next week for the Wednesday time slot, everybody. Get to work. That is your homework for the weekend. Figure out what game to play.
Okay, so I need... Jesus Christ, Cobalt will gifted 17 subs. Wait, that's my favorite number. It's actually kind of cute. Okay, so I need purple, blue, green, green. 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 Thank you for redeeming, Chris. Purple, blue, green, green. Oh, wait, rainbow! Hacker's the only one who's not good at rainbow names. Today. If you gift more than five subs in a stream, you get rainbow. I almost forgot. No one reminded me. Shame on you all. Okay, let's do Hacker first. Has Hacker ever gotten a sketch card? No. And I feel bad, because, like, there was one month where Hacker gifted, like, four, and they were so close. I ended up getting suspended from school. Don't leak. Don't leak. But hopefully, it works out. And don't do that shit again if you get suspended. One and done. No more. I hope you're okay. I got grounded and now I'm on my breaker phone. <laughs> Sorry. It's not funny. Is it like your side bitch phone? Like how I have two phones? Sorry, I I hope everything's okay, Chris. Don't share because you shouldn't leak. Um, FBI is watching. But hope you're safe. Hope you're okay. But seriously, don't do that shit again. It's on your permanent record. You can't have two strikes. Um, I would say don't share. I would say don't share. Because mainly for your own privacy and... That, that's the main reason why. Because you don't know what information is public. You don't want to, You don't know what videos are online. If it is like a documented event. And you don't want to leak your identity, right? Because even if it's in a Twitch chat, there's some freaking crazies online. So, I would say don't. Okay, we had Hacker with one gift to the chat room. Thank you, Hacker. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> yeah, don't go to the principal's office ever again. You'll get banned from the chat if we hear about this shit. Um, Chatters, clip the stream. If you make the best clips, you get VIP. Ain't no way. You only got two days left to clip, everybody. And you can also clip VODs. If you're a VOD watcher watching the stream, you can clip VODs too. Dude, <laughs> I was looking at the clips the other day, and Wolf? Wolf can't watch stream often because they're in school. Cringe. Um, but they titled a clip. Um, uh, what was it? Wait, I need to look it up later. It was the best clip of the weekend. It had like 15 views. But it was like, peace and let's go, or peace and oh no! And it was me, like, <laughs> getting last in a Mario Kart race, and it was so funny. Because <laughs> I was just like, oh no! And that was the whole clip. It was a really good title. Shoutouts, Wolf. Hi, if you're watching the VOD. We like the clippers. I 
No, but seriously, chatters, um... Flipping the stream helps out a lot. It's good for, like, new viewers to get a good idea of, like, the top clips of the day. I think it was Tina who said they watched, like, the top viewed clip and they were like, Oh, I knew you were gonna be funny right away. Yeah, you guys are queer. Why is that my top clip? It's so unfair. It's so bad. I can't be praising the clippers too much, because honestly, it's me that says the funny shit. You guys just clip it. So yes, you do some of the work, but it's mainly me being entertaining. Okay, made Kim with five gifted today. Making her eligible for a sketch card. No, don't tell me this pen is dead. It's not, thank god. When are you doing sketch cards? Maybe April 2nd, maybe April 3rd. Depends. Because I'm planning on doing a long sub only tomorrow. One off game Friday, if I feel up for it. Like if I'm not tired. Um, April full stream. And then Sunday, Monday. Maybe we'll do sketch cards. Because I have an appointment on April 4th, Tuesday, so. Yeah, so pictures, I need them by Saturday. Saturday at the latest. I'll post on Twitter and tag everyone again. If I don't get them in time. Hey, okay, thank you, Kim, for the five gifted. I hope the sketch girl comes out good. Dude, Evelyn coming in with the suggestions. New chatter, we love this. Thank you. Genuinely, thank you, Evelyn. Because, like, it's hard for me to, like, like, research games and not get spoiled. You know what I mean? Um, so, Dash of Dark. Oh, wait, Night of the Woods. Wait, I've seen that. Shit. I watched JSE play it. But if you want straight up warm goodbye, start with with some slight tears. I vote. Oh, yeah, I've I've watched somebody play Night of the Woods, so I can't have that on the list. Sad, but thank you. <clears throat> oh, I did see. GAC play like a short one off like 4S pixel game the other day. I saw the video on my feed I was like, oh, I can play that for stream so I'm not gonna watch this video. I forgot the name. I screenshotted it though. This is the hula hoop music, I think. Yeah, I love Life is Strange. It's got like way too like cringe and predictable, but it's still like feel good. Oh wait, I should change the title. Calligraphy everybody, we're not watching a Mori. I keep forgetting. I'm not on my group today. Um, everybody, if you could click the uh, piece and art in the ch in the title. You can follow my art channel. We do calligraphy and painting sometimes. Go follow my art channel. Smile. 
Yeah, we've well, had a lot of good new chatters recently. I mean, new year, new me, right? But what's chat? It's very 2013 Tumblr, but if you're around for that era, it's kind of slay and embarrassing nostalgia way. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> so good. Donut Country? Okay, I'll look that up. Thank you, Water. Because, like, I was able to buy some shorter one-off games through the Nintendo eShop because they were on sale. But they're, like, only three hours long. So it'll probably take, like, five hours for stream, but I need, like, a game that'll cover like 12 to 20 hours. What a game that I do have, let's see if I actually have it. Damn, I miss Kirby. Oh, oh, oh here it is. One shot? Okay, cool. I will write that down as well. I have this. Oh, that's really close. Do you think I will be good at this game? This is Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. I was debating if I wanted to play this for stream. Would it be good? Peace and Plays a Zelda game? Yeah, wouldn't that be crazy? Thoughts? I'm pretty sure it's simple. <laughs> I mean, it's like the most baby-looking Zelda game. So maybe, maybe that can become a Wednesday time slot, that way we don't have to buy a new game. Because I bought this on sale for like 15 bucks. It's not difficult. We love that. We love that. <laughs> we love easy games. Oh, wait, I need to write down one shot. Can somebody look up how long this game is for me really quick? If you want to, I don't care. If not, I don't, I don't care. If you're a real fan, you're not good at an easy game, though? I am cracked a Mario Kart. I will not let you slander me. Once again... Thank you, Keelan, for the six gifted and a hundred bits. Thank you. Wait, Keelan went to sleep. Awkward. Ooh, the animation is very Tim Burton-esque. Ooh, we love that. Dude, Evelyn is coming in clutch. Evelyn is my new favorite chatter. Lost in the random. Lost, like the TV show? It says 14 hours. Okay, 14 hours is not bad, so it'll probably take me 30, let's be honest. Okay, so this is like a good game we can get done in like a month of streams. Not bad. <laughs> lemon in shambles? Mod lemon, everybody. Okay, when I say blank is my favorite chatter, I say it like how parents say, oh, I don't have a favorite, but I do. No, that's not what I meant. Shit. I mean, like, all my chatters are my favorite. <laughs> I don't think I've ever said Crystal is my favorite chatter. <laughs> I, don't, I think I've literally never said that. <laughs> You're literally lying. Okay, last time I lied right now when I said everybody is my favorite chatter. You're so bad at lying. No, I'm not. I'm actually really good. You haven't? <laughs> no, you just meant I'm your favorite, okay? Exactly. See, Evelyn gets it. You have made it clear you hate me. I mean, Crystal, how many times have you gotten banned and timed out between my two channels? I think it's obvious. 
Mac is the fave? You know, Mac is like old reliable. Mac is like pretty consistent. Mac is pretty good. Mac is pretty good. The truth comes out. No, because like every every chatter who's a regular has a different dynamic in which they chat. I think the most entertaining, most entertaining chatter right now is Kim. Kim is pretty solid. Best emote chatter, Betty and Vora. But Betty is slightly better than Vora. It takes two. No, I hate puzzles. Because, like, I'll watch people play It Takes Two, and it makes me mad. But thank you. I'm, I'm not going to play that. No. And I don't have any friends. Or I don't have any friends that would, like, want to be on stream. No, I think Wub is closer to your age, Crystal. Because Mac is 21. Shadows, don't leak your actual age. You can say you're in school, but do not leak your age. I like everyone here. Dude, now you're sounding like just like me. <laughs> That's cheating. Cool Bobo's good because they type Lomel throughout the whole stream and it's really funny to me. Because what keeps chat alive is both bantering with me in between individual chatters and then reacting in chat. So like using emotes, typing LOMEL or W, that keeps chat moving. So Kobobo is, I think, the glue that keeps everything together. What would you do if there was chatter, drama, or fight? You guys play banter all the time, and I do get worried somebody's gonna go home and cry. Um, you praise others for things I do? But, Crystal, you are more so a menace. Kobobo is cohesively good. <laughs> Stop it. Crystal was just trying to bait me into complimenting them, and I see what you're doing. You're being manipulative, and I don't appreciate that. Have you been reading How to Gaslight the book? <laughs> but they both get timed out? Probably, yeah. It's kind of like how in school, if you punch somebody, you both get suspended if you get in a fight. I'm just dying for attention? Obviously, I'm not clueless. He made Cole Bobo with 17 gifted today. Holy moly, that's insane. That was a joke. I do not think you guys are ready for the April Fool stream. It's gonna go crazy. I have the best bit planned and none of y'all can guess what it is. A million subs and I will, I will leak what the bit is now. Speaking, beefing with people on Twitter, y'all don't do it. Yeah, I think um, debating randos on Twitter is pointless because they don't give a shit, so why should you give a shit? What's the plan for the birthday stream? I actually have everything planned out. I'm not gonna leak what it is. Unless I get two million gifted right now. <laughs> Here we had Kobobo with 17 gifted. Thank you, Kobobo. Thank you. That's a lot of money, so thank you. That money will go towards the birthday stream. Now I can buy two cakes. No, probably not even. Because 17 subs is... 
I can buy half a cake. An extra half a cake. I thank you everybody who donated today. Thank you for getting me to a level 6 hype train. Once again, the hype trains are all of your guys' work, so it's not me doing all the hard work. All I do is show. Okay, final two names, everybody. Obsess over your comment sections? That is a problem, Kobobo, and you should stop. You should stop. <laughs> Why, did I get some... Because I post my TikTok clips, my IG reels, and TikTok video or Twitter videos before I go live. But then for my YouTube shorts, because most of my subscribers are active from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m., I post my shorts when I'm live, so I can't look at the comments until after I end stream. So the comments have been public for seven hours now. So hopefully they're not crazy. It's interesting to see which clips get comments. Dude, me, literally same. Because, like, some clips will pop off on TikTok and then flop on YouTube Shorts and then the opposite. But I have one person who regularly comments on most of my TikToks or most of my YouTube Shorts and they make me feel nice because they're always super wholesome and cute. Because I, I feel like a lot of YouTube comments in specific in particular are really shitty so whenever I get like really nice YouTube comments I feel really good so I'm like oh people are nice I've seen that person so much yeah aren't they so cute they're so nice Okay, everybody, last name. Last name, everybody. Yeah, they did say they can't watch stream. That was, like, one of the first comments they ever left. They're like, hey, I can't watch the stream, but I'll, like, watch all the clips you post. And it's like, oh, so cute. There we go. Any other redeemers? Last call, everybody. Last call. If you want me to redeem, all you gotta do is donate to the channel or use your channel points. Last call. I feel like I had my... Oh! I dropped a pen. I used my more gravelly voice today. Green? Okay. last call you guys have five four three do the goofiest song two one and we're done all the streams this week have been a huge w it's because people are, are on spring break so we have more viewers so therefore more chatters more unique viewers so not that i do better when we have more viewers but when we have more chatters stream is so much better because when you have different personalities interacting with each other there's different dynamics right like i feel like whenever crystal's in chat it's gonna be a fun time right because crystal is like the nice chaotic energy and whenever we have i think kimari is another one that stands up because they don't type often but sometimes they're either like really wholesome or they'll say something so obscure <laughs> and it seems so weird <laughs> it's good 
This is the first time she's complimented me? No! Jeez, calm down. I'm not a hater. I swear to god, Crystal is gonna become a hate watcher one day. I swear to god. Quote me on this. In the eight months I've been here... Well, you always lurk. You never... You're like, hey, hi, actually, I have to go. I need Luigi back? Yeah, I miss Luigi too. We haven't seen them since, like, Christmas, and I feel bad. I hope they're okay. Okay, everybody, we're gonna end stream here. Because of school, um, just go to college already. Easy. Okay. I would like to thank everybody for watching. Any chatter suckers? Once again, thank you to Keelan, Kobobo, Hacker, Kim, and Kobobo for donating to the channel today. I love you, Miss J. Butler. I miss them too. I feel weird because, like, even if somebody types once, I usually remember them. And I'm just like, if somebody doesn't chat for a while, I'm like, I hope they're okay. Because either they think I'm not fun anymore, they don't watch, or they, like, have shit going on. Yeah, Kingly was a good chatter, too. They only chatted for, like, a month, and we haven't seen him. Good chat. See, it's so cute how you guys, like, remember them. It's a cute. It's cute. It's cute. Okay, everybody, I'm ending stream. I'm ending stream. I need to go eat dinner. So, I will be live. Hopefully tomorrow. Plan. Dude, not you screenshotting chat messages. You're actually- Dude, I hate zoomers. I hate zoomers. Okay, plan. The plan is simple, everybody. Um, I will- Hopefully my goal. My goal. Is. I have a screenshot of the first time you wrote my name. Dude, actual simp. Actual simp. Oh my god. Dude, my top gifter being a simp. Oh no. <laughs> Okay, okay. Okay. Plan. I will do a subscriber-only stream, probably tomorrow, where we will do Stardew Valley and then testing out Mario Kart team modes. And then Friday, if I have the energy for it, I will do a one-off game, like normal. Saturday. April Fool's stream, big stream, don't miss it, Saturday. Probably at 11, for all these streams, 11 a.m. as normal. Big stream, April Fool's, don't miss it. Um, portrait sketch cards. For anybody who gifted during the month of March, will be done probably um, Sunday, Monday, or maybe Tuesday afternoon, depending. It all depends on like my energy levels, right? So that is the plan. So since, in my head, my head, okay, since I did more stream hours this week, then next week we'll have less hours. Okay. I had fun today. We beat Amori finally. And I got the good ending. Ain't that crazy? Ain't no way. <laughs> so, chatters, I'll see you when I see you probably tomorrow. So if you don't want to miss a single stream, follow the channel. We got four followers today. Ain't no way. That's crazy. I think it's because we played Amori the final section. And that's fine. You'll be on vacation? Ooh, fun. I wish I could go on vacation. But I'm disabled. Meaning it'd be very difficult. Anyway, chatters, I'll see you guys when I see you. Make sure your notifications turn on. That way you don't miss a single stream. And follow my Twitter. It is pinned in the chat room. I usually do go live tweets that way. You can get into chat right away and I will say your name. Okay, I'll see you guys later. Oh, last thing. It's tagged in the title, but please follow my art channel. It is peacein underscore art on Twitch. I also linked it in the chat. Go follow it, please. I will be launching the website to start selling paintings soon in the best way to support. Oh, I try to shout out my own channel, Omega Lol. Um, the best way to support is just follow the social media, follow the Twitter, follow the Instagram, follow the Twitch channel. That'd be great. Okay, I'll see you guys later. Bye bye. Bye bye. I'm so fucking tired. Freaking, I can't curse. Oh, wow. <laughs> bye, Evelyn. Thank you once again. You gave so many game suggestions. Thank you, Evelyn. Putting the stress off of me. Bye, Water. Thank you, Water, for hanging out today. It's not often we see you, but glad to see you, Water. Dude, I have a headache. It's because I'm hungry. I am so excited for dinner, though. <laughs> I made pork, and it's made with coconut milk and um, curry paste, and it's so good. 
have some good food. Yay, this is gonna be so good. Because I, I personally don't like fat on my meat, so I spent like almost an hour trimming off all of the fat on the pork. That way when I eat it, I can just guzzle it down. And not have to get any... Worry about getting any chewy, fatty bits. That's also why I like eating alone, because I feel like I eat too quickly. <laughs> Or I take too big of bites. Dude, my sister, she takes way too big of bites when she eats her food. It's actually, like, frustrating. Like, she'll take a bite that's worth, like, three bites sometimes. And I just look at her and I'm like, oh my god. You need to stop. Oh wait, I should end stream. Bye. I was like texting my friend. I was like, <laughs> okay, bye guys. Imagine I just left the stream on. Psych.